American Comics. Invincible starting with Lord of the Shadow Kingdom. Chapter 31. The absorbing person looked disdainful. Zuhua. From the moment you provide me with energy, all this is over. This energy is really pure. Stupid guy, this is my biggest whole card. In this world, there is no way to restrain me at all, unless I seek death myself and use infinite energy to support myself to death. So what if you have super abilities? Fang Quan clicked his tongue and folded his hands on his shoulders, kneel down. The absorber laughed loudly, and with a wave of his hand, a terrifying dark wave went upstream, tearing apart the giant dark hand in the sky, and countless flying shadow soldiers turned into black aura and evaporated, mutant, you don't understand the relationship between us at all. I am immortal. Now, I will let you see the huge amounts of. Ah, my legs, my legs, why did you kneel down? Quote, Absorber looked arrogant, but his body knelt down on the ground very honestly, kneeling in a very standard posture. His face was shocked and puzzled, and the arrogance he had just now still remained, but his knees were extraordinarily straight, and his kneeling posture was also very standard, presenting an extremely contradictory and beautiful picture. Fang Quan stretched out his hand, absorbed the body like a good baby, ran over quickly, and then knelt at Fang Quan's feet, with an appearance of absolute loyalty. The absorber looked crazy and shouted in horror, No! Why does my body listen to you? This is my body, this is not yours. Give it back, give me back my body. He couldn't understand why his body wasn't his own. Fang Quan stroked his head, felt this dark body, and was a little surprised. Your body is interesting, but it's a pity that you are too weak to perform to your full potential. This guy seems to be invincible, but in fact, the conversion efficiency, absorption efficiency, and upper limit of endurance are all limited, and he is not as crazy as he said. He didn't even have to do it himself, just two more bombings from the Flying Shadow Legion would have killed him alive. Definitely, this guy is at least half a natural disaster player when released, but his Flying Shadow Legion, ordinary enemies really can't bear it. Absorbing people is crazy, how can such an unruly body become the opponent's plaything? It was the light wave just now. I shouldn't be absorbing these energies. Fang Quan looked at the absorbing person in front of him with constantly changing expressions, and clicked his tongue, you are also interesting, you can hang out with me from now on. Absorbing people were furious. I am a dignified David Banner. I have never bowed my head in my life. Even if I die, I will die standing up. Fang Quan didn't bother to pay attention to his yelling, and snapped his fingers, Boss Guiying, he will be in charge of you from now on, give him good exercise, look at the children who are hungry, they will all get fat. The leader, Ghost Shadow, took the lead, turned around and sent a thought wave to the absorber. It attracts people to yell and curse, but the body follows up very honestly, it is even more precise and elegant than a robot with absolute control. Fang Quan solved one problem, he was in a happy mood, and started to draw the lottery directly. Congratulations to the host for extracting the chicken charm. Chicken charm. Active. The host gains flight ability. Passive. The host gains energy control ability. Fang Quan laughed loudly. Not bad. With the chicken charm, I finally have flight ability, and I no longer have to be afraid of air combat. Energy control ability. Fang Quan felt it carefully, and found that his ability to control external energy had greatly improved. Ha, huh, doesn't the ability of the chicken spell control objects to float? Fang Quan felt it carefully, only to find that when he used his ability, the chicken charm and the dragon charm glowed together. The powerful magical ability brought by the dragon spell, combined with the object control of the chicken spell, is the energy control ability. Not bad not bad, very good ability. Fang Quan was very satisfied with his recent gains. In just two days, he gained control of a legion, and there were so many spells, enough for him to digest for a while. Fang Quan tested the chicken charm, and with just one thought, his body sped up like the flash, while everything around him slowed down. Fang Quan raised his eyebrows, feeling amused, he took a single step, and was a hundred meters away, as if teleporting. Fang Quan smiled, took two steps, and returned to the hall of the villa. Wow, are you moving in space? Tony was taken aback, Fang Quan appeared in front of him in the blink of an eye. Nick Fury swallowed, feeling that Fang Quan's strength had increased explosively after each battle. Does the Dark King wake up his energy by fighting? Or is it because he likes to fight that he awakens his power? 
Ross put down his daughter, his face frightened. No, you can't take David away, he will be responsible for the 60,000 soldiers who died. Fang Quan turned around and saw that it was General Ross, he chuckled and said, give me some face, let's leave it at that. Rose knew that the hope was slim, but he still stood up unswervingly, with his back straight, King Fang, this is the blood feud of 60,000 broken families. He will not die, and Eagle Kingdom's revenge against him will not end. Fang Quan smiled kindly, this is not a discussion, but a notice. Rose was choked, his pale face was flushed with anger, his hands were tightly clenched, his nails pierced deeply into his palms, and streams of blood flowed down his fingers. He looked at the mighty and invincible Fang Quan, his eyes were so bloodshot that he seemed to be drinking fresh blood. The white-haired general let out a heart-piercing roar, and slammed his fist on the ground, blood and tears streaming down his face, I, Ross, I'm sorry. More than 60,000 soldiers died in vain. The enemy is right in front of him, but he has nothing to do. Fang Quan stretched his waist, not bothering to pay attention to the old general's heartfelt blood rage, he slapped him and walked towards the back garden. Tony watched all this and shook his head, not knowing what to say. This matter is too bad to talk about. Connivance is David Banner, the demon who killed 60,000 people, and there are also shocking and speechless things. Who would have thought that this David Banner would have been Ross's best cellular super immune ability expert, and even a great scientist who contributed to the country and the people? Nick Fury looked at the bloody general in front of him and fell silent. Perhaps, I need to be more proactive and look for hope of breaking the game. This Dark King may not be reliable. I need to find that ancient one magician, that blue star Asgardian. Blood and tears flowed down Rose, and he stood up slowly, as if he had aged a dozen years. He raised his hand tremblingly and saluted in the direction of the fallen soldiers. Soldiers, I'm sorry for you, but I will definitely take the blood of the enemy. Blade, revenge for you. He made a blood oath, raised his hand to wipe away the blood and tears, and left the villa straight away. The ghost soldiers around were as indifferent as their king, they didn't pay any attention to this non-threatening mortal, and continued to do what they should do. Nick Fury was silent for a while, and asked seriously in the direction of the back garden, Mr. Fang, where is the ancient one magician? Fang Quan's laughter came from the direction of the back garden. Interesting, are you looking for ancient one? Nick Fury could only hear a burst of hearty joy from the laughter, and he bit the bullet and asked, please tell me the address. Ha ha, okay, go, ancient one is here. A note flew out from the direction of the back garden, floating in front of Nick Fury. Nick Fury took it with great care, then bowed deeply, and led the agents out of the villa quickly. Tony was a little confused, and shouted towards the back garden, hey, Fang Magician, why did you give the address? This Nick Fury obviously had an idea, and dared to take the risk of asking this topic. Fang Quan's voice was ethereal and indifferent, do you think I need to care about the thoughts of ants? Hey, what kind of trouble can a group of ants cause? Tony was taken aback, then laughed dumbfounded. For an immortal king of darkness, the thoughts of short-lived species seem very shallow and boring. After Tony laughed, there was a look of deep thought on his face, which was what his position was. Rose's cry of blood and tears lingered in his ears. Is my mission to be the one who snaps my fingers, or is it Fang Quan's backup tool? Tony turned around, ready to go to the training ground, and asked David Banner himself to learn about the past stories. The end of the world, I want to stop it. National justice, I also want to defend. I have received Fang Quan's great kindness, but I also have my justice to show. When Tony walked to the training ground, he saw Banner, who was sober, trying to persuade the absorber David. An ice pack was stuck on Banner's smooth forehead, and he tried to persuade his father bitterly, Dad, stop, what's the use of breaking free now? In the entire Eagle Country, only here is safe. Absorber David's expression was dissatisfied. My such powerful strength is the guarantee of safety. Banner sighed. Dad, it has been more than 50 years since you took over the Super Soldier Project. Do you really think that the military has achieved nothing except you? If they continue to fight head to head, the military will definitely take out restrained genetic weapons and spend all their money to wipe out their father and son. They have only become stronger, but they are still carbon-based creatures. Carbon-based organisms must have weaknesses, not invincibility. 
unless they can be strong enough to lead a dark empire like the Dark King Fang Quan, who is immortal and immortal. The resentment on the face of the Absorber David calmed down a lot. He is indeed not invincible. If he bears more than the upper limit of energy, he will enter a state of self-explosion out of control. Banner looked at his darkened father with complicated eyes, and opened his mouth slightly, Dad, how have you been all these years? Absorber David's eye circles were red, and the dark energy on his body began to fade. He took the initiative to release the energy, and his voice suddenly choked up. He couldn't help but stepped forward and hugged his own son, 30 years. They locked me up for 30 years I've been thinking about you and your mother every night for 30 years. What keeps me alive is you, and the memory of your mother. Quote. Tony stood at the corner, listening to this conversation, his face slightly moved. Absorber David hugged his son and cried bitterly. They forced me to give up hope of saving you, forced me to kill your mother by mistake, it was them. They took everything from me, they took me away from you. Tony fell into silence suddenly, laughed at himself and silently, turned and left with light steps. This is the justice I don't want to touch, and it is not the justice I am looking for. Tony looked relaxed, it was great not to have to think about such questions anymore, and he could chat with Fang Quan at ease again. After Tony left, Banner and his father cried together, talking about the experiences of these years. Banner confessed to his father that he fell in love with General Ross's daughter Betty, and told about his experiences over the years. David was stunned. At one point Rage wanted to beat his son up, but his raised hand was trembling in midair, but in the end it didn't fall down. David let go of his palm in disappointment and pain. How can you like her, how can you like her? Banner didn't want to irritate his father anymore. He pressed his father's shoulder and hurriedly said, Dad, don't worry, let's stay here and stroke a little bit, okay. David nodded in despair, and asked bluntly, what do you like about her? The corner of Banner's mouth raised unconsciously. Those brown eyes made me fall in love at first sight. David looked pained, and couldn't help covering his face with his hands and crying. Yes, yes, brown eyes, your mother also has brown eyes. Banner stood there dumbfounded as if struck by lightning, a sense of absurd and stunned space-time disorder arose in his heart. Countless years ago, my father met my mother on a certain street, fell in love with those brown eyes at first sight, and fell in love. Just like the experience of falling in love with Betty and falling in love. Time reincarnation, I made the same decision as my father did back then. Banner had mixed feelings on his face, and he didn't know what to say. Dot dot dot. Three months later, the military base. Ross looked at Bronsky, who was used to super serum, and the blood in his eyes finally faded a lot, and he couldn't help showing a hint of relief, okay, very good. Although Bronsky does not have the possibility of confronting Fang Quan, there is hope. There is hope, better than anything. General, Nick Director Nick Fury is visiting. The joy on Rose's face was instantly extinguished, and his face returned to his coldness, with only hatred left in his eyes, let him go. Hating the house and the bird, Ross hated this Agent King who had a cooperative relationship with Fang Quan, even though he knew that he was on the same side with him in the overall situation. Hey, I've already said, I might as well come here by myself, it's useless for you to make an announcement. Nick Fury walked in with a bald-headed beauty in a white dress, followed by Phil Coulson and two agents. Without turning his head, Ross said coldly, kick this traitor out. The secretary stood there with a wry smile, not daring to move. She understands why the general is rage, and she also knows that her best choice now is to do nothing. Nick Fury said seriously, I'm here to find you to cooperate. Ross turned around, revealing a face full of deep-rooted hatred. The haggardness of working all night covered the whole face, cooperation. What can I do with you? Nick Fury didn't speak, but moved aside sideways, allowing the bald-headed beauty in a white dress to come out behind him. This is the Sorcerer Supreme, the Ancient One, which he finally found after three months. It's just that Nick Fury wouldn't have dared to think that this pure and beautiful intellectual beauty would be Sorcerer Supreme if he hadn't seen it with his own eyes. Ancient One's eyes are full of wisdom and insight, and his voice is full of precipitation beauty. I am the magic side of Blue Star, Sorcerer Supreme Asgardian, responsible for protecting Blue Star from the forces of dark magic. I need to use your hands to test this a king of darkness who appeared out of nowhere. 
Ross clenched his fist and slammed the table angrily. Rage, Oriental, what's the use of you standing up now? Ancient One slightly cast the spell of clearing the heart, raised his hand and shot a clear light, his voice was light and nimble, and his eyes were steady, calm down, general. If he does something that violates Blue Star, it is impossible for the seven holy places to fail to observe. At least until so far, if Director Nick hadn't come to me, I wouldn't have known that such a powerful Dark King appeared on Blue Star. According to the video provided by Director Nick, Ancient One at least knows that Fang Quan, who claims to be the King of Darkness, has a strong immortal body, leads a group of humanoid dark creatures, and has powerful spiritual ability and dark magic power, which can form dark sanctuary. But these are not enough, these people are not professional magicians, and the information and materials provided are not enough to support themselves to make a good judgment on this dark king. If you're lucky, this might just be a powerful dark life form smuggled in. Bad luck, this dark king who calls himself Fang Quan, may really be the dark king. Rose felt this strange power, calmed down, and his face became much better, Sorcerer Supreme. How strong is your ability? Ancient One said lightly. Young man, I have lived for more than 800 years, and I can easily envelop the entire planet with my will. This is the confidence of Sorcerer Supreme, and it is also the reason why Thanos is afraid of it. As a super powerhouse in the multi-dimensional Supreme class, she has this ability to let other Supreme class weigh her own. Ross frowned. Then why do you need me? Ancient One stretched out his hand and summoned a piece of light and shadow to form a colorful world, because my will can't get close to this place, there is a larger dark world will shrouding here. If I approach rashly, it will cause the Doomsday War. In a world of color, a vast field of darkness covers an area of nearly 300 square kilometers near the suburbs of California. At her level, in order to protect ordinary humans, some things cannot be done easily. If she rashly uses her will to investigate, maybe it will trigger a world-class war. Ancient One explained. At present, it can be confirmed that this is indeed a strong dark man. However, I need more detailed evidence to help me understand his strength. Seeing this scene, Ross couldn't help but become serious when he remembered the experience that day. Can you tell me the general result? Ancient One hesitated for a while, and said, at present, it can be confirmed that his strength surpasses the seven magic holy places, and he is no longer able to be detected by ordinary magic abilities. If you are unlucky, this may really be a superpower who has mastered a dark dimension. You need to be prepared to cover up a world war, and I may need to do it myself. Nick Fury thought of a point, and hurriedly added, Master Sorcerer Supreme, don't be in a hurry. Master Fang Quang once said that after your death, Thanos arrived at Blue Star in order to collect all six infinite gems. He also said that Space Gems and Time Gem is also in Blue Star. Ancient One looked stunned. He foresaw my death. Able to foresee his own death, also know Thanos' plan, the location of the two gems. This person is not simple. Nick Fury smiled wryly. I didn't come to you to start a war with him, but... Dot his position is very confusing, I have no idea what he is trying to do, it seems that everything he does is for fun. For fun, he offered Tony eternal life, saying he was the hero who snapped his fingers to stop Thanos' plan of destruction. Similarly, for the sake of fun, he almost buried hundreds of thousands of people in the war with absorbing people. Quote. Ancient One had question marks all over his head. Please explain in detail. Why do I feel that this matter seems to be more troublesome than I imagined? Nick Fury had no choice but to tell everything he knew about Fang Quan from an objective point of view as much as possible, and asked Phil Coulson to play all the video materials carefully. Ancient One watched the whole thing with black lines all over his head, didn't absorbing people hurt him at all? The strength of absorbing people has almost caught up with the first-class magic powerhouse, and Fang Quan did not show the slightest trace of injury. Nick Fury joked hesitantly, does it count if the absorber burns his clothes? After a battle, the greatest result of absorbing people is that Fang Quan's clothes are gone. Ancient One had to start re-evaluating his judgment of Fang Quan's strength, frowning, this is not immortality, this is eternity. He didn't lie, he is indeed a strong man who can never die. Immortality is just immortality, but eternity is a more powerful original force than immortality. At this level of powerhouses, unless they give up their lives, it is very difficult for them to really die. 
Even if the life of the body is given up, the soul can still live forever because of the powerful original power and travel in the universe. Nick Fury and Ross looked at each other, realizing that the iron plate seemed stronger than they thought. Nick Fury asked hesitantly, what is the general strength of a powerhouse at this level? Ancient One felt a headache. I, Thanos, and Dormammu from the Dark Dimension are all strong at this level. At our level, death is just a state. You are so lucky that you were able to meet one of the few eternal powerhouses in the multi-universe. Quote. Phil Coulson was surprised. Then why did he come to Blue Star? Ancient One pondered for a while. A strong man like us has a great ability to predict his own death. He may be trying to prevent Thanos' plan to snap his fingers from descending on Blue Star. However, no matter what, I need to test him strength and attitude. Nick Fury had a strange face. So, he will save Blue Star, but he really doesn't care about the survival of our Eagle Nation. Ancient One had a strange face. Among the three of us, Dormammu, who is the weakest, is the ruler of the Dark Universe. The Dark Dimension, also known as the Dark Universe, is where Dormammu is the ruler. Nick Fury shut up, realizing how naive his knowledge was in front of such a strong man. The Ross people were dumbfounded. They never expected that they would have to fight against such a strong man. Phil Coulson was dumbfounded. Then how wide is your territory? Ancient One shook his head. No, although I am the powerful sorcerer supreme in the multi-universe, I am indeed an Asgardian of the Blue Star Civilization. In addition to the seven holy places, powerful dark life forms will not easily approach the Milky Way. On the contrary, those who dare to approach here are all immortals like Dormammu, Faith, and Thanos. Rose didn't dare to think at all, how he would fight against a strong man who ruled the Dark Empire. Ancient One put aside distracting thoughts, and said seriously, I will provide you with the Hulk serum, and I will help you create the Abomination and the Red Giant, and then use magic to integrate you. After you have strong power, you need to take the responsibility to challenge Fang Quan and find out his strength and attitude. Quote. Rose had question marks all over his head, Abomination and the Red Giant. What is this? Ancient One looked calm, a life form that is more powerful than Hulk the World Breaker. Fang Quan's villa in the suburbs of California. Fang Quan was wearing sunglasses, lying beside the swimming pool, with beauties lying on both sides of him, and he played with it casually. In the past few months, he has not challenged the mission, and he enjoys the service of the beauties. Tony, Banner and David are studying super mutant genes. When these three people are free, the ghost leader and the flying shadow leader will arrange exercise tasks for them. Among them, absorbing people is favored by the two chiefs, testing the diversity of dark energy to their heart's content. For the sake of convenience, Fang Quan simply gave Absorber the indestructible power, so as not to be played to death by the two shadow leaders. Challenge Mission The Exploration of Ancient One Content Defeat the Red Abomination Reward Number of Lucky Draws plus one Fang Quan took off his sunglasses and looked at the challenging task in front of him with some surprise. It really made these people play something different. Abomination, Red Hulk, it's a fun Hulk combo. What is different from the Hulk is that both of them are from the military, and there is an extra super soldier serum strengthening, and the physical fitness panel is stronger than the Hulk in the normal state. However, when facing the extreme anger Hulk, the two can barely compete without losing, and there is no possibility of winning at all. Fang Quan smiled. Interesting. What's more interesting is that Ancient One, the Sorcerer Supreme, participated in this matter. Half a month later, on a military truck heading to Fang Quan's villa, sat a huge red giant with bone spurs protruding from his back and bone spurs on his elbows. Ancient One was sitting opposite the truck, flanked by the extremely respectful Nick Fury and Phil Coulson, and the secretary was sitting in the distance beside Red Abomination, looking at him in fear. This is Red Abomination, the result of their hard work for half a month. Abomination, Bronski, Super Soldier Serum plus Hulk Serum. Red Hulk, General Ross, Super Soldier Serum plus Hulk Serum. After shaping the two, Ancient One Beauty integrated the two together to form a more powerful Red Abomination. Nick Fury looked at the Ancient One Magician respectfully. In the past half a month, he clearly felt what a Sorcerer Supreme is, a superpower so powerful that he can control space, and he can bring everyone into a hyperspace with a wave of his hand. 
He also saw with his own eyes that this ancient one magician possessed extremely strong prophecy ability and magic ability, and did things completely beyond their imagination. But because of this, Nick Fury also refreshed his understanding of Fang Quan from the cautious attitude of Ancient One. This Dark King is definitely stronger than what he and others imagined. Ancient One's face was calm. Red Abomination, you have only one task, which is to test Fang Quan's strength and attitude, and don't overstep and provoke him. In his dark realm, I may not be able to save you in time. Red hates to show the ferocious smile of a berserker, and confidently clenched his fists. Could it be that after entering the super state, I can't compete with him one or two? Snapped. The mana giant slapped half of the red loathsome face fiercely, and his face became red and swollen at a speed visible to the naked eye. A burst of air reverberation flew out from the side of the red hateful face, and flew to a distant place. The smirk on Hong's disgusted face hastily restrained, and turned into a well-behaved look. Because of Bronsky's violent war thirsty, and General Ross's frivolous and arrogant youth, after integrating, Red Abomination's temperament became extremely war-thirsty, eager to prove his combat ability. Ancient One's tone was steady, and a huge translucent magic palm was floating above his head. You have to be clear, even if you become super-state, you are only close to us in terms of combat power. In other respects, any of us can easily kill you. Hong hated and felt angry, but she didn't dare to talk back, and obediently obeyed. In this half-month, a lot of time was actually spent on Ancient One Magician, training him. If unilateral tyranny allows him to control his temper, it is also called training. The biggest achievement of half a month is that they can continue to retain a certain amount of wisdom after integrating, but because of the lack of will control, the war-loving consciousness is still very strong. Ancient One looked around, his eyes reflected the scenes of many dimensional spaces, including the dark world that was already close to the main world. In the shadows invisible to ordinary people, countless humanoid dark creatures stopped their activities, watched their actions silently with their blood eyes, and kept watching silently. Ancient One frowned slightly. The good news is that this Dark King has an unrivaled ruling ability. This is the only grand sight she has seen after traveling in all the worlds. Nick Fury heard the voice. What's your bad news? Ancient One felt a burst of pressure. Every dark creature I have seen has absolute loyalty to their king. Most importantly, these dark creatures possess extremely high intelligence. Quote. Wisdom, absolute loyalty, immortality, peak fighting ability. This is already a symbol of being ranked in the super biological sequence, even if it is only low level, it is definitely not something that ordinary people can provoke. But here, along the way, these super dark creatures stationed at their posts with absolute loyalty, guarding their dark king. Well, things are getting better. After seeing it with his own eyes, Ancient One felt more and more how unfathomable this Dark King was. With powerful subordinates, she has seen many. But to make countless super dark creatures defend their king with absolute loyalty from the soul, what kind of strength and charm does this have? In front of the gate of the villa, ghost soldiers began to arrange the venue. Fang Quan held the melon seeds and sat on the first seat, spitting out the melon seeds while checking the screen from the ghost soldiers. Tony yawned, with dark circles under his eyes. Old Fang, you mean, that super-powerful Sorcerer Supreme brought someone to beat you? These days, he and Banner, and his dad, stay up all night studying how to be strong. The harvest is quite fruitful, that is, the Absorber David was bombed several times by the leader of the Ghost Shadow and the leader of the Flying Shadow. But, after dying a few times, Absorber David gradually adapted to his sudden death. Fang Quan gnawed the melon seeds, his face full of curiosity, it's not hitting me, it's testing me. The bald banner looked worried, I don't want to shoot Betty. Fang Quan didn't bother to argue with this bald head, so he directly sent the picture to him. When banner saw the picture, his face looked much better, as long as he wasn't confronting Betty, okay, as long as it's not Betty and General Ross, I'm willing to fight for you and others. Fang Quan's movement slowed down slightly, and a thoughtful look flashed in his eyes. Does this red abomination count as his half-father-in-law? Forget it. Forget it. Don't tell him. I really want to appreciate the scene where my son-in-law beats his father-in-law violently. How? Filial, this is. Absorber David dragged his body to Fang Quan's side with a tired face. My lord, are you going to let me join the battle? Seeing his haggard look, 
Fang Quan cast a horse charm over him. Just play, don't worry, you won't die. Absorber David almost cried. I can't die, but it hurts. During this period of time, he was beaten very badly by the leaders of the two Dark Legions, and he was beaten to death many times. If Fang Quan hadn't rewarded him with the indestructible power, grass could start growing on his grave now. Fang Quan snorted coldly. The Absorber David immediately lowered his eyebrows and said, My lord, I am willing to participate in the war, and I will definitely not let down the training of you and the other two lords. After gaining the indestructible power, his mentality gradually became submissive. I got eternal life by mistake, what else is there to be dissatisfied with? I have countless years to live, and countless years to realize my ambitions. Soon, rows of military trucks and fighter jets flew over from the horizon. Fang Quan chuckled, spat out the melon seeds, and said with disdain, the battle is quite big. The ghost shadow leader and the flying shadow leader silently walked out of the shadows, showing their fighting spirit, and the bloody eyes flashed. Countless shadows appeared in the surrounding sky and on the ground. Ka ka ka! Countless phantom soldiers came out of the shadows, taking forward steps to form a huge phalanx. Countless flying shadow soldiers flew out of the sky, suspended in midair to form a huge square formation. The dark soldiers of the two armies lined up on both sides of Fang Quan's left and right hands, releasing terrifying absolute morale, condensed into a group, and formed a huge blood-eyed phantom roaring silently in midair. Fang Quan smiled. Not bad. The military truck stopped, and Hong Hei jumped out of the truck with a dignified expression. All the soldiers around were extremely nervous and under terrible mental pressure. In front of them, there was an endless array of black-clothed ninja legions, roughly estimated to be hundreds of thousands. A thousand people can form a film, and hundreds of thousands of black-clothed ninjas are boundless at a glance. The huge number plus the ruthless blood eyes of absolute loyalty and unanimous will. All these things gathered together to form a terrifying roaring blood-eyed specter in the sky. Not only are there black-clothed ninjas on the ground, but there are also black-clothed legions in the sky that quietly suspend in midair without flapping their wings, forming a phalanx for the air. The black-clothed legion that covers the sky and the sun literally means the air legion that blocks the sun. The only light path left by this huge dark legion in the sky has been pouring down, sprinkled on the central position surrounded by numerous legions. A young man in black casual clothes was eating melon seeds, crossing his legs, and looked over with a half-smile. Red Abomination restrained all his arrogance, leaving only a solemn fighting spirit, he is very powerful. After possessing the Hulk-like ability, the Red Abomination realized how powerful this Dark King really is. It's just sitting there, but it has a terrifying suppressive force that controls the surrounding space, as if the world here belongs to him. This is a feeling I have never had before. But Red resents the feeling of choosing to trust herself. When Ancient One saw this scene, his brain began to ache. Even if he pursues darkism, I can't easily start a war with him. Nick Fury was shocked. What? Is Fang Quan so strong? After seeing Ancient One's colorful space magic, position magic, integrate magic, mind magic, etc., Nick Fury admires this superpower who has been guarding the Blue Star civilization for 800 years. Ancient One said helplessly. It is possible to defeat him, but after I finished fighting with him, I am optimistic that several nearby states will have to be wiped off the map. A strong man of this level, unless the tit for tat is extreme, involves a matter of principle, he will not do it unless he can do it. Once it is done, it will definitely kill all the lives living in the nearby states. The corner of Nick Fury's mouth twitched, once again refreshing his understanding of Fang Quan's awesomeness. Ancient One nodded. Go, Red Abomination, initiate a challenge, and take a look at the style and attitude of this Dark King. Hong hated and hesitated for a while, and asked, Will I die? This feeling of suffocation and oppression constantly irritated the eyebrows, why did I feel a little unconfident? Ancient One, speak politely. Hong hates to accept the suggestion humbly, be polite, can I survive? Ancient One raised his head and looked into his eyes, his tone was flat, Maybe it's better to die. Red hate. What the hell, before I came here, I didn't know that you asked me to attack such a terrifying enemy. It's too early to blow the cowhide. After seeing Fang Quan with his own eyes, Hong Hate clearly felt what it means to be an immortal boss. 
Red Abomination can only bite the bullet, for the blood feud of those 60,000 brothers and sisters. If Fang Quan shot at him personally, with better luck, he would be able to lie down and go back by recovering his ability. If you are unlucky, it will become a flower fertilizer here. Red Abomination walked to the front of his own line, adjusted his mentality, showed his fighting spirit, and shouted, Fang Quan. I am Red Abomination, and I want to challenge you. If I win, hand over David Banner. Quote, after he finished shouting confidently, he couldn't help showing a trace of death on his face with his back to everyone. For the sake of those 60,000 fighters, I must fight this faint hope. Even if there is only a slight possibility, I have to desperately grasp it. Hong's disgusted eyes quickly became firm, becoming extremely resolute. Bet your own life, but also to fight for this possibility once. Going to death with your life can be regarded as completing your life for your mission. 60,000 brothers and sisters, don't panic, I, Rose, will definitely meet you with the answer. In front of the gate of the villa, enter first. Fang Quan felt the supreme will of faith emanating from Hong Abomination, and the sloppy face on his face calmed down. He sat up straight, sprinkled melon seeds in the hands of the ghost leader, and showed an interested expression, interesting, which one of you is going. Play. On Hong Abomination's body, Fang Quan felt the hot will to believe, a powerful soul wave that ordinary forces fear. Inside this huge and twisted red giant body lives a noble soul with lofty beliefs. Fang Quan is willing to give respect to such an enemy, he deserves to be respected. Such a person, whether it is one's own side or the enemy's, deserves noble treatment. Banner took a deep breath, his body began to grow huge, and his skin turned green, all go. Fang Quan tapped the back of the chair with his fingers, his eyes bright, his smile playful and respectful. He is the product of your father-in-law Ross and a powerful warrior Bronski mutated into a super giant integrate. Banner, who had adjusted his aura to a wild state, was just about to roar, but when he heard Fang Quan's words, he turned his head in disbelief, what the hell? Let me beat my father-in-law. Is this too inappropriate? Fang Quan smiled, waved his hands and said, you don't need to kill me, I respect warriors with lofty beliefs. After Banner saw his attitude, the heart in his throat slowly let go, and he roared in a wild state seriously, Hulk attack. Roar, Hulk Banner roared, leapt up, and flew towards the red abomination in the distance. The absorber David couldn't sit still, anxiously, Master Fang, can you let me go? I will definitely use all my strength. The enemy is extremely jealous when they meet each other, I can't sit still. The energy level of this red abomination obviously exceeds that of his son, and his son will only suffer when he goes up. Only when the son enters the state of extreme rage can he compete. If you keep your hand, the other side may not keep it. My own son has no indestructible power, he will die if he dies. Fang Quan didn't bother to pay attention to the absorber, sit down and watch. In this world, not everyone has the characteristic of infinite energy. Hulk's potential and prospects are unfathomable. Red hate. Ah, you still underestimate the Hulk. Dot dot dot. Red Abomination saw the Hulk jump out and land in front of him, the ground trembled, and he was slightly relieved. A terrifying powerhouse like Fang Quan should be faced by a supreme powerhouse like Ancient One. Hitting a Hulk, isn't it enough to have hands? I'm a quadruple stacked ability, boy, you're going to suffer. Hong Abomination couldn't help showing a sinister smile on his face, eager to try, wanting to show his invincible and powerful berserker figure in front of everyone. It's time to let the world know. Super soldiers, not just you Hulk. And I, Red hates. Hong hates being in a good mood, and even yells at Fang Quan. King Fang, do you approve of this competition? Fang Quan smiled, his voice was not loud but he transmitted to the ears of everyone present with his powerful dark magic power, if you can defeat Hulk and Absorber, then you will win. It is impossible for Red Abomination to win. The Absorber has been rewarded with indestructible power by himself, and with his ability to energy absorbing and release energy, it is impossible to lose. Indestructible power plus energy absorbing can still lose, and Absorber can simply be reopened. Hong frowned in disgust, it was okay, although it was difficult, but his chances of winning were 50 to 50. The Hulk roared. Hulk. Smash. The sound waves rolled, shaking the air constantly. 
Hong hated not to be outdone, increased her own energy, and roared back with a sound wave, kill. The two behemoths more than six meters tall did not have the slightest trace of ink, and they both charged and slammed into each other. Boom, the Hulk collided with the red abomination with his arms crossed in front of him, the muscles in his arms churning like waves. The ground around the two of them collapsed, shockwaves spread out, and the ground waved like a mud wave. The soldiers of the Eagle Kingdom couldn't help but retreat one after another, fearing the battle between these two behemoths, and they didn't even want to touch the aftermath of their battle. The black-clothed ninjas remained motionless, being rubbed by the shockwave, the ones in the front row turned into black smoke and exploded, while the ninjas in the back row used their powerful strength to stabilize their figures. After the front row was killed, the back row made up silently. The dead ninja in black came out of the shadows and made up for the end position. These black-clothed legions blocked Shockwave with their bodies, so that these chores would not interfere with the Dark King who was watching the battle with admiration. The soldiers of the Eagle Kingdom looked at the performance of those black-clothed soldiers in horror. This, what kind of monsters are these? Is this brainwashed? My god, these two are monsters, and those men in black on the opposite side are also monsters. The morale of the soldiers of the Eagle Kingdom was severely hit. The elites who spent a lot of money to raise them, the last thing they want to encounter is this kind of dead soldiers who are not afraid of death. These dead men only have a few dollars to raise, how much money they have to raise. Most importantly, seeing these dead men in black silently and naturally taking over the positions in the front row makes people feel even more frightened. Nick Fury's complexion was as ugly as it needed to be, with blue veins appearing faintly on his forehead, Fang Quan's ability is too strong. Ancient One couldn't help taking a deep breath, this Fang Quan's ability is stronger than I expected. Just relying on such a well-trained undead army, it is not a problem to push the entire mortal world. Such a dark life form, just a playful thought, is enough to set off huge waves in human society. Nick Fury smiled wryly, I even got your address from him. At the moment, watch Ancient One's performance. Only then did Nick Fury feel more deeply how terrifying this Dark King is. On the battlefield, the Hulk and the Red Abomination fought fiercely. Every punch can produce a terrifying shockwave, and during the roar, it can release sound waves to bombard the surroundings. It forced the soldiers of the Eagle Kingdom to keep retreating, making room for these two powerful life forms to fight. The Black Legion has maintained its original formation unwaveringly. The bigger the Red Abomination, the more excited it is, its sanity is constantly decreasing, and its fighting spirit is soaring wildly, wanting to tear up the powerful life body similar to itself in front of it. From being rational at the beginning, to rage being constantly suppressed after the battle, the Hulk has learned his berserk style and his power has soared. Boom, Red hated and roared excitedly, suppressing the Hulk's attack, his eyes were extraordinarily excited. It is too easy to defeat this guy, I will definitely be able to avenge my brothers and sisters. On the first place in the distance, Fang Quan couldn't help but burst out laughing. Tony couldn't help being curious, what's the matter? What's so funny? Fang Quan smiled helplessly. Banner is a little tender after all, and he can't beat this super soldier. Tony is wearing a steel armor, with a tactical mirror in front of his left eye. No, the energy in Banner's body is constantly increasing, and sooner or later he will be able to fight back. Fang Quan clicked his tongue. No, he doesn't have this chance. Tony didn't understand, but he read it carefully. Absorbing people twitched their cheeks. My son has no chance of winning. Through these days of torment by the two great dark lords, he has acquired the purest fighting skills and abilities. After all, my son is still tender, and he can't fight this kind of fighting old fritters. In the distance, Eagle Kingdom watched the battle. Nick Fury saw the Hulk's muscles constantly bulging, and frowned, this Hulk is so difficult to deal with. If it wasn't for the intervention of the Ancient One magician, the usual plan would definitely have nothing to do with this guy. Ancient One's face turned ugly. I remember you said that he found this Hulk through the prophecy ability. Yeah, what's the matter, Lord Sorcerer Supreme? Ancient One let out a breath, and the magical aura in his eyes faded. This Hulk has the potential of infinite energy, that's why the Dark King is following him. I only knew that the Hulk was very strong, and only after seeing it with my own eyes did I understand the root cause. The Hulk is a super strong man who grows infinitely stronger through fear and anger. 
If he goes to the extreme state after rigorous training, even spiritual magic will be unable to do anything about him. Fortunately, though, he's just Hulk now, not Green Wart Destroyer of Worlds. On the battlefield, the Hulk roared angrily, and the energy on his body soared to a higher level, faintly raising the suppressed arms of the Red Abomination. The Red Abomination snorted in disdain, and directly entered the Super Red Abomination state, which was the initial result after training with the Ancient One Magician. It can perfectly display the effect of the integrated power. The only disadvantage is that it takes a lot of effort from two people, and after the effort is exhausted, it starts to consume the mind. If the super state cannot be released before going completely mad, the souls of the two of them will be lost in the power shock forever. Super Red Abomination The red color on the skin becomes more vivid, the body size becomes larger, and the bone spurs on the body become sharper. Boom! The Super Red Abomination pressed easily, and then swept his legs, and the Hulk was pinned to the ground, tightly pinned to his neck. Hulk angrily pounded his hands like a sledgehammer on a drum. Supervillain remained motionless, kneeling on the Hulk's neck until he began to foam at the mouth, his eyes rolled up, and he began to slowly shrink in size. Super Red Hate let go of his knees, showing a disdainful smile. After all, he is a commoner who doesn't know fighting skills. In the case of superior strength, he has nearly a hundred years of combat experience that this big green man never had. It's easy to defeat him. Super Red Hate looked relaxed and happy, and looked at Fang Quan. King Fang, please continue, I think I can defeat the Absorber David and avenge my brothers and sisters. The ghost soldier dragged the unconscious banner to Fang Quan. Fang Quan couldn't help admiring, it's really a clean and neat fighting technique. The operation of Red Abomination just now can be described as a perfect combination of strength and skill. Even if the power of Red Abomination was not very dominant at the time, it was still able to crush and defeat the immature Hulk with its skills. Fang Quan took a glance, and threw out a healing horse spell power with his hand, awakening Banner. Banner woke up from a coma, and saw Fang Quan's face when he opened his eyes. His face quickly turned red, and he hurriedly got up from the ground, I'm sorry, I. I'm still too weak. The fight just now made him clearly realize that there is a huge amount of gap between himself and the real strong. Fang Quan waved his hand indifferently. It doesn't matter, just play. The Absorber David blushed with anger. My lord, let me go. Fang Quan smiled. You guys go together. Tony, who was sitting by the side, was full of question marks, is this too immoral? Fang Quan rested his chin on his hands and said with a playful smile, Moral. Do I need it? Beat him and win this victory for me. If you win, I will grant one of your wishes. Quote, Banner's back straightened immediately, his momentum was full, and his face was full of red light. Okay. Go. How precious is the promise of the Dark King. After I win, I must give my father free will. Absorber David's eyes lit up, and he unconsciously looked aside, staring at Red Hate's aggressive son. I will definitely win, so that my son will also have eternal life. Banner and Absorber David's aura are inexplicably united and become a stronger belief. The two of them quickly went to the front of Hong Abomination. Hong's disgusted face was ugly, what does this mean? It took me a long time to fight before I fell into a coma, and you cured it with just a wave of your hand. Fang Quan's voice came from a distance. Beat the two of them, and I will hand David over to you. Hong gritted his teeth in disgust, so he could only hold back his breath. Okay. The situation is stronger than people, so I have to bow my head. The Ancient One magician looked at Banner's state and frowned slightly. This Dark King has a very powerful healing ability. Nick Fury was surprised. Don't you know? The Ancient One magician was helpless. No, this is different. What he possesses is a law level healing ability. I never expected that Fang Quan would be so difficult to deal with. This is good, not only can't do it easily, but also can't easily defeat this difficult Dark King. It can only be a strategic compromise. Ancient One was silent for a while, sighed, prepare the table and drinking utensils. Nick Fury opened his mouth wide, Master Sorcerer Supreme, don't you wait for the results of the Red Abomination. Ancient One sneered, why, do you think Red Abomination can win? Fifty-year-old young people are still a little shallow. Absorber David connected the entire Dark Army behind him. 
Unless the Super Red Abomination can compete with the energy of the entire Dark Army, it can't win. Nick Fury couldn't be more confident after being kicked, but he had seen with his own eyes how powerful the Red Abomination was, even missiles could resist it. The Super Red Abomination is more resistant to hard nuclear explosions. If this guy is thrown in Africa, he can unify the African continent. This kind of guy can't beat the two people Fang Quan recruited at random. I can accept that I can't beat Fang Quan, but if they can't beat both of them, it's unlikely, right? Ancient One shook his head. It doesn't matter whether Red Abomination wins or loses, what matters is Fang Quan's attitude. At least, this is a superpower who can communicate. We have not risen to the stage of intense conflict yet. Ancient One no longer paid attention to the battle situation, but simply closed its eyes and rested. Seeing this, Nick Fury waved his hand to keep the people around him quiet, and closely followed the battle with Phil Coulson. Anyway, there will be some chances of winning, how could it be possible to lose? The battle was fierce, and at first, the Super Red Abomination had the upper hand. But as the absorbers rushed to absorb the energy of the Super Red Abomination at all costs, the battle situation began to decline gradually. Super Red hates to shake it hard, throwing the absorber off his body, sweating profusely, looking at the absorber in fear. Grass, this guy's ability is too perverted. The Hulk let out a roar, rushing up and smashing his fists furiously. The Super Red Hater couldn't block it, and the absorber who flew out turned into lightning in midair, circled around in the blink of an eye, and threw himself on his back to start energy absorbing. Super Red hated and roared angrily, go away. If we have the ability, we will risk our lives. This feeling of being constantly weakened is too bad, I definitely can't win. Absorber David laughed loudly, put his head next to the Super Red Abomination's ear, okay. Super Red hated and was furious, kicked away the Hulk's suppression, turned back and punched it. He turned his anger back to anger, his mind was clear, and the speed of his fists was controlled, giving the Absorber time to dodge. The worst result is just a punch in the face of the absorbing person, and there will be no fatal injuries. Boom, Absorber's head was smashed, and electric lights radiated. Super Red was dumbfounded in disgust. Why don't you hide? Why don't you hide? The surprise and accident came so suddenly, Super Red Hate didn't even realize whether he should laugh or cry. This is revenge. The Hulk rushed forward angrily and smashed angrily. Super Red loathed and laughed, raised his foot and kicked the Hulk who couldn't fight easily again, ha 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 ha, dead. David, you are finally dead. Ha 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 ha. I had predicted 10,000 outcomes, but I never expected that it would be so easy. Blood feud must be avenged. Super Red hated laughing up to the sky, laughing extra heartily, with bursts of sound. What are you laughing at? A pair of khaki-colored palms grabbed Super Red Abomination's ankles. Super Red was shocked in disgust, looked down, and saw the most disgusting face in his life. The sky in front of Super Red Abomination suddenly darkened, and a terrifying wind pressure hit. When he looked up, he saw a huge amount of green fist. The Super Red Abomination couldn't dodge, it forcibly ate the Hulk's fist, and was thrown backwards, but there was a khaki figure hanging tightly on his ankle. Absorber David grabs him by the ankles, working on energy absorbing while the Super Red Abomination is distracted. With such a short effort of breathing, 20% of the energy of the Super Red Abomination was sucked away, unable to maintain the peak state, and was forced to release the Super State. Super Red Abomination fell to the ground, and his bright red skin became darker and darker. He tried hard to struggle, but because of his own weakness, the strength of absorbing people soared. He couldn't break free for a while, and could only be suppressed and lay on the ground helplessly. Rage's Hulk lifted a boulder, jumped in front of the Super Red Abomination, and slammed it down hard on his head. Enough, the Hulk's figure paused instantly, even the huge boulder in his hand was suspended in midair, and the Absorber was also terrifiedly imprisoned, unable to move, unable to energy absorbing, unable to use energy, only his eyes could turn. In the distance, Ancient One Magician's left hand shone slightly, and his eyes looked at Fang Quan. Mr. Fang, that's enough, I surrender for General Ross. The Super Red Abomination is the result of hastily rushing out, and it is highly uncontrollable. If the fight continues like this, even if they can win, Ross and Bronski will always be lost in the vortex of power. Super Red shouted angrily in disgust, No. I can still fight. 
Let me fight. I didn't lose. I can still enter the super state. The Ancient One magician threw out a decree, directly sealing the mouth of Super Red Abomination, and his power was also sealed. The Super Red Abomination suddenly fell silent, unable to move. Ancient One magician looked at Fang Quan calmly. I have asked Director Nick to prepare the tea set, do you want to taste it? Fang Quan laughed and applauded. That's right, you really deserve to be the Sorcerer Supreme, who can master the power of Eye of Agamotto so proficiently. How is your apprentice Steven Stan range? The Ancient One magician's face was slightly moved, and he smiled subtly, you said this sentence three months or half a year earlier. Fang Quan smiled, but did not speak. While the two were talking, a group of soldiers had already placed the table and drinking utensils in front of Fang Quan. Fang Quan looked at the expensive high-end drinking utensils in front of him, and said indifferently, Okay, let's do it like this, children, it's normal to be ignorant. But I want to teach myself a lesson. A pop-up window popped up suddenly. Congratulations to the host for accepting the opponent's surrender, the number of lottery draws plus one. Fang Quan was a little surprised. The settlement of this task actually requires him to accept the opponent's surrender. Don't need to do it yourself. If you come out one minute later, Hong Abomination should have suffered a comminuted fracture all over his body by now. Start lottery draw. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the Sheep Charm. Sheep Charm. Active. Acquire the ability of the demon Soul Astral. Passive. Soul Authority. Fang Quan's movements paused slightly, a gleam of light flashed in his eyes. The soul in his body suddenly underwent metamorphosis, and in an instant it became the darkest color that absorbed the luster of all things, and the essence of the soul also became crystal clear. Looking inside, one can see a domineering dark demon soul sitting on the dark throne, staring proudly and indifferently around. This is really a surprise, my soul metamorphosis has become the soul of the demon king. The dog charm is immortal, the horse charm is immortal, and the sheep charm spells the soul of the demon king. I have become a more powerful eternal immortal. The corner of Fang Quan's mouth raised slightly, interesting. Ancient One's forward steps paused slightly, and he looked at Fang Quan with suspicious eyes. What is this powerful soul oppression? What does it mean? Do you mean to start a war? In the next moment, the terrifying oppression of the soul dissipated. Ancient One was surprised for a while, let go of the superficial sense of vigilance, and walked towards Fang Quan. Fang Quan was a little surprised when he saw Ancient One approaching. The Ancient One of this universe is actually a pure and intellectual beauty in an oriental white gauze dress, with very good looks and temperament. Anyone who is not blind will know that this is a very noble beauty. Ancient One sat on the other side of the table, heated the tea by himself, picked up the teapot, have a drink. Fang Quan nodded, resting his chin with his hand, his face was calm. Ancient One poured tea for Fang Quan, then brewed it for himself, picked it up and took a sip, his face was slightly stiff, and he put down the teacup in embarrassment, don't drink it, the quality of this tea is very bad. I shouldn't expect any good tea from these rough people. Fang Quan smiled lightly, say it straight, I like to say it straight. Ancient One nodded, and asked directly, your purpose for coming to Blue Star. Fang Quan said frankly, be stronger and play with women. Ancient One was surprised. Don't plan to capture Blue Star. Fang Quan changed a comfortable position and leaned back on the chair. I like to have fun, and I don't like to assign tasks to myself. I don't have this interest at the moment, and the future is hard to say, but you can try to kill me when the time comes. Ancient One chuckled. I can't kill you, at most I can expel you. And the price of expulsion is too great. Ancient One asked curiously, you came here to stop Thanos. Fang Quan rested his chin on his hands, with a relaxed expression on his face, no. But I'm very interested in killing Thanos. Ancient One nodded, and asked calmly, when will I die? Fang Quan raised his eyebrows, you don't know. Ancient One smiled slightly, the future is unpredictable, and I only know the general idea, but I don't know the exact time. Fang Quan, Stephen Strange, when he takes over from your Sorcerer Supreme, that's when you choose to die. It's about half a year after he joined you. Ancient One lamented. It seems that I can finally unload the burden, but I don't know what he will do. Hee <laughs> hee, by the way, will you hurt the human race? Fang Quan smiled. I am a human race. I don't care about ants, but if ants annoy me, I don't mind trampling them to death. 
After finishing speaking, Feng Quan looked at Hong Abomination whose time had been stopped. Ancient One frowned slightly, weighed in his heart, and finally said, he's just a pawn. Feng Quan said playfully, I admire the selfless and heroic General Ross. Another bloodthirsty guy must die. It would be a pity that someone like Rose died. But something like Bronsky is so disgusting to me. Ancient One stopped the time magic, picked up the teacup and said, okay. Boom, the terrifying black light of the soul reached the red abomination in an instant. Before Red Abomination could even react, a desperate scream resounded throughout the plane. Red Loathing's body disintegrated quickly, turning into a white-haired old man, standing blankly on the plane. Ross was naked, raised his hands blankly, and looked around him in surprise, where's Bronsky? Ancient One looked down at the water in the teacup trembling slightly, raised his clear eyes, and opened his mouth slightly, Law of Soul. Layman watched the excitement, while experts watched the doorway. At this glance, there are too many things that can be seen. The law of immortality, the law of immortality, the law of soul, the law of all magic, the ruling power of the Dark King. In a short contact, this Dark King brought too many surprises and accidents. Fang Quan blew on the dark waves on his fist, and smiled, the feeling of annihilating the soul is not bad, by the way, let me ask you a question. Ancient One said politely, please tell me. Fang Quan smiled. What kind of price does it cost to put you on the bed? Such a rare beauty, it would be a pity not to conquer it. Ancient One also laughed. Are you provoking me, the supreme powerhouse in the multi-universe? Fang Quan smiled gently. How much do you think I'm getting along with you? Ancient One's face suddenly turned ugly. He got up and left, leaving a sentence, a draw. Although Fang Quan's full strength has not been tested. However, only based on what has been shown so far. I can't beat him unless he admits defeat. This pervert. Ancient One was so pissed off that he left. Nick Fury and others left with General Ross naked. At present, it can only be confirmed that Fang Quan has no hostility towards Blue Star. As for more, I dare not ask for extravagance. Ancient One magician can only turn a blind eye and close one eye, taking Bronsky as a victim and the Ancient One magician said it very clearly. If there was a fight, Fang Quan would definitely not die, but the onlookers would definitely die. Fang Quan watched Ancient One and others go away, smiled and shook his head, it's really interesting. Tony asked curiously, Fang Magician, what is your goal? Fang Quan yawned, become the ultimate dark Mephista. Tony, will human beings be sacrificed in the process of achieving this goal? Fang Quan looked at him like a fool, I'm not Thanos, don't blackmail me. I am the king of darkness, I am not the king of madmen. Darkness also has dark rules. Tony breathed a sigh of relief. I'm just afraid that if you stand on the opposite side of all mankind, I will have a bad conscience. Fang Quan rolled his eyes. Get out, I am the king of darkness supported by the human race, I am not a foreign Mephista. Tony understood and smiled awkwardly. Fang Quan is a dark king rooted in the human race. He is one with the human race and has two sides, and will not stand against the human race. Fang Quan looked at Banner and David who were kneeling in front of them, tell me your wishes, and I will grant them. Banner knelt down on one knee and hurriedly said, please give my father free will, he can't stand being imprisoned, it will drive him crazy. David looked at his son in surprise and emotion. Such a precious wish, the son is willing to use it on himself. What a, what a good son. Fang Quan snapped his fingers and waved his hands indifferently. Okay, I have lifted the prison and he is free. The absorber David hurriedly thanked. Thank you sir for giving me freedom, but I don't want to leave, I want to stay with my son. Fang Quan looked impatient. Tell me your wish. Absorber David bite the bullet and said. My lord, please give my son eternal life, I'm afraid of me. Before he finished speaking, Fang Quan injected the power of immortality into Banner's body. Fang Quan felt bored, got up, and said indifferently, Next time, I will tell you directly, I don't like inkblots. Fun things are gone. I have to return to the fallen life again. Fang Quan didn't want to pay any more attention to these people, and walked straight into the darkness and returned to the back garden of the villa. Banner was dumbfounded. Ha! Huh, am I going to live forever? Tony pressed the tactical eyepiece. Indeed, look up. 
Banner raised his head subconsciously, and saw Tony aiming the palm of the steel armor at his head. Boom, Banner's head exploded in an instant, and the fragment solidified in midair again, and quickly returned the same way. Banner's head recovered perfectly, he rolled his eyes and passed out directly. Tony smiled contentedly. Ah, take a deep breath, don't panic, coma is normal. Ah, this kind of suffering, finally there is a second person to suffer. Tony, who had been drenched in the rain, was inclined to tear other people's umbrellas apart at this moment. Dot dot dot. The Ancient One magician was sitting in the car, frowning slightly, the dark green power of time shone in his eyes. Nick Fury smiled wryly. Master Sorcerer Supreme, what should we do now? Ancient One magician's face was slightly strange. You can try to cooperate with him, his dark power is rooted in the human world. In the overall situation, he is one of us. Nick Fury, what's the king's position? Ancient One magician's eyes were filled with dark green light. Chaos and order, is very principled, but it is also a Mephisto who can do anything as long as it feels interesting. Hey, such a troublesome matter should be handed over to the next Sorcerer Supreme. To put it simply, this is a fun Mephisto. He is in a good mood and will bestow eternal life on some people. And these people who have obtained eternal life have good conduct and some have bad conduct. Tony, a playboy with a strong sense of justice, has gained eternal life, Banner, a man with a sense of justice, has gained eternal life, and the twisted soul that absorbs people like a madman has also gained eternal life. This kind of principle is strong, but people who are only for fun are the most troublesome. Nick Fury also got a headache when he heard it. I'll go back to him now, will he kill me? I don't think I can offer a bargaining chip to make amends. Ancient One stopped prophesying, rubbing between his brows. No, you have. Nick Fury was startled, yes, where, he is immortal, the king of darkness, what else is missing? Ancient One said the result of the prophecy speechlessly, hate him, hate him, and do everything possible to kill him. Nick Fury was shocked, do I think I have a long life? Ancient One raised his forehead, he will find it very interesting if you do this. As long as you can satisfy his need for fun, he will give you the gift of eternal life if he is in a good mood. That's why I hate this messy Mephisto with no firm stand. This Mephisto will do anything for fun. Nick Fury was dumbfounded. Ha! Huh. Ancient One said helplessly. I didn't lie to you, his greatest interest is fun. As long as you can bring him fun, even if you want to kill him, he will find it very interesting. You can't measure the idea of an immortal Mephisto by the idea of an ephemeral. For eternity, this Mephisto will do anything for fun. Quote. His eternal life is to protect the Blue Star civilization. Thanos is immortal in order to pursue the goddess of death and wipe out half of the life in the universe. Dormammu seeks endless dominion after immortality. And this Fang Quan, immortalized, is after the messy fun. Righteous Way, he does not stand. Mo Dao, he doesn't stand either. He stands for his own fun. The ultimate shit stick Mephista. Nick Fury looked confused. Then what I need to do now is to seek cooperation with him while establishing an anti-dark alliance. Is it so above board? Ancient One nodded. Yes, correct answer. Nick Fury was a little nervous. Really want to do this? He won't kill me. Are you fooling me into a pawn? Bronski is already dead. Ancient One glared at him. If Fang Quan wanted to kill you, would you still be alive? You really don't know anything about power. Phil Coulson volunteered to pick up the phone. Director, let me ask instead of you. The corner of Nick Fury's mouth twitched. Ask. Phil Coulson dialed Tony's number and was connected within two seconds. Phil Coulson swallowed. Is Mr. Fang there? I'm right next to him. Let it go. Phil Coulson looked at Ancient One, and Ancient One nodded helplessly. Phil Coulson took a deep breath and said seriously. We want to set up an Avengers, while protecting the Eagle Kingdom and human beings, and at the same time possibly killing Mr. Fang Quan, what do you think? Tony's gasped voice came out, are you crazy? Finding death is not such a way. Fang Quan's hearty laugh came from the microphone. It's interesting, then you have to do everything possible to kill me, otherwise it will be too boring. Phil Coulson responded with twitching corners of his mouth, and waited for Fang Quan to finish laughing before silently hanging up the phone. Nick Fury lit a cigarette, smoked, and murmured with slightly dull eyes, how does this make sense? 
The idea of your immortal species, I, a short-lived species, is somewhat incomprehensible. Ancient One's face was full of helplessness. Maybe, being too invincible is also a kind of loneliness. In terms of immortality, I am not as good as this Mephista. My soul will rot. His soul is eternally young. I'm so envious. Avengers, also known as the Anti-Dark Alliance, was established after the encouragement of the big villain laughed. Ancient One Magician clarified the strategic goal of Nick Fury's shield in this area. On a local level, you have to form a confrontational relationship with Fang Quan so that you can improve your competitiveness. But in the overall situation, you have to know that he may not necessarily is our enemy. Nick Fury kept this in mind and said that he would definitely follow the guidance of Sorcerer Supreme. The guidance of the boss is more valuable than Jin Shan. After Ancient One solved the tedious matters, his brows furrowed unconsciously. Nick Fury asked cautiously, Master Sorcerer Supreme, do you have any troubles? Ancient One's eyes flickered slightly, I'm just not sure if I want to change the future. Forget it, help me find a surgeon named Stephen Strange. Nick Fury, bring someone here. Ancient One said in an affirmative tone, you just tie him up. He won't be willing to come here on his own initiative. Nick Fury looked confused, but accepted the order anyway. Ten days later, at the shield ground base, Ancient One was meditating with her eyes closed, when a man with his hands tied behind his back and a black cloth bag over his head was pressed in front of her. Ancient One opened his eyes, looked at the hostage in front of him, waved his hand slightly, and motioned for the two agents to release him. Two agents tore off the black cloth bag from Strange's head. Unable to adapt, Strange hastily closed his eyes, and then opened them twice before gradually getting used to the light here, and said in a joking tone, kidnapping me as a surgeon. I think you can use a more polite way, such as a consulting fee of 200,000 yuan. The handsome and tough Strange is confident and arrogant, and doesn't care about being a hostage at all. Ancient One went straight to the point, I need you to learn magic. Strange laughed loudly, what are you kidding? Ancient One stood up immediately and shook his sleeves. The two agents behind Strange saw their faces tense, and they couldn't stop stepping back. Whenever this intellectual and beautiful woman flicks her sleeves, someone will be unlucky. Last time, the 6-meter-tall red abomination was slapped into a mosaic by the 1.7-meter-tall intellectual Yuji, and then he was rescued with healing magic and continued to be beaten, until the red abomination, actively, learned to control his temper until. Ancient One didn't talk nonsense, and directly slapped Strange on the face, directly slapping his soul out, and his body fell directly to the ground. The two agents quickly caught his body with quick eyes and hands, and looked dumbfounded at the bewildered soul body in midair. Ancient One said seriously, Time is short, I will throw you to the edge of the multi-universe to experience it first. Strange's soul in midair turned pale with fright, and hurriedly waved his hands, No, no, no. I think I can. Boom, Strange's soul disappeared in midair and was thrown into the multi-universe. The two agents looked at Ancient One tremblingly, their whole bodies trembling slightly. This little man who is 7 meters tall is so strong that he can turn the entire base upside down with a wave of his hand. Ancient One's face was calm, and he tapped the palm of his left hand with his right hand, counting the numbers, estimating how many cosmic spaces this future Sorcerer Supreme has passed through. Ancient One even paid attention to his body leisurely, calculating whether he had reached the upper limit of his endurance. When Ancient One silently counted to 106, Strange's body began to smoke. Ancient One's face was slightly joyful, and he recalled his soul with a wave of his hand, good potential. It is rare for ordinary people to even have the potential to travel through space, but Strange was able to withstand 106 space shuttles at the stage of ordinary people. This kind of potential is already rare in the world. No wonder he can be my successor. Strange's soul was recalled with smoke all over his body, and he was pressed into the body by Ancient One with his hands in panic. Ancient One nodded very satisfied. Yes, you can be my disciple. Strange was covered in smoke, knelt on the ground, looked at Ancient One in horror, and said in a trembling voice, What did you do to me? Psychedelic, psychedelic. Ancient One smiled and comforted. Don't panic, I just opened your real eyes. Strange yelled with a nervous breakdown. Do you know what I just experienced? I personally passed through a fixed star. A galaxy cloud. 
There is also a large dark and strange universe. Ancient One listened patiently, and asked seriously, So you want to study? No, I won't study. Let me go back, I want to be a doctor. Strange growled hysterically, his hair standing on end. Ancient One sighed in a voice full of charm, stretched out his hand and pressed his eyebrows. Strange, in front of life, none of us are ready. Boom, this time, Strange travels through the universe with his body. Ancient One left a little source of mana on him, enough to protect the source of body and mind of this weak mortal. This time, Ancient One waited patiently for ten minutes and then calmly recalled Strange. Facts have proved that Strange's ability is very powerful, giving a little mana source protection, and it hasn't completely collapsed after ten minutes. Strange was covered in hellfire, and his expression was extremely broken. He knelt on the ground and yelled loudly, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. Ancient One waved his hand, and a space bookcase appeared beside him, with a calm expression. Very good, now we will start learning from the basics of spells, and you must familiarize yourself with the new general outline guide I recently wrote for the universe within the next eight hours. Strange watched in despair as Ancient One extinguished the flames on his body, and then wept bitterly. I learned, I learned, I have a photographic memory, I am definitely the best student. I was eating hot pot and singing at home and a group of agents broke in and kidnapped me. I, Strange, the best surgeon in Eagle Country, was kidnapped by a group of lunatics to learn some kind of magic. Sky, the world is crazy, not only the super mutant that slaughtered the military, but also this terrifying magic. Ancient One was very satisfied with Strange's performance. If it wasn't for the time constraints, she would really like to teach this disciple to take over her responsibilities step by step. But now, my time may not be as rich as expected, and I need to make preparations in advance to protect the Blue Star civilization from the magical forces. While calculating the future, Ancient One estimated the dangers that would be encountered in the future. The mysterious the gods telekinesis came into her mind, making her feel that the dark hand she left in the library was triggered. Ancient One's eyes changed slightly, Caecilius. My arrogant disciple finally made a move against the taboo spell after he left the Holy Land. Caecilius, did you finally choose to betray me? Ancient One immediately opened the portal to Holy Place, she stopped when she was about to pass through, and said to the two agents, Go and tell Fang Quan that Dormammu, the Dark Lord, is about to invade Blue Star. No need to say anything, just need just tell him. After saying this, Ancient One walked into the portal and disappeared. Strange hugged the two books in horror and confusion. Seeing that Ancient One disappeared, he turned his head tremblingly and asked the two agents, Who is she? Chapter 41 The two agents showed fear, and one of them replied, Sorcerer Supreme, the most powerful magician on Blue Star. According to this lord herself, she is a superpower in the multi-universe. Strange wanted to cry but had no tears, why did she arrest me? Still torturing me like this. The two agents looked at each other without knowing it. When Ancient One arrived at the Eastern Holy Place Library Pavilion, there was only a bloodstain on the ground, and Asgardian had already been separated. Ancient One looked at the corpses on the ground and sighed slightly. He could only look at the Book of Cagliostrolo scattered on the ground, which was a secretary who studied time. She didn't open the book, knowing that Caecilius tore up and snatched those few pages. It is a magical ritual to summon Dormammu, energy absorbing from the dark universe. Ancient One stood quietly on the spot, looking at the corpse on the ground with complicated eyes. I have been protecting this planet for more than 800 years. For the sake of civilization, I made a moderate compromise to the dark universe in exchange for eternal life. However, his own approach is still not understood and recognized by some people. For thousands of years, the severe exhaustion of constantly preventing disasters and protecting human civilization once again flooded my heart, submerging my entire soul. Ancient One sighed. Strange, I hope you can grow up quickly. I'm really tired. I need you to take over my responsibilities. Dot dot dot. Fang Quan was enjoying the food in the living room when he saw Phil Coulson standing respectfully at the door. Fang Quan stopped eating, wiped the corners of his mouth, and asked curiously, why, you guys are ready to kill me so soon. Phil Coulson laughed dryly, walked in, and reported respectfully, it was the Ancient One magician who sent me a message. She said that Dormammu is going to invade Blue Star. 
Fang Quan's eyes changed slightly. Time is so fast. Phil Coulson asked cautiously. Excuse me, Mr. Fang, what time is it? Fang Quan fell into thought, and said casually, The time of death, her time of death is coming. Ancient One is equivalent to the nuclear deterrence of the Blue Star civilization. Once she dies, Blue Star will soon be involved in interstellar wars. Phil Coulson was dumbfounded. What? Then what's the use of our efforts? Nick Fury has just ordered Tesseract to be shut down in preparation for Star Wars. However, these small measures can only delay time. However, as long as the Ancient One is dead, these small tricks will be useless. Fang Quan changed his posture, knocked on the table with his fingers, slightly serious, I have to intervene in this matter. It would be a pity for a civilization like Ancient One, Asgardian, to die. Fang Quan has a good impression of Ancient One, it would be a pity if such a peerless beauty fades away. Challenge task. Kill Kaecilius once. Challenge reward. Number of draws plus one. Fang Quan laughed. Good guy, this task is heartfelt. Go, go find the traces of Kaecilius, I want to kill him, have fun. The coming of Dormammu is already settled, inevitable. But, Grandpa is happy to take the opportunity to kill a few ants for fun. Fang Quan's words fell to the ground. On the surrounding ground, countless shadows flew out from the walls, bringing gusty winds, and quickly flew into the distance. In the sky around the villa, on the ground, countless dark ninjas obeyed orders, turned into shadows and rushed towards the whole world, looking for the enemy's traces for the great king of darkness. Three days later, somewhere in the wilderness, Caecilius ran with all his followers, with blood all over his head and many wounds on his body. Between his brows, a dark mark was emitting blood light slightly. And behind them, some dark ninjas are chasing and killing them in a playful manner, not in a hurry to hurt them. Caecilius couldn't help yelling. We are followers of the great dark god Dormammu, why are you chasing me down? We are a family. Caecilius couldn't figure out what was going on. Ever since he absorbed immortality from the great dark god Dormammu the day before yesterday, he has been hunted down by a group of immortal dark ninjas. Yes, a group of immortal dark ninjas. A dark ninja who can fight but can't die. When did eternal life become so worthless? Caecilius could only use the portal hard to buy time, but within half a day, these dark ninjas would catch up again. How did they find me? A follower of the black girl cried while running. My lord, why don't you ask my god? Ask if this is a misunderstanding, we respect my god very much, this must be a misunderstanding. Caecilius gritted his teeth, opened a portal again, and hurriedly shouted, This is the last hiding place, we must move in half an hour. A group of people rushed in, and Caecilius closed the portal as fast as he could in his life, leaving behind those dark ninjas thousands of miles away. There was no rejoicing on his face at all, only deep tiredness. I never thought that after I got eternal life, the first thing I did was to run away for two and a half days without eating or drinking. What the hell is being hunted down by dark creatures? Did you know that behind me is Dormammu, the god of darkness? The follower didn't want to say anything at all, panting, My lord, ask my god, even if we die, we have to die to understand. Caecilius sighed helplessly, and while casting spells to perform the summoning ceremony, he complained, These dark ninjas don't speak at all, they can't communicate. Soon, the summoning ceremony was completed. Caecilius hastily knelt down on the ground, and the followers around him also knelt down. The rich voice of Dormammu Chaos came through the thick cosmic barrier, My beloved believer, why haven't you destroyed those three holy places? Caecilius had a bitter face, and said helplessly, My god, we have been hunted down by a group of dark ninjas for three whole days, and I just got a chance to contact you just now. Dormammu was confused. You didn't release my dark coercion. How could there be dark creatures daring to chase you? Caecilius can also be regarded as his fanatic, who can use a small part of his coercion and ability, how could he be threatened by a group of dark creatures? Caecilius could not wait to cry. My god, these dark ninjas are immortal, and their number is boundless. Along the way, we are the only ones who are hunted down. Three days ago, I was still a great leader who raised my arms and was followed by thousands of people. Three days later, I had only a few remnants and defeated generals left. Dormammu was shocked. Immortal. Could it be my niece who made the move? Impossible. She was kicked out of the Dark Empire by me. 
Caecilius begged bitterly. My God, please guide me in the direction. If I continue to be hunted down like this, I will not be able to fulfill your great will. Dormammu felt carefully and confirmed that Caecilius was not lying and the memory in his mind was true. Dormammu was in shock, so he had to cast a prophecy spell through the cosmic barrier. Strange, could it be that Ancient One made the shot? It shouldn't be, she doesn't have, what the hell? What the hell is this? Dormammu watched in shock at the scene unfolding before him. Caecilius raised his head in horror. My God, what's wrong? My God, have you already occupied Blue Star? In the prophecy screen, many fast-moving black spots appeared on the surface of the Blue Star. In California, there is even a huge dark sanctuary shrouded, as if a huge amount of dark universe portal has been opened on the surface of the Blue Star. Dormammu was dumbfounded. The Blue Star has already been occupied by dark life. No, there are three holy places, plus the suppression of Ancient One, how could there be dark beings who dare to spread on Blue Star? That's Ancient One. When he was young, he crushed the head of the immortal strong man with a single disagreement, and his body was separated and sent to the sealed Ancient One at the edge of the universe. Blue Star is well known in the circle of top powerhouses. Because this sorcerer supreme who is so strong lives in this extremely weak and inconspicuous surface civilization. To be honest, Dormammu didn't know about this insignificant planet before. It wasn't until Ancient One crushed his head one day and took away part of the origin of the Dark Universe that he became murderous. Caecilius was dumbfounded. My God, what shall we, do? Dormammu pondered for a moment, pointing to a certain point on the map. Here, they are driving you here. Go, go and see what is here. Caecilius felt something was wrong. My God, don't you understand the origin of these dark ninjas? Didn't you say that you are the only one who sells eternal life? How come once I get eternal life, this thing will be rotten? Dormammu's eyes were slightly coercive. I don't know, but he must be a dark powerhouse of the same level as mine. Go, you won't die. The summoning ceremony was unilaterally hung up by Dormammu. Caecilius knelt on the floor dumbfounded. His followers also knelt aside dumbfounded. Their hearts are as cold as their knees at this moment. Yeah, not dead. Just because he won't die doesn't mean he won't be sealed or tortured. These dark magicians have mastered countless magics that make people feel miserable. Taking the initiative to touch another dark boss, this is really disgusting with his own life. My lord, what should we do now? Caecilius took a deep breath. Go to California. Only by dragging Blue Star into the dark universe can eternity be achieved. Dot dot dot. California, Fang Quan's big villa, living room. The ghost leader walked to Fang Quan's side and lowered his head to report the information. Fang Quan put down the newspaper in his hand, slightly surprised, they took the initiative to approach me. The ghost leader nodded. Fang Quan was a little surprised. It's strange, how did Caecilius know, he doesn't have the ability. With the passage of time, a wide area dark sanctuary has been established within nearly 200 square kilometers around him. Although the level is not comparable to his own exclusive dark sanctuary. But this wide area dark sanctuary is enough to solve most common problems. E.g. Cannot be spied on. A portal lights up in the living room, and Ancient One walks out of it. She showed a slightly tired expression, because they asked Dormammu for help. Fang Quan asked curiously, can Dormammu see through this wide area dark sanctuary? Across a cosmic barrier, there is still such a long distance in time and space. If he can reach this level, the title of Sorcerer Supreme should be given to Dormammu, not Ancient One. Ancient One didn't know whether to laugh or cry. He can see the whole picture of Blue Star, but you can't see anything because it's pitch black. Then tell me, can he not know that the problem lies with you? When Fang Quan thought about it, it was indeed the truth. Ancient One sat down on her own, while the ghost soldiers beside her made tea for her. Ancient One slowed down, took a sip of tea, his eyes lit up, not bad, good tea. What kind of rubbish was that that I drank myself last time? This is the tea one should drink. Fang Quan said casually. Tony gave it, you can take it if you like. Ancient One saluted to express his gratitude, thank you so much. By the way, I came to you to know one thing. Fang Quan said politely. Please tell me, I am still very generous to a dying person. Ancient One, if your mouth can't speak, 
you can cut off and sell two tails of meat for money. Ancient One adjusted his mood and asked, what is your attitude towards Dormammu? Fang Quan said indifferently, as long as it doesn't mess with me, I don't care. Ancient One nodded thoughtfully, and then said, that's over. Fang Quan was surprised, what's the end? Ancient One explained earnestly, once he knows your existence, he will definitely peek at the dark origin in you. Fang Quan was amused, is he so courageous? Ancient One, well, after I crushed his head, he went a little, crazy. Fang Quan, Ancient One, well, how should I put it, in order to pursue eternal life, I killed him and took away part of his dark origin. Fang Quan was startled, you deserve to be hunted down. Co-author Dormammu is still a victim. Who is not angry with this? Ancient One silently looked at the teacup in his hand, but he really wants to drag Blue Star into the dark universe, this is a fact. Fang Quan couldn't stop laughing. A ruler of a dark universe cares about the gains and losses of a planet. What else are you doing? Why is he so popular? Ha 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 ha. Ancient One covered his mouth and coughed twice. I was young and frivolous at the time. After I crushed his head, I smashed his balls. Although he recovered later, I heard that he had psychological shadows and was never born. Descendant. The air fell silent. Question marks frantically jumped on Fang Quan's head. Ancient One's tone was very helpless. I didn't know that he would be resurrected at the time, so in order to punish him for his bad words, I used magic to punish him a little. Hey, I didn't expect that the grievances and grievances would last for more than 500 years. Quote. Fang Quan gasped and leaned back tactically, hiss, dot you are so ruthless. Ginger is still hot when it is old, and the ginger, which is more than 800 years old, is even hotter. Lo and behold, the balls were cracked directly. No male creature can bear this kind of humiliation. No wonder Dormammu kept other universes from invading, staring at Blue Star for a long time. Who doesn't want to risk their lives? Ancient One held the teacup silently admiring the slightly green tea, as if he could see the flowers. She came here this time just to see Fang Quan's attitude. Fang Quan clicked his tongue. Yes, I can help you solve this matter. In exchange, you can give me a copy of Kamar Taja's magic book, and I want to play with your magic. Ancient One nodded without any hesitation. Okay, yes. Yes, this chaotic Mephista is still on the Terran side in the overall situation. As long as this point is stable, the rest is easy to say. Even if Fang Quan is a Mephista, he is also a Mephista of the human race. Fang Quan sighed while checking the progress. Okay, let them prepare, I'm going to see what Dormammu's followers can do at the door. This time, the ghost soldiers prepared a dark throne made of black crystal for him, with dragon patterns engraved on it, and a dark dragon head engraved on the back of the chair, which is mighty and domineering. In front of the gate of the villa, Fang Quan sat on the dark throne, chatting with Ancient One while eating melon seeds. Banner and the Absorber David sat obediently aside and waited. Fang Quan glanced at him, and said lightly, where's Tony? Banner hastily explained. My lord, his company found a batch of smuggled arms, and he handled it himself. Fang Quan nodded to show that he knew. Tony finally embarked on this familiar path, a little bit of personal heroism. However, one thing that is different from the previous life is that Tony in this world retains more arrogance and egoism, and does things more arrogantly, especially after gaining eternal life. Fang Quan turned his head and continued chatting with Ancient One, and Ancient One also began to talk about the past when he traveled to the 10,000 worlds many years ago. Almost half an hour later, a semicircular portal popped up 300 meters directly in front of Fang Quan, and Caecilius walked out with three of his pathetic followers. As soon as Caecilius came out, he was the first to see Ancient One, his face tightened, and then he noticed the young man in black casual clothes beside Ancient One, his eyebrows ached. This familiar dark wave, this person is related to those dark ninjas. Caecilius' heart was bleeding. Three days ago, he only had time to get the dark mark for himself and three of his followers, and the rest were all dead. After Caecilius was distressed, he took the lead in attacking Ancient One, Ancient One. You yourself are in collusion with the dark forces, you hypocrite. Ancient One opened his mouth slightly to persuade, but thought of Fang Quan's prophecy to him just now, he couldn't laugh or cry, so he could only shake his head and remain silent. It was a trick of fate that he actually died at the hands of this villain. 
Feng Quan was a little surprised. That's it. The magic fluctuation of this Caecilius is not very strong. It can only be said that Ancient One was careless and did not flash, causing the car to overturn. Caecilius was a little uncertain about the depth of this young man, but he still showed an arrogant attitude. I am a follower of Dormammu, the great god of darkness, Caecilius, you false god, why don't you quickly bow down to my god? The corner of Fang Quan's mouth twitched, and he looked at Ancient One beside him, has his mind always been like this? Ancient One wanted to find a crack in the ground to get in, staring at the teacup, Dormammu is the ruler of the dark universe. In theory, there are not many people in this universe who can wrestle with him. In normal circumstances, Caecilius' trick works really well. Because no more than one pair of hands in the entire universe can beat Dormammu. Even at the same level, it is rare to be stronger than Dormammu. But now, two stood in front of Caecilius. Fang Quan was speechless for a while, and waved his hand, go, kill him, and then press him over. In an instant, dark shadows charged from both sides of Fang Quan's body, turning into a group of phantom shadows rushing towards Caecilius. Caecilius was completely dumbfounded. With a glance, a hundred thousand dark creatures suddenly appeared. On average, twenty-five thousand dark creatures per person were easily dealt with. Shouldn't we be showing each other's cards? Why did you just flip the table over? This is different from the rules on the road. Caecilius only had time to raise his hands to cover his face and shouted, Don't slap your face. Next second, the four dark believers were overwhelmed by the group of ninjas, and the ones behind wanted to hit someone, but couldn't even insert a needle. Papa Papa, ah, the screams resounded across the plain. Fang Quan calmly blew on the tea leaves on the surface of the tea, this sound is really pleasant. The ghost soldiers attacked Caecilius fiercely, hacking Caecilius to death seven or eight times, and then found that the four dark believers would not die, but kept recovering. After looking at each other, they grabbed the disabled Caecilius and dragged them to Fang Quan. Caecilius and his followers were thrown at Fang Quan's feet, bloody and bruised. Caecilius was forced to kneel on the ground, struggled to raise his head, one eye was bruised and the other half opened, beast, even if I die, I won't tell you a word. Fang Quan was happy. I just like you who are tough, come on, step on him. Caecilius stared wide-eyed, looked at Fang Quan in disbelief, and hurriedly shouted to repent, a ghost soldier covered his mouth intimately so as not to disturb the Dark King. The ghost soldiers around rushed up to help, suppressing Caecilius and turning him right. A ghostly soldier stood in front of Caecilius, carefully raising his black combat boots. Caecilius' eyes widened to the maximum, he struggled in horror, his covered mouth made a sound of, woo. No no no, do not, snapped, the wind, like a sword, landed on Caecilius' crotch. Crack, Banner and David couldn't help clamping their legs, gasping for air as if feeling empathy, and looked at the miserable scene in front of them in fear. Caecilius' body suddenly lifted up, his eyes stared like copper bells, bloodshot eyes filled the eye sockets. The ghost soldier showed no mercy, earnestly followed the order of the Dark King, and stepped on the second foot like lightning. Woo, Caecilius was covered with his mouth, he couldn't say anything, he could only let out a desperate mournful roar. Fang Quan drank tea by himself, with an indifferent expression, don't say it. Keep stepping until you say it. Snapped, woo, crack, woo, the two ghost soldiers went into battle together, taking turns to lay their feet down. The testicles recovered after being crushed, and then they were crushed again. Caecilius felt the greatest despair and pain in his life. His eyes hurt so desperately that he couldn't stop the tears from flying. Ancient One couldn't help frowning. Stop it for a while, I think he's repented. Fang Quan was full of question marks. He didn't say anything, how could he repent? Ancient One let out a long sigh. You never asked any questions. Also, you let the dark ninja cover his mouth. Fang Quan was taken aback for a moment, and looked up, only to notice that when he lowered his head to drink tea, Caecilius' mouth was covered, and he could only whine. Fang Quan sighed embarrassingly. I thought this kid was so tough and could bear such a great pain. The ghost soldiers let go of Caecilius in unison. Caecilius fell to the ground, muscles all over his body twitching unconsciously, his crotch was covered in blood, he was foaming at the mouth, and his eyes rolled up from time to time. Fang Quan thought for a while, but he didn't seem to have anything to know.
Wait, there is one thing to know. Hand over the ritual of summoning Dormammu. Caecilius on the ground was unconscious, foaming at the mouth, and did not respond. Fang Quan showed a pitiful look. Sure enough, someone is tough enough, come here, and his balls. Look, the followers of Dormammu are also very loyal. Seeing this, the other three dark believers didn't care about dignity, and hurried forward to slap Caecilius. Papa Papa, Caecilius was jerked awake abruptly, his white teeth flew out, and he opened his eyes in a dazed gasp, huh? Are we in hell? Followers hurriedly repeated Fang Quan's words. Caecilius wept bitterly, took out two pieces of paper from his bosom with trembling hands, and confessed with both hands. The ghost leader picked up the paper and stood aside. Fang Quan looked at Caecilius who was kneeling in front of him, and smiled, it seems that I have to do it once. The ghost soldiers killed several times, but the mission was not completed. Caecilius looked at Fang Quan in bewilderment. My, my lord. What? Boom. His head exploded instantly, flying out in a fan-shaped explosion, and a pitch-black soul knelt on the spot in a daze. The task is completed, the number of lucky draws plus one. Fang Quan glanced curiously. Hey, so the soul of this thing can be erased. Dormammu's immortality is a bit of a stretch, but the body is immortal, and the soul will rot or will rot. Now all he needs to do is punch him, and he will be blown away. Fang Quan was curious about the effect, so he punched him. Boom, Caecilius didn't even have time to let out a scream, and his soul and body turned into dots of black light and scattered away. Fang Quan looked at the black light that had become scum, and realized something, it turns out that eternal life is also divided into levels. The eternal life bestowed by me is much more than this high level. The three dark believers trembled. Ancient One watched his eyebrows move slightly, your origin is really strong. This is a heartfelt admiration. The dark mark is the guy that Dormammu invades other universes to eat, and it can be easily erased by Fang Quan. Fang Quan's strength is not simple. Fang Quan ignored Ancient One, but looked at the lottery. Start lottery draw, rabbit charm, active, super fast power, can move quickly. Passive, able to travel through time and space. Fang Quan couldn't help laughing, interesting. After getting the chicken charm, I actually got the rabbit charm. Moreover, the rabbit charm involves space and time. When the speed reaches a certain level, or obtains a certain energy blessing, it can travel through time and space. Now, I have mastered half of the spell power, which is enough to be called half invincible. Seeing Fang Quan kill Caecilius, Ancient One gradually calmed down and smiled. It seems that in the overall situation, you are still willing to stand on the side of the human race. Although I have peeped into the future, the future is infinite time and space, and the real reality still needs to be experienced to confirm. Fang Quan didn't bother to pay attention to Ancient One's words, and yelled, this Caecilius is really weak, I didn't even enjoy myself. Ancient One looked at him speechlessly. You are the eternal strong of one side, what's the fun in bullying a child? Why don't you go fight Dormammu? Fang Quan leaned lazily on the chair and ignored it. If there is no task, no fun to find the door, who has nothing to do to find something to do? Day by day, isn't it good to have fun? Dark flames suddenly ignited on the bodies of the three dark believers, and the ghost leader, with quick eyesight and quick hands, stepped forward and kicked the three flame men into the distance. Ancient One showed a bad look, Dormammu. Fang Quan became a little interested and looked at the three burning men. Three dark believers were ignited, an angry roar resounded across the plain, and a pitch black specter rose from the fire, rapidly expanding to a height of more than 80 meters, Ancient One. Dormammu looked at Ancient One angrily. Ancient One, you dare to break my dark mark. Ancient One, you can seal it, you can kill it, but how dare you break my dark mark. Dormammu is very rage. Once the method of breaking his dark mark is spread, his progress of invading other universes will be greatly slowed down. Are you trying to fight me desperately, Ancient One? Ancient One, are you bold enough to smash my job? It's true that I have no temper. This is a giant made up of pure dark energy. The skin on its face is made up of dark waves, rolling constantly. The purple eyes are constantly releasing dark evil light, causing all the lives it watches to become distorted and mutated into servants of darkness. Fang Quan looked at this huge black wavy human face and was quite surprised, what is he barking like a dog? Ancient One explained. 
you have cracked the dark mark. In order to prevent your method from getting into his dark empire, he must develop a new dark mark. To a certain extent, this is similar to your identity of the Dragon Kingdom. The certificate management system is cracked. If your method spreads, his dark empire will be directly paralyzed. Quote, this is not a slap in the face, it directly digs the foundation of Dormammu's dark empire. Fang Kuang was startled. I'm so awesome. Ancient One was startled. Don't you want to frighten him? I think you know what you're doing anyway. Dormammu glared at Fang Kuang. His face was so angry that the dark waves kept fluctuating. Get out if you have the ability, I must kill you. Killing people is nothing more than a nod, you are too courteous to destroy the foundation of my empire. Fang Quan stroked his chin, attacking the dark universe is a good proposal. Ancient One, Fang Quan snapped his fingers, and the ghost leader at the side bowed his head respectfully and reported that he had obtained the coordinates of the dark universe. Special Challenge Mission Attack the dark universe, fight Dormammu's dark empire until he sues for peace. Task Reward Specified number of lottery draws plus one. Fang Quan looked at the task bar and smiled. To be honest, I still admire your rebellious appearance. Dormammu was blown away by his cynical look, and cursed. When I invade Blue Star, both of you will die. Fang Quan stretched out his middle finger and smiled contemptuously, stupid. After the leader of Fei Ying waited until the Dark King had finished speaking, he threw out three waves of light to annihilate the three Dark Believers. Dormammu was so angry that his black face turned purple, and he wanted to curse, because the believer died suddenly and the projection disappeared instantly. Ancient One was dumbfounded. This ninja leader must have been instructed by Fang Quan before he dared to do anything. But be it. You are a majestic level 1 Dark King, why are you so annoying? Ancient One couldn't help complaining. Why do you owe it? Fang Quan was surprised. Really? No, this must be a misunderstanding. The two of you come here, and from now on, one of you must go to the Dark Universe to fight Dormammu's Dark Empire every day. Remember, this will be a daily task of our Shadow Empire in the future. Quote. Banner and David accepted the task in bewilderment. Ancient One laughed angrily. You still say you don't owe it. Relying on the power of immortality to make trouble like this. Fang Quan clicked his tongue. Why, do you have a problem? Ancient One gritted his teeth. Definitely there is a problem, because the cost of the seven holy places is borne by me. When Dormammu came to fight, it was the holy place of our magician who was fighting on the front line, not you, the Dark King. Fang Quan smiled. Come here, I'll give you a buff. Ancient One had a strange look on his face. Speak as you speak, what do you want me to do? Although we have the same position on the two major situations, it does not mean that I approve of you. Fang Quan stood up put his hands on the chair where Ancient One was sitting, and put his face close to the Great Sorcerer Supreme, showing an ambiguous smile, do you want my gift? Ancient One was furious, and punched Fang Quan in the abdomen, Dengtuzi. As an oriental beauty, even if Ancient One is angry, with this pretty face and temperament, it is quite enjoyable. Fang Quan resolutely activated the cow charm and the rabbit charm, and grabbed Ancient One's fist. The clothes on his body instantly turned into debris and flew away quickly. The clouds in the sky behind his back were torn apart, revealing a huge hollow fist. Ancient One's eyes were full of surprise, impossible. How could this guy be unscathed? Even if Thanos takes a punch from me, he will be beaten to half useless state. Fang Quan grabbed her delicate palm, suppressed her with supreme brute force, pressed his body up, with his face close to Ancient One's cheek, his mouth close to her earlobe, and gently blew out a breath of hot air. Ancient One couldn't help curling up, let out a hum, and his cheeks and earlobes turned red instantly. Fang Quan smiled evilly. As a reward, I will give you eternal life, do you like it? A ray of light drilled into Ancient One's body. The hidden wounds hidden in Ancient One's body for many years were slowly healed by the indestructible power. Ancient One was ashamed and angry, and fought back again, get out. I don't like it. The evil smile on Fang Quan's face became more intense, and he grabbed Ancient One's left fist, I smell a lie from you. Ancient One didn't dare to look at Fang Quan, bit his lower lip and turned his head away, looking sideways. Seeing her like this, Fang Quan felt bored, so he let go and said playfully, it's boring, but I don't like to force others. After Fang Quan flirted with Ancient One, 
He got up directly and left without the slightest bit of nostalgia. Ancient One clutched his neckline tightly, his face was ashamed and his heart was beating fast. Hateful, if I can't beat you, I'll kill you. Banner and David looked at the sky and the ground, pretending they didn't see anything. Ancient One stomped his feet angrily, tore open the space with his hands, and left in a flash. Dot dot dot, Dark Universe, capital star of Dormammu, on the throne of Mephista. Dormammu looked at the disappearing scene, and couldn't suppress the anger that was suffocating to the top of his throat, and his fingers in midair stopped stiffly. After two seconds of silence, Dormammu was so angry that he shot dark magic light into the sky, it's disgusting. Young people nowadays have no rules at all. The black-purple magic light shot straight into the universe, illuminating the surroundings. Dormammu never expected that the younger generation would actually do such dirty work. Who would cut off the magic connection after cursing? So dirty. Dormammu originally planned to wait for Ancient One's soul to decay and die, so that he could get back the source of darkness. But now, Dormammu doesn't want to bear it at all. Isn't it just one, no, two eternal powerhouses? I am dignified Dormammu. I really have to bear this breath. Dormammu rage belongs to rage, sanity is still on the line. Ancient One is an eternal powerhouse, but her soul is not immortal. The other one, Dormammu knew with a glance, was the real immortality inside and out. Isn't it just a cheap meal? Tolerate a moment of anger until it explodes, take a step back and become more and more angry. Dormammu was furious, and smashed the black stone table in front of him with a fist. When did I get angry like this, I have to beat this blue star today. Even if the tooth is broken, I will kill this fool. You are the strong forever, am I not? Everyone is being human for the first time, why let you? If you have the ability, hide in the three holy places and don't come out. Come on, call me the third army to attack Blue Star. I want to smash the tortoise shell of Ancient One. Whoever can smash the holy place will increase the magic power by three levels. Dormammu was so angry that he exploded and lived for thousands of years. This was the first time he encountered such a blind person. Dormammu's orders were passed quickly, and the dark leaders of the Third Army gathered. A group of leaders gathered together, frowning. The magic snake Kato was so worried that the snakes on his head were listless, Ancient One is provoking my god again. Going to fight again. Necromancer Biro stared at a pair of bone fire eyes, and his tone was full of helplessness. It's been 500 years, and we have been beaten for 500 years. Dot how many years have we been safe? The beholder Modo touched the scar on his forehead with his tentacles. My injury is not healed yet, she almost pried my eyeballs off last time. The three leaders look at me and I look at you, with tears in their eyes. Was the name of Ancient One blown out? It was punched and punched. He said that he was a magician, what the hell, he just picked up anything by his side and used it as a weapon. Moreover, the scariest thing is that Ancient One's favorite thing to do is to charge wildly at their dark army, single-handedly defeating the entire army. The most pitiful thing is that they can't beat Ancient One at all. Every time we wait for our god to descend on the battlefield, Ancient One withdraws to the holy place at a light speed, turning into that kind of high-cold style, with the back of his hand, showing the demeanor of a master. What could Dormammu do, he could only stare with anger. The dilapidated holy place became stronger and stronger, and directly filled the defense points of the magic side. The magic snake Kata waited for the eyeballs, weakly, what should I do now? The old rules. Unlock the army, charge in the past, be beaten and cry, my god descends, ancient one hides back to the holy place to taunt. This is almost becoming a regular training program. I mask Moto suddenly snorted. Hey, look at my god's will, this time it seems to be aimed at another person. Upon hearing this, the other two leaders hastily reopened the screen passed by Dormammu. This time, their target was a young man in black casual clothes. The magic snake Kato narrowed his eyes, Eagle Country California. There is no holy place here, right? The bones in necromancer's eyes glowed brightly, we can try to smuggle people on a small scale. Beholder Modo nodded vigorously, agreed. Because of the magic holy place, it is not realistic to enter on a large scale, but it is still possible to do it on a small scale. How many years? After more than 500 years, I finally changed my goal. Demon Snake Kato's face was solemn, then our plan is. 
Necromancer Biro touched his head. Old rules, sneak into the battle, destroy the holy place, the army is coming. Although the goals have changed, the process remains the same. With holy place here, they couldn't even display their strength. Only by unplugging the holy place can you enter the blue star. Then you can be beaten by ancient one. But, this time, it should last longer than last time. Hope. After the three leaders decided on the plan, they directly entered the teleportation to Blue Star. War is the root of the Dark Empire's grandeur, and anyway, they will not lose money. The only headache may be how to die in a less miserable way and live until my god descends. One hundred days later, the Shield's secret base. Ancient One became the special magic consultant of Shield. After solving some magic problems for Nick Fury, he came to the training ground. On the training ground, Strange was waving his hands aggrievedly but trying hard, concentrating all his attention on training his magic proficiency. Behind him, two magicians are holding a laser array aimed at his vitals, and a magician is playing with healing spells. The three magicians saw Sorcerer Supreme approaching, received the spell, bowed their heads and saluted. Ancient One put his hands together in return, and asked, Thank you Jill Magician, Pusul's Magician, and Daniel Magician for your company. May I ask how Strange is doing today? Daniel Magician said respectfully. Strange is a person with a very pure heart that I have met. He loves all beings. At two or three o'clock in the morning, when the soldiers were practicing in the field, someone was accidentally shot and injured. It took him eight hours to get up. He removed all the casings for that soldier and healed all the wounds. Jill Magician's eyes were full of relief. The most important thing is that he didn't delay today's magic training. He would rather not sleep to complete 16 hours of magic training. While maintaining the magic circle in his hands, Strange wailed, then can I go to sleep? Is it because I don't want to go to sleep? It's you who don't let me go to sleep. Kusul's magician smiled and said, Strange magician, your potential has not been fully tapped, you need to work hard to develop a strong spirit. Please don't say such stupid things in the future, unless you are dying, we won't stop training you. Quote, definitely can sleep unless you are going to die. Comfort is for dead man. Strange cursed angrily, waving his hands and releasing fire magic to shatter targets a hundred meters away, a bunch of unworthy beasts. It's fine for these people to torture themselves during the day, and even when they sleep, they have to let their soul astral recite magic books. Livestock. Daniel Magician seriously praised. That's right, your anger resonates well with the flame element, please master this feeling carefully. Strange didn't dare to scold more, for fear that he would suffer even more inhumane torture in the next training. Ancient One took a look and was very satisfied. That's right, his progress is really fast. After a hundred days of effort, he turned from a magic novice to a skilled high-level magician. And his temperament is really good. Knowing that these three magicians will not delay his training, he still chooses to support his body to save the lives of others. Although he is a very selfish person, he is indeed very kind. Ancient One unconsciously thought of that annoying guy, Fang Quan. Tisk, this guy Fang Quan is really annoying, the prediction of ability is really accurate. Strange would indeed be the man to take my mantle. Strange noticed the disgusted expression on Ancient One Magician's face, he was a little surprised, and asked while exercising, Ancient One Magician, do you have someone you hate? Ancient One pouted slightly. Yeah, a guy named Fang Quan. Strange remembered the name in his heart, and looked back to see what was going on. After a whole day of super intensive training, Strange dragged his tired body down on the bed, and used his willpower to release a healing spell for himself to relieve the pain in his body. No, I can't sleep yet, I need to know who Fang Quan is. Strange sat up, posing in a soul astral pose, an emerald green light flashed in his eyes. The body fell asleep on the bed, while the soul sat cross-legged on the bed, and an emerald green light faintly appeared inside. Calling my future, I ask questions and ask questions. The corners of Strange's mouth raised, with a feeling of cheating. During these more than 100 days, he also visited Kamar Taj, came into contact with the Eye of Agamotto in the library pavilion, and studied the Book of Cagliostrolo, and successfully mastered a unique skill, he can communicate with your future self. There were waves in time and space, and Strange, with one eye on his forehead and white temples, appeared opposite him. In the future, Strange had an expression that he had known for a long time, 
Do you want to know information about Fang Quan? Strange has long been used to communicating with his future self, and nodded curiously. Yeah, it can make Ancient One Magician feel disgusted, who wouldn't be curious? Ancient One Magician, this beautiful woman who has lived for an unknown number of years, has mastered the magic sanctuary that can cover the blue star, and she still shows that expression, who is not curious. Future Strange looked at him with pity. Fang Quan is in California, and he is a dark king with very powerful magic power. Strange was surprised. Why didn't the Ancient One Magician expel him? The Ancient One Magician is jealous of evil, he is the leader of the Righteous Way, how can he tolerate a dark king staying in Blue Star? Future Strange shrugged. I don't know the reason, but I want to prevent you from going to him now. Strange snorted. Why would I go to him? How could it be my turn to solve a problem that Ancient One Magician can't solve? Strange sighed in the future, knowing that he was absolutely useless. The Eye of Agamotto can not only summon the projection of the future, but also allow you to control the time, and even summon me to descend on you. Strange became excited. What? There is such a good thing. Then my future? No, are you strong? Future Strange said with a toothache. Very strong, comparable to Ancient One at peak state. Strange felt that this ticket could be messed with, so he clapped his hands. I'll get it right away, how long did it take me to master the time? In the future, Strange's eyes became more and more pitiful, two minutes. Strange is confident now, since he has mastered the time and his future self still exists, it proves that his next plan can be tried, I will take Eye of Agamotto to challenge Fang Quan. My future is the Sorcerer Supreme, and when the time comes to borrow my own strength from the future, it may not be impossible to solve this problem. Doing what he thought, Strange returned to his soul, got up and opened the portal leading to Kamar Taj, and rushed in. As a disciple of Sorcerer Supreme, as long as he is not arrogant, he will definitely be able to get the Eye of Agamotto. Oh yeah, Strange, this is your first battle as Sorcerer Supreme. I want to prove to Ancient One and Daniel that I am not a waste, I am a super genius. After these days of tempering, Strange is eager to prove his super ability and ability, instead of being trained hard every day like a fool. In the future, Strange watched his past self disappear into the portal with pity, and sighed helplessly as he watched the portal disappear. I didn't die, but I didn't say I could fight. Because he is himself, Strange knows one thing very well in the future. When you are trying to die, you can't stop it at all. Depend on. Strange got the eye of Agamotto easily. With the identity of the Ancient One Disciple, the Asgardians and forbidden curses in the library pavilion would not guard against him at all. It took Strange two minutes, and he really mastered the power of time, and even got a comprehensive precautions and operation manual from the future. Strange was even happier, playing with Eye of Agamotto excitedly, I am indeed a super genius. Well, let me go and see how divine Fang Quan is. He stretched out his hand to borrow the power of his future self, and knew where he was about to go. A large villa in the suburbs of California. Oh, such an easy to use power, why is it placed here, what a pity. Strange thinks that the Eye of Agamotto is really a magic weapon, and decisively opens the portal to the suburbs of California. The figure of Strange disappeared in place, and with the help of Eye of Agamotto, he was no longer what he used to be, possessing the ability of Sorcerer Supreme. After Strange disappeared, the figure of Ancient One appeared in the treasure area, looking at the empty guard tower and raising his eyebrows. Perhaps, I should teach this ignorant little guy a lesson, to respect the ancient commandments. Ancient One raised his hand and pinched his fingers, and calculated that Strange's life was not in danger, so he felt relieved. Since he didn't die, then it's fine, let's redeem people later. It is also a good choice to make this little guy suffer a little bit in moderation. Dot dot dot. Big house in the suburbs of California. Following Fang Quan's daily tasks, after attacking the Dark Universe, the Ghost Army will always bring back some good harvests every now and then. In order to collect these things, the Ghost Shadow Legion began to expand Fang Quan's residence, and began to open the passage between the real world and the Shadow Universe, and began to build the Imperial Capital on the other side of the passage. Fang Quan was exercising dark magic power with his upper body bare in the living room, and the coercion on his body was more condensed. It's really cool to pick up girls, but after soaking for a long time, Fang Quan still feels that he prefers to improve his strength. 
Girls will only delay my speed of improving my strength. With a javelin stuck in his forehead, the Hulk banner walked in helplessly and sat aside. The dark universe is too big, we haven't found out where Dormammu's dark empire is yet. At present, it has occupied half of the planet, but the people on this planet resisted fiercely and were very powerful. Quote, Fang Quan looked indifferent. It's a universe anyway, besides, it's normal for powerful people to appear on a planet. Also, don't you feel uncomfortable with a javelin stuck in your head? Quote, Fang Quan is not in a hurry to advance this task, it is all about training his subordinates and expanding the territory of the Shadow Empire. Although he himself doesn't care about this, his subordinates are very fanatical about this matter and want to conquer the entire Dark Universe as a gift for him. The Hulk was taken aback, touched his forehead with his hand, found a long stick, and pulled it out speechlessly, I said, why does my head feel a little awkward? Sir, why don't you go to Master Ancient One? Master Ancient One must know the location of the Dormammu Empire. Since gaining the power of indestructibility, the Hulk has become more and more indifferent to some non-fatal injuries. Fang Quan looked at him like a fool, you are shameless and I want shame. This trivial matter can't be solved. Originally, he could know the coordinates of Dormammu's Dark Empire, but the cunning Dormammu quickly changed the ceremony of the Dark Mark, which caused the original ceremony to become invalid. Dormammu didn't dare to be ambiguous about this kind of thing. This was related to the foundation of the Dark Empire. A slight problem would cause big problems for the entire empire, and even paralyze it. Now, the two shadow leaders and the Hulk can only solve it in a stupid way. Conquer one planet after another, and conquer civilizations one by one. It's all fun and preparations before attacking the Dark Empire. Anyway, everyone is immortal and has enough time to play this game. The Hulk casually threw the javelin to the ghost soldier beside him, this weapon is good, collect it. My lord, is there any work to be arranged next? While playing Wu Chin Shi to move his body, Fang Quan said casually, it's a bit, I've been a little idle recently, you can tell the ghost leader to send some people to build the Blue Stars Intelligence Network. I have been relying on my favor to obtain information, somewhat lagging behind. Hulk nodded, okay, I will give orders when we go out tomorrow. The Ghost Shadow Leader and the Flying Shadow Leader are war fanatics. During this period of time, they are the factions that are most inclined to fight. They will only come back when they die unexpectedly and are revived, and spend the rest of their time on the battlefield. The Hulk and his father's absorbers are on duty. One person goes out to fight, and the other person stays here in the Shadow Capital to guard Fang Quan, and act as a general who handles chores. Challenge Mission the Dark Three-Eyed Sorcerer Supreme Pseudo challenges you. Challenge Content. Please defeat this Dark Three-Eyed Sorcerer Supreme. Challenge Reward. Number of Spell Draws plus one. Fang Quan laughed. Interesting, Strange has been blackened so soon. It's not possible, shouldn't he have just learned general magic at this time? It seems that her arrival changed Ancient One's mind and made her take the initiative to find Strange for teaching. But, it's only been three months. How did this kid turn into a dark three-eyed Sorcerer Supreme? This needs to pass the test of Sorcerer Supreme first, and take over the secrets passed down from generation to generation. In order to become the Dark Sorcerer Supreme, one must obtain only one Dark God book in each universe to browse and master. This book is the supreme magic book that one of the ancient gods, the fallen god Sithorn, was forced to flee. He was full of hatred and anger. It recorded everything in magic he knew in the first half of his life. What's more interesting is that if there is no perseverance, ordinary people will be affected by the hatred left by Sithorn in the book and become extremely aggressive demonic beings. As for the three eyes, it is not simple. In the East, it is called the Sky Eye, which is the abbreviation of Eye of Omniscience. It also has another name, the Eye of Agamotto, which is the supreme secret art left to future generations by the ancestor of the ancient magician. It is rumored that only a pure necromancer and a pure soul can master the super ability. And in the Kamar Taj treasure area, the device loaded with the time gem is the Eye of Agamotto instrument, which possesses the mysterious power of the ancestor of the magician. Fang Quan understood and smiled, interesting. Sorcerer Supreme, the Book of Darkness, Strange, who opened his eyes, challenged me. I just don't know if this guy's consciousness has been corrupted. If he was corrupted, he would have to teach this disciple a lesson for Ancient One. 
If not, that would be a lot of fun. Is Ancient One going to break with itself and go to war? She's not that stupid. The ghost soldiers moved the Dark Throne to the gate of the Dark Palace. Fang Quan sat down and rested his chin on his hand, waiting playfully for Strange to arrive. Hulk Banner asked curiously, is the enemy strong this time? After this period of contact, Hulk Banner has a general understanding of Fang Quan's character. A very principled king of darkness who values a certain natural order, hates muddled souls, and hates guys who destroy a certain natural order. Fang Quan respects people with lofty souls, and likes people with firm beliefs, the latter has nothing to do with good or evil. On the whole, he is still a very good person. Partially, even if the ideas are different, Fang Quan doesn't mind, but encourages them to be themselves and implement their beliefs. Fang Quan is not a person who sticks to the rules, he is a very unusual king of darkness, and he is also very charismatic. Because he can accommodate people whose views are completely opposite to his own, and he can even explain the reason to Tony with a smile. For example, when Tony struggled with how to choose justice and the stand of the people of Eagle Country, Fang Quan encouraged him to strengthen his beliefs and protect the great order of the people, which is the root power of civilization. Inspired, Tony put on the Mark V and challenged Fang Quan to get David, the Absorber, to apologize to the 60,000 innocent soldiers. Fang Quan slapped Tony to death, and then explained to him with a smile that he is not even qualified to uphold justice if he is not strong. Tony. Tony can only compromise temporarily, but said that he is still Fang Quan's firm friend. Fang Quan also expressed understanding, and was not angry because of this, but accepted his point of view tolerantly. Fang Quan sat in a leisurely posture, with some curiosity on his face, it is a very interesting enemy. Its strength should be at the same level as Ancient One, but it should not be as powerful as Ancient One. If Strange completely fell into the evil way, Ancient One would definitely be the first to jump out and crush him to death. After a while, a black spot appeared in the sky, and the black spot gradually enlarged. Hulk looked over, and a figure appeared in his eyes. Ha, huh, can fly. Strange, it can still fly. In the sky. Strange is flying, using not only his future ability, but also his future self's levitating cloak. Looking at the magical environment on the ground, Strange took a deep breath, knowing why the Ancient One magician had a headache and disgusted him. A huge dark dimension is coming here, transforming the magical environment here into what the dark creatures like. To completely solve this problem, one must either kill the root cause, or simply cut off time and space and expel it. Ancient One Magician is so powerful, why not do it? Strange saw the Dark Throne guarded on the ground, and swallowed, feeling that he had committed a great death. How about, withdraw? Strange regretted a bit, he should consult the Ancient One Magician before acting, instead of dying alone. Strange stayed in midair, with a troubled expression on his face, thinking in his mind, and unconsciously touched the eye of Agamotto on his chest with his fingers. You shouldn't give up, you have the power of time, so why bother? Can't run if you can't beat it. Strange cautiously applied time magic to himself. If he died, his state would be reversed to this moment and teleported here. Seeing the time spell form a circle, hidden into his chest. Strange breathed a sigh of relief, put aside distracting thoughts and flew to the dark army on the ground. Strange landed on a position more than 20 meters away from the throne of darkness. Relying on his skill and courage, he said with a relaxed expression, you are the leader of these evil creatures, right? Fang Quan couldn't help laughing when he saw how proud he was when he was coaxed a while ago, interesting and interesting. A question mark appeared on Strange's head, interesting. Ha! Huh. Strange saw that the direction of the dark throne was not aligned with the palace gate, but was facing the direction he was flying over, and he had a bad premonition in his heart. I shouldn't be in trouble, right? This man already knew he would come. There is a powerful prophecy master here. Either, this guy's supervision system has spread to 150 kilometers away, otherwise he would not have such ample time to prepare the legion formation and the dark throne. Sweat broke out slightly on Strange's forehead, and he realized that he had encountered a problem that Ancient One was unwilling to solve. A stubborn problem that even Ancient One is unwilling to solve has its own reasons. What is this? Challenge the big devil just out of Novice Village. Strange bite the bullet and said, Who is Fang Quan? I want to challenge Fang Quan. Fang Quan stood up with a smile. 
Why, don't young people nowadays do any preparation before the challenge? This is not a good habit. Behind Fang Quan rose a jet black majestic giant king phantom, wearing a dark crown and wearing a jet black magic armor, staring at everything in the world indifferently. Strange almost cried. He really is the great demon king. Why didn't my future self tell me in advance? Isn't this just watching me being beaten? Beast. Strange hurriedly waved his hands. Wait a minute. Give me some time to prepare. Fang Quan looked at him playfully. Okay. Although this sorcerer supreme has encountered countless disasters in his life, he has dedicated his life to protecting the Blue Star civilization from evil magic forces. He dedicated his life to this great goal, and even lost his beloved one because of it. Although he is immature now, it cannot be denied that in the future, he is a great and powerful sorcerer supreme with a noble soul. Strange muttered a few words in his heart, but he really did, almost thinking that he was going to be hammered to death. He didn't dare to waste time, and hastily opened the time ceremony to the maximum, with the help of the most power he could bear, he couldn't help scolding his future self by the way, you idiot. Why didn't you say that this is a demon king? The projection of Strangeby in the future came to his mind, and he looked at him with a non-smiling smile. Sure enough, even if I knew it a long time ago, I still feel very uncomfortable after hearing it with my own ears. Don't worry, I will give you the greatest strength you can bear, but you should lie down and get out today. Quote. Now you're scolding me, why didn't you thank me when I gave you pointers before? Mada, even though he knew that he was a very egotistical idiot in the past, he still couldn't stand the way he was in the past. I can't stand myself. After Strange finished cursing, his face paled, and he realized why he didn't tell himself the truth in the future. Grass. What a perfect closed loop. While cursing secretly, Strange displayed his supreme divine power. He put on the supreme robe, and in front of him appeared a pitch-black book of darkness made by the fallen ancient god Sithorn, and a sky eye appeared on his forehead. The all-seeing eyes looked at Fang Quan, and the pupils shook violently. Strange gasped wildly. The essence of the all-seeing eye is to greatly enhance the information collection ability and processing ability, and look at the world from a more objective perspective. Now, what Strange presents is a pitch-black, world. A humanoid, living world. The body is forged by the power of spells condensed by seven colors, and there is a crystal-clear devil soul similar to the core of the world. What seems to be the outside of a person, the inside has transformed into an existence similar to the rule of the world. Strange's eyes trembled slightly, realizing how hard an iron plate he had kicked. No wonder Ancient One has a headache on his face. To expel such an enemy, the biggest price is not the Ancient One, but the life surviving on this planet. Once the two fight, it will bring a natural disaster level disaster. After the battle is over, it is not surprising that none of the seven continents will sink. Strange gasped, for a moment he didn't know how to make a move. I have to make sure that after the shot, I can contend and not be pressed to the ground and rubbed. Seeing that his expression was extremely exciting, Fang Quan was shocked for a while, frightened for a while, nervous for a while, and raised his eyebrows, ready. Strange heard the same opening words as in training, subconsciously set up a defensive circle and replied, ready. When the voice fell to the ground, Strange stood there dumbfounded. It's over. Muscle memory helped me make the choice. It's too late for me to regret it now. Fang Quan punched out. The power of the bull talisman was manifested, the air in front of him was torn apart, and the elemental environment was broken by brute force. A phantom of an ancient giant bull roared and flew towards Strange. Strange desperately used mirror space magic to distort the space in front of him into a shield position. His whole face looked extraordinarily hard, with his eyes and eyebrows squeezed together. Boom! The phantom of the ancient giant bull collided with the space defense shield, and the surrounding space made a creaking and distorting sound, and Strange's entire face turned red. Fang Quan leisurely admired his defense, and exclaimed, It's really good. This way, most of the power can be removed, and only a part of the power can be born. It has to be said that the one who plays magic is the flexibility of the brain, and the use of space and position structure to unload the attack power has something in common with the principle of Tai Chi. Hearing these words, Strange breathed a sigh of relief, a momentary opening appeared, the entire space shield shattered, and was directly hit by the phantom of the ancient giant bull, spitting blood and flying backwards. Bang bang bang. 
Strange rolled on the ground like a football until he smashed a flower bed with his head. Strange's head was bleeding, his eyes were staring, his head was in severe pain, and the whole world was spinning. While spitting blood, he released a healing spell for himself by relying on muscle memory, brought his state back, and the injury on the top of his head was healed. Strange let out a breath and got up with a bitter expression. If it wasn't for his strong body in the future and the reliable defensive magic weapon on his body, his head would explode right now. Strange smiled wryly. The defensive magic I built with all my might is not bad for you. When I was on the training ground, I used space magic as a defensive position. The three magicians were astonished, and they all praised themselves as super geniuses that have never been seen before or since. But in the eyes of this demon king, it seems that it is only good. Fang Quan smiled and shook his head. No, no, you didn't risk your life, this is not your limit. I was just playing with you just now, and I will be a little more serious next time. Strange turned pale. Wait, me. I surrender. To you, it's a joke, but to me, it's a life-threatening game. Fang Quan punched a little more seriously this time, but this time he didn't use brute force, but the magic power of the dragon charm. The flame dragon roared and rushed towards him. The surrounding air was instantly squeezed away and boiled, and the ground where it passed by instantly melted into red magma and boiled. Strange's pupils shrank sharply, his sense of life and death was triggered, and he desperately squeezed his magic power to form a high-level space composite defense stance again, creating a full three-layer space composite defense stance in an instant. He didn't care about the consequences of doing so, he clenched his teeth, roared from his throat, and put his hands together to block in front of him. Shua, Shua, Shua. The three space composite defensive stances are like three translucent shields in front of him. Boom. The first translucent space shield exploded instantly, and the flame dragon paused for a moment, then crashed into the second translucent space shield. The second semi-transparent space shield only had time to stop it for a moment, and it exploded right after the former. The translucent space shield on the third side was supported by Strange's constant magic power, even though it made a constant clicking sound, it was also quickly repairing the resistors. Strange's forehead was covered with sweat, and he looked in horror at the lifelike flaming dragon in front of the space shield, and the continuously boiling magma on the ground. No, can't resist. As soon as Strange gritted his teeth, regardless of the pain in his arm, he directly doubled his magic power output, the translucent space shield instantly expanded, and his defensive ability was raised by three levels. A trace of disdain flashed in the flame dragon's eyes, and it continued to charge at the space defense shield. After being strengthened, Strange launched a spatial movement in an instant and disappeared in place. The magic that lost the master's blessing didn't even persist for a millisecond before it was swallowed up by the flame dragon. The flaming dragon remained undiminished, flew into the distance, landed on a small hill and exploded, instantly blasting it into a huge deep valley of magma, countless red magma was blasted into the sky. Fang Quan let out a sigh, and looked at Strange in midair with surprise and surprise, as expected of Sorcerer Supreme, this kind of spell controls ability, infinitely close to the peak. Fang Quan was not surprised that Strange released powerful magic, but Strange can read multiple spells and release them multiple times at the same time, and he can also release space movement magic again after release, which is very powerful. This is equivalent to completing three complex and huge space calculations at the same time, and can also adjust the huge data model changes at any time, and finally complete its own state calculation and space movement calculation within one millisecond. This brain melon is really powerful. Strange was suspended in midair in horror, his clothes were drenched in cold sweat, his hair was sticking to his face wet from sweat, the blood vessels on his arms burst, and countless streams of blood flowed down his arms, bright red the blood dripped down the fingertips to the magma ground, and evaporated and gasified in midair due to the high temperature. What the hell, this guy actually didn't take the attack seriously. When attacking just now, the demon king only had his right fist flashed for a moment. Did this guy only move for a moment, limited to the strength of his fist to attack me? Depend on. Strange thought that he had just squeezed out the magic power of his whole body and exchanged his arms for the chance to escape, and his whole body was under great pressure. Strange's face was full of despair, his arms were so painful that he could only rely on perseverance and faith to build a healing circle to heal his wounds. It's impossible to fight. 
if it's a complete future self, maybe it's still possible to fight. With my half-baked level, it is absolutely impossible to win. I don't have enough combat experience, I haven't honed my magic to perfect control, and I haven't sublimated my inner self to the next stage. What was I thinking half an hour ago? Looking at his terrified expression, Fang Quan felt very amused, why, want to admit defeat? Strange's face turned red, he held his breath, his mouth was tightly closed, and his eyes were staring like copper bells. Seeing his expression, Fang Quan was amused, knowing that this arrogant genius had committed a common problem. If I don't say it, he probably can bite the bullet and admit defeat. If I say it, even if this arrogant genius can't beat him, he will stick it out for the sake of face and pride. Strange suppressed the breath in his chest, his face flushed, and he squeezed his voice, No, I will not admit defeat. I am Sorcerer Supreme. I'm so good looking, can only use a trick. Seeing this, Fang Quan laughed so hard that tears almost flowed down his face. The immature Strange is so interesting, in a way, he is really, simple, now. Strange healed the wound, put his hands together on his chest, and his eyes turned emerald green, this move is enough to determine the outcome. Demon King, don't underestimate Sorcerer Supreme, don't underestimate our Blue Star Civilization. This trick is for the human race. Back in time, quote, Fang Quan let out a sigh, feeling the abnormal flow of the surrounding heaven and earth rules, squinting his eyes, he decisively flew up to him, and seriously punched out his dark magic fist. Fang Quan's speed was too fast, so fast that his right fist left a dark path of magic light in the space behind him, and the power of the rabbit charm and the chicken charm were integrated, and half of the path was completed in an instant. Strange was so frightened that his ghosts froze. If this punch landed on me, even if I could be revived, I would still suffer from traumatic sequelae. The time gem on his chest unfolded, and the power of infinite time flew out quickly, and the time domain expanded at super light speed, quickly controlling the time and space around him. The time and space of everything around Strange stopped, and even Fang Quan's magic fist attack gradually slowed down, as if being slowed down a little bit. Seeing that the power of time can control Fang Quan, Strange couldn't help heaving a sigh of relief, and maintain the time magic, it's okay, it's not like I don't have to fight at all. With the power of the time gem, I can still hit a dozen. The moment Strange let down his vigilance, in this world where everything is frozen in time. Fang Quan's eyes moved slightly, and he looked at the scene of time stagnation around him in surprise, time gem. I have to say that this dark three-eyed sorcerer supreme is still a bit knowledgeable. Although there are not many ways. Strange's eyes widened, and he looked at Fang Quan who spoke in disbelief, how is this possible? How can you have time resistance? The rabbit charm in Fang Quan's body began to work, the frozen time on his body began to flow, the light of the dark magic fist continued to condense, and the magic light behind him began to flow. Rabbit charm passive, can travel through time and space. When the rabbit talisman works to the extreme, it will be able to step into the power of time and space. Strange was so frightened that his face turned seven points pale, and he directly activated the second half of the time magic, countercurrent. Mad, don't care, call first and talk later. An invisible and quality less time stream shot towards Fang Quan, and the air wherever it went was restored to its former appearance. The terrible thing about time reversal is that it can weaken the lifespan and ability of all things. Definitely, for this kind of, walking world, level enemy, it is equivalent to being in a, weak, state, unable to perfectly display one's own strength within a certain period of time. Strange's face was pale, but he had a good calculation in his mind. As long as Fang Quan was in a state of weakness, and his ability and resistance were reduced, then many dark magic and curse magic would be available. Fang Quan watched curiously as time flowed against him, not dodging or evading, and letting himself be baptized. Strange's eyeballs almost popped out, and he tried his best to maintain the ceremony. How dare you not hide? Why don't you hide? Why don't you hide? Strange watched desperately as time flowed against Fang Quan. Time flowed backwards into the Dark Palace on the ground, and in an instant, the time of the entire Dark Palace was reversed to three months ago, turning back into a large villa. The Hulk was also affected by the reverse flow of time, and his head, which had been bald for three months, turned into that handsome young man again. Fang Quan blinked, 
looked at his hands, and confirmed that he was not affected in any way, this is all your magic. Fang Quan checked the power in his body with some surprise, and the sheep charm was slowly emitting fluctuations. Yep, it turns out the sheep charm allows me to avoid any negative states. An extremely powerful soul, not afraid of the vicissitudes of time, still shines with the brilliance of the strong. Strange was dumbfounded, he stopped releasing the magic, he was completely stupefied, and kept his hands in a posture. Why? How could it have no effect at all? How is this possible? I don't agree. Strange was dumbfounded and aggrieved, knowing that he could not defeat this super strong man. A super strong man who is not even afraid of time can only have the confidence to compete if he estimates that he has lived to the peak strength in a full state. The challenge task is completed. Congratulations to the host for winning the spell lottery once. Fang Quan ran the rabbit charm and felt the power of time and space wrapped around his fingertips, which was very interesting. On the ground, a group of ghost soldiers looked dumbfounded at the dark palace that had turned back into a big villa. We have been repairing the palace for three months. What about our big dark palace? Depend on. This magician is really a beast. Banner felt a slight friction on his forehead, and touched the top of his head with both hands in surprise. Sure enough, he touched the docile hair, and shouted, Ha 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 ha. My hair is back. I have hair. Fang Quan felt the overwhelming resentment of the Black Shadow soldiers on the ground, chuckled lightly, and threw a spatiotemporal force to hit the ground. Boom! The big villa was once again restored to the dark palace that had been expanded for three months. The faces of the Shadow soldiers couldn't help showing fanaticism, and they used their spiritual power to exude fanatical cheers, praising the great Dark King. Banner only felt that the top of his head touched by his hands became smooth again, and the excitement on his face suddenly stiffened. Where is my hair? Three-second hairstyle experience card. Is this the devil's curse? Banner's resentment exploded in an instant, and he didn't understand what happened at all. He only knew that he suddenly had hair and suddenly lost it. Fang Quan looked at Strange, with a smirk on the corner of his mouth, and he was gearing up, Hey, strange, there is a price to be paid for ignorance and arrogance. Chapter 51 The cold sweat on Strange's forehead slid down his cheeks, and his voice was slightly unconfident. So what if you can't beat him, run, I can still run away. Fang Quan smiled kindly and snapped his fingers. The Black Shadow Empire, which was sleeping in the subspace, gradually emerged, and countless people of the Black Shadow Empire came out of the shadows, flew out, and occupied the entire sky and the earth. Indifferent blood eyes stared at Strange in midair. The corner of Strange's mouth twitched slightly, once again realizing why Teacher Ancient One was unwilling to deal with this thorn. Even if it's hard to beat, the people of this Dark King's strength should be at the top level of human beings, and the number is also terrifying. Strange thought of the core time magic he had reserved, which was the best choice for him to leave here. Strange hesitated for a moment, then decisively raised his hand and pointed it at his temple, with a mischievous and unconvinced expression, hey, old guy, just wait, I will definitely come back again. Boom, Strange's head exploded in an instant, and after the body fell eight meters from the air, an emerald green light flashed, and the whole body disappeared. Fang Quan was stunned for a moment, this guy saved it in advance. The mind of playing magician is flexible and prepares various plans in advance. But, isn't your save point a bit close? Fang Quan looked at the little black dot in the distance, showed a playful smile, raised his fist and slammed into the sky. No, with one punch, the endless berserk dragon roared against the sky, shattered and exploded the clouds in the sky, and went straight to Strange. Boom, ah, in an instant, a huge amount of fire lighted up in the sky, and the small black spot screamed with smoke, and flew to the distance at an extremely fast speed turning into a spot of light and disappearing. Fang Quan immediately felt much more comfortable. Your master doesn't dare to do anything to me, no matter how big or small, you really owe a lesson to me. After torturing the little rookie, Fang Quan happily started to draw the lottery. Start lottery draw. Pig charm. Active. The power of lasers, the ability to emit lasers in both eyes of the holder. Passive. Can absorb the power of light to strengthen itself. Fang Quan looked at the passive ability, and was taken aback for a while, am I half a superman? Saying that I am a king of darkness, absorbing the power of light is not a bit inconsistent with the style of painting. 
Fang Quan spread out his palms, and saw the surrounding sunlight gathered, and the light particles constantly soaked into the muscles, strengthening the cells. It's not bad, absorbing the power of light during the day and the power of darkness at night, double the joy of lying down and becoming stronger. Fang Quan was very satisfied with the effect, and decided to go back and lie down. Banner touched his bald head with resentment. My lord, did I suffer from an illusion just now? I seem to be touching my own hair. Fang Quan was silent for a millisecond, and whistled, maybe, I don't understand either. You know, magician, you can do anything fancy. There's no way I'm the one who turned you back into baldness. Absolutely impossible. There is no evidence. Eight kilometers away. Strange watched the black-clothed ninjas all around silently returning to the subspace to station, lying on the ground smoking and doubting their lives. Holding two artifacts in hand, an eye of Agamotto and a time gem, and possessing a variety of magic artifacts, he kneels so smoothly. Losing, Ancient One's voice came from behind him, and at the same time a healing spell hit him. Strange's injuries healed quickly, but his expression was extremely sad. Teacher, it hurts too much. The pain in the body is fine, but the pain in the heart is even more tormenting. He hung himself up the whole time, and was hung up and beaten. Seeing his miserable appearance, Ancient One couldn't help laughing out loud, ha 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 ha. How did you think of challenging him? I don't even want to confront him head on, how dare you? Strange reflected on himself painfully. He acted rashly without investigating the information in advance. Facing such a powerful enemy, he should not fight alone, but seek organizational help. Most importantly, if it weren't for the teacher, I'm afraid I should be dead by now. Going out of novice village to challenge the great demon king this time directly reshaped his three views, learned from the painful experience, and will never make this kind of mistake again. As for his fate, Strange knew very well, the great demon king must have shown mercy. He also understands that the current situation is a short-lived peaceful situation formed by a consensus contract reached between the devil and the teacher. Acting rashly by yourself will not only cause disasters, but it is very likely that everyone will be involved in the vortex of war. Thinking of this, Strange couldn't help shivering. If it wasn't for the teacher as the background, the demon king would disdain himself, and he would really have died. Seeing his expression, Ancient One knew that the education effect this time was good. Very good, as long as you have learned something. Strange slowed down and stood up. Teacher, is this devil just letting it go? Is there any way to solve it? Ancient One shook his head. No, this person's situation is fundamentally different from other things. He is the dark lord of the human race, and his interests in major matters are the same as ours. A question mark floated over Strange's head. The overall interests are the same. How is this possible? Ancient One smiled and said. Don't forget, the most important enemy is the evil god of different space, Mephista. He is a problem, but it is definitely not the main problem. Moreover, when facing the invasion of the alien race Mephista, Feng Quan would be very happy to be the first to shoot those guys to death. Quote. Strange's brains turned quickly, and he realized what the problem was. Unless the dark side of our civilization disappears, this world-class demon king will not disappear. From a certain point of view, he is the leader of our civilization. On the other hand, it is also responsible for protecting civilization. In the face of threats from the outside world, I and others are in the same position as the devil. It is also normal that there are contradictions on local issues. Overall, no solution. Ancient One looked at him unexpectedly, you can see clearly. Also, you will be able to obtain the Dark Divine Book and open the eyes of the sky in the future, so you are naturally not a pedantic person. Strange was praised, and he straightened his body slightly proudly. It seems that my future is really awesome. Ancient One smiled. Okay, since you are so eager to fight to prove yourself, I will give you a new task. The Third Army of the Dormammu Empire is preparing to invade the Blue Star, and you need to find the traces of these demons and eradicate them. Get rid of their minions, destroy their invasion rituals, and stop their evil plans. Strange was shocked. I just left Novice Village to accept such a high-level task. No, let's just say, can we have some Trask to practice first? I was just beaten up by a big devil, and now you want me to challenge another dark army. Can we go step by step? Ancient One chuckled and shook his head. 
no one can prepare for life, Strange, you need to face fate. Okay, I'll go. Strange nodded helplessly and accepted the teacher's order. With the time ritual, as long as he doesn't encounter a terrifying world rule level demon king like Fang Quan, he will definitely not have any problems. Strange raised his hand to open the portal, his arm was in severe pain, and his face was distorted by the pain. The last punch of the Demon King must have seriously injured me on purpose. Demon Snake Kado, Necromancer Biro, Beholder Mordo. The three leaders of the Third Army of the Dark Empire have descended on Blue Star, squatting on the streets in the form of human beings, doubting their lives. Demon Snake Kado felt the severe injury in his body, and his face turned pale. I only expected that the cost of the shuttle would be so high, but I didn't expect it to be so big. Ancient One upgraded the defense system of Holy Place to a larger version. One version of one generation of gods, one generation after another was beaten. When traveling to the main world of Blue Star, the three demons were almost beaten to death by the macroscopic domain of Holy Place. Necromancer almost cried. I only knew that the Watch World has Holy Place defenses, but I didn't expect that she could also build three Holy Places in the Mirror World. It's fine to build three wonders in the Watch World, Holy Place, how can you be rich enough to build it in the Mirror World? The spectacle is detrimental to the country. Don't you know how much resources this thing burns? In order to avoid the suppression of the Holy Place in the main world, the three demon leaders took the initiative to drill into the Mirror World. Then he was very honorable and suffered a second beating. The beholder Modo was so angry that his quarrel was full of foam. It's fine if these magicians don't talk about martial arts, but why don't these local people talk about martial arts? Stealing, robbing, and defrauding. It's so unruly. After the three demons were seriously injured, they originally planned to find a place to recuperate and build a portal after a while. As a result, he was extorted, robbed and robbed along the way. Dodden experienced a series of severe beatings in the New Era Society. No wonder they don't know it. It's because these Blue Star people don't talk about martial arts too much. The Beholder Modo bought a mobile phone, and after binding the bank card, he was ready for online payment. He clicked on an incomprehensible link, and in the next second, all the money in the card was transferred, leaving no money left. Necromancer was trembling with anger. Gun. They actually developed a thermal weapon. Originally, when faced with a robbery, Necromancer Beto was the calmest. In terms of strength, other stars. But, never thought of it. This group of people took out hot weapons and fired. They don't follow the rules at all. No matter how powerful Necromancer's magic is, even after a dozen holes were opened in his head by a gun, he couldn't cast magic smoothly. If it weren't for the petrification ability of Demon Snake Kaduo, which turned these ignorant guys into stones, their three powerful dark leaders would be ashamed to the entire dark empire. Although they cannot use dark magic for the time being, their foundation is strong, and no matter how serious the injury is, they can recover with time. The overall experience is, Shuttle was seriously injured, hid in the mirror world and was beaten more severely, and suffered more severe injuries, finally completed the disguise and came to the main world, was robbed and survived, and the injury aggravated again some, now, their money has been cheated out of all kinds of online scams that don't talk about martial arts. Demon Snake Kato held the ice bag and covered Necromancer Beto's head, boss, what should we do now? Necromancer Beto pondered, it takes time to recover, we must devour enough human beings to recover as soon as possible. If they encounter some master level magicians, the three of them will die suddenly and return to the dark universe. The Beholder Modo's eyes were dull, all my money has been cheated. I have been cheated of all my money. I, I knew that the Blue Star people have no conscience. I didn't expect them to be so heartless. 11. The Snake Kado fell into deep thought. It's too risky to do it now, why don't we start from the village? The action is a little smaller. Necromancer nodded and agreed with the plan. Take it step by step first, recover your strength little by little. And when you have enough strength, no matter what you do, it will become very easy. So the question now is, how can we gather a lot of human beings for ourselves to devour? Hello, hello, miss, you look really good, would you like to be a star? A scout dressed more fashionable stood in front of Kado, the devil snake, with his eyes shining and his hands constantly rubbing together. The snake Kado said impatiently, go away, mortal. 
Necromancer Beto stretched out his hand to stop the snake Kado, and asked curiously, Star. What star? The scout saw Necromancer Beto's posture and knew that he had the right to speak, so he hurriedly explained, It's just singing, dancing, and brushing. After packaging and running in our company, with the beauty of this young lady, she will definitely be able to hold a concert with hundreds of thousands of people. The eyes of the three demons suddenly lit up. Necromancer Beto licked his lips. You mean, if she is beautiful enough, she can gather many people. Get their support. The scout saw that there was a play, and hurriedly took out the notebook he carried with him from his arms. Yes, 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 you are foreigners at first glance. At that time, this young lady is in charge of brushing the edges, and you are in charge of writing the script. Understand the script, it's okay, it's very simple, let me give you an example. You just need to pick up the coffee, match it with your foreigner appearance, and shout, our eagle country is really great. Will definitely be sought after by many people. As for you, dot you have a good figure, and you can shoot cross-dressing videos, and if you have some talent, you can also become popular. Quote. The scout was bragging excitedly, and in the blink of an eye, he planned the realization path of the three people. The beholder Moto asked unwillingly, What about the money? How will the money be divided? The scout smiled, Three to seven points, we are seven, you three. Necromancer by Duopi smiled, I came all the way, and I will take this 30%. You kid really don't know who I am. The scout put on a threatening face, I don't think you know Master Downey. Necromancer Beto's eyes looked at the scout's dark power flowing in his pupils, the weak will make choices. I want it all, man, I want, I want money too. The scout was controlled by dark magic, and in a blink of an eye, he became a loyal servant of Necromancer Beto, and turned into a fanatic. Necromancer felt better. This was the first thing that went smoothly after being beaten all the way. Very well, let's focus on training Kato first, and let her become a star, the three harvests of Wolf Wolf. The beholder Moto said unwillingly, hundreds of thousands of people are not enough, at least one million people are needed to restore part of our strength. Necromancer is full of confidence. It seems that no matter how many years have passed, the nature of human lust has not changed. Cardo, you have become a big beauty, Moto, you have become a handsome guy, I want to hide and be behind the scenes the messenger controls the situation. Follow me, boss. In this way, the three demons descending on the Blue Star launched their invasion plan in an unexpected down-to-earth way. A month later, on the international highway, inside a luxury car. Happy drove, Tony sat in the co-pilot, Fang Quan and Banner sat in the rear. There is another car behind their car, and Yin Sen, Luo Di, David and others are sitting in the back. Tony was dancing with excitement. Hey, let me tell you, this girl named Kato is definitely on point. She has a plump and beautiful body, a charming and seductive temperament, and that singing voice. As soon as she debuted, she rushed to the bluebird list. Fang Quan looked at him speechlessly. So you dragged me out to pick up girls. Tony raised his index finger and shook his face proudly. My dear friend, do you want to stay at home to admire beauties? For some beauties, you need to go to the scene to appreciate her dazzling dancing posture and self-confidence. This is what you see on the bed no way. Fang Quan understood, this is still a tasteful old color critic. But for the sake of Tony's kind invitation, and because he really promised to give him a beautiful woman, Fang Quan came here along the way. It is true that I have been staying at home for a long time recently, so Fang Quan should go out to relax. Tony enthusiastically introduced this beauty, boasting that this beauty has never been seen before or since, there is only one in the world, with a hot body, a pure temperament, bright eyes and confidence. Fang Quan's curiosity was also aroused, and he became interested. The bloody eyes of the ghost leader appeared on the back of the chair, and he reported the information ahead to Fang Quan unabashedly, and a picture appeared in everyone's minds. Fang Quan looked forward in surprise. Strange is here too. Tony was curious. Strange. Who? Fang Quan raised his eyebrows. Catch up with the limited edition Lamborghini in front. Happy ordered, stepped on the accelerator to the bottom, and suddenly caught up with the front. The Lamborghini in front sensed that someone was accelerating behind him, turned on the double flashing lights and accelerated suddenly, driving the speed to 300. Happy's eyes changed. I rub, play hard with me. 
Fang Quan's eyes also changed slightly, and the traces of the rabbit spell appeared on the palm of his hand, made, overtake him. Boom, the limited edition luxury car was blessed with magic power, and it soared to 150 in an instant. Lamborghini finally backed down, a brilliant circle of light appeared in the car, and the whole car accelerated instantly, 21. In this way, the originally one-hour journey was shortened to 16 minutes by the continuous acceleration of both sides. In the end, Fang Quan's magic power was even better, and he easily arrived near the concert parking lot first. Fang Quan straightened his neckline confidently, and got out of the car with a slightly disdainful face. There was a brake mark more than 40 meters long on the ground. Ziya ya ya ya. There was a loud brake sound, and the belated Lamborghini stopped in a parking space not far away. Strange's face turned pale, his fingers trembled slightly, he opened the car door and walked down. When he looked up, he saw Fang Quan, and couldn't help cursing with envy, magic is so powerful. You will be fined for speeding. Ah. Before he finished speaking, Strange staggered forward two steps, and vomited directly into the flower bed. Tony staggered down from the car door and struggled to stand up while holding the door. His face was pale, and he raised his fingers and said, I, Tony, have a lot of money, vomit. Next time, vomit. Tell me in advance vomit. Banner didn't say a word, he had already crawled out with hands and feet, and Paula opened beside the flower bed. More than 400, close to the speed of more than 500. If it weren't for the limited instruments, they would never suspect that the car couldn't fly. The back is really a super high-speed ground flight. There are also various drifts. If it wasn't for Fang Quan's magic power that stabilized the situation, they wouldn't be throwing up now, but full of brains. The only person who didn't vomit was Happy, who was protected by Fang Quan's magic power. Fang Quan smiled, and patiently waited for his own people to recover their status with the power of immortality. Soon, Tony and Banner recovered. Seeing this, Strange applied a treatment to himself with trembling hands, bringing his state back. Fang Quan asked curiously, are you also coming to Cardo's concert? Fang Quan looked into the car curiously, but there was no one else. Strange has a sweetheart, and since he is going to succeed Sorcerer Supreme, there is no reason why he would come to this kind of place for entertainment. Strange shook his head. No, I recently discovered that some demonic auras disappeared nearby, so I came here to investigate. Fang Quan nodded, expressing his understanding, and because he was in a good mood, he was willing to explain more, I just came here to meet that beautiful woman with a good figure, so just leave me alone. Strange looked at him speechlessly. As a great devil, you actually do such a boring thing. This is simply a pervert. It doesn't match the strength of you, the big devil who can destroy the world. Fang Quan looked at him like a fool. Do you think I became stronger to have bed with beauties or to destroy the world every day with? Am I sick or are you sick? Is it sick to destroy the world at every turn? You destroyed the world, where do beautiful women come from? Where do darkness and light energy come from? Strange thought about it carefully, and nodded in agreement. If I were at the top, I would also want to live this kind of good life. Please first. With a respectful look on his face, Strange extended his hand politely, motioning for Fang Quan to go first. After discussing with Ancient One, Strange still has a good impression of this principal devil. As for the mess of absorbing people, if you break it down in detail, it is all the grievances and faults of the previous generation, and there is no need for him to intervene. After all, judging from the division of duties of the magician, this is an internal disturbance, not an external enemy. Fang Quan was very satisfied with Strange's attitude. It seems that after experiencing a life and death crisis, Strange's concept has undergone tremendous changes. Fang Quan and his group walked through the VIP passage, and soon came to the first row. Tony showed off. This is the best angle to appreciate this beauty. Let me tell you, this, E.H. What are you looking at? Is there anything good? Tony followed Fang Quan's line of sight to look at the surrounding scene layout, and question marks began to appear on his head. Fang Quan's expression was slightly strange. Do you have an extra ticket? Let Strange sit here. As the king of darkness, the superstar dark energy circulates in his body every day. Fang Quan also passively grasped some knowledge, secrets and taboos that circulated in the energy. 
He just took a glance and found that there was something wrong with the scene arrangement of this concert. Tony smiled brightly. The first row and the second row have already been reserved by me. Happy, go and invite that Mr. Strange. Soon, Strange was sitting on Fang Quan's right-hand side. Fang Quan got straight to the point. The arrangement of this concert is like some kind of ritual that echoes the background noise of the dark universe, not something that the blue stars can arrange. Strange's expression changed slightly, and he quietly released the magician's eye, looking down at the concert scene from the sky, trembling with anger. This is the standard devouring ceremony of the Third Army of the Dormammu Dark Empire, and it can devour them in a way that ordinary people can't detect life and destiny. However, if you look closely, it is infinitely more complicated than the standard ceremony, but it is indeed the standard ceremony arrangement of the Third Army of the Dormammu Dark Empire. Tony was confused. What is the Third Army of the Dark Empire? Isn't this the concert of Kado Beauty? Strange counted, and hurriedly used illusion magic to disguise himself, I hope these demons haven't found me yet. Fang Quan's eyes lit up. So, these demons must be here. Strange nodded. Yes, they must stay near the ceremony to learn. Banner opened his eyes. In other words, these alien demons have perfectly integrated into our society, pretending to be stars to hold concerts, and absorbing our life energy. Strange had a strange expression on his face. Theoretically, it is like this, or all the demons so up to date. A task window popped up in front of Fang Quan. Challenge mission. Defeat the three Mephisto leaders. Task reward. Demon King armor. Fang Quan smiled. Look at the show well, there are three Mephistas here. Strange's face paled instantly. What? Three? Is it too late for me to call the police to the teacher? Am I not in charge of investigating demons? How did you bump into Mephista head on? Or three, let's just say, even though I'm a sorcerer supreme reserve, there's no reason to torture me like this, right? Fang Quan smiled and said nothing, crossed his legs and waited for the concert to start, to see what tricks these demons could play. Strange didn't have any hesitation, so he decisively picked up his mobile phone and called teacher Ancient One. Ever since he got into trouble last time, Strange has realized one thing deeply. If there is a problem, go to the organization, don't make a fool of yourself. You only have one life, don't be kidding. Within a second of the phone connection, Strange described the crisis he encountered. Teacher, I have encountered three clues of Mephista, please pretend to save me. In the next second, a weak wave of mental shielding covered more than 100 cubic kilometers near the concert, and Ancient One disguised herself as an elegant beauty and walked out of the portal. Ancient One was slightly surprised when he saw Fang Quan. Seeing that she was so beautiful, Tony consciously stepped aside and sat aside. Ancient One sat on the left side of Fang Quan, you found it. With the ability of my apprentice, I must not be strong enough to discover the clues of the three Mephistas. Fang Quan nodded. Yes, I found out when I came here to pick up girls. Ancient One frowned subconsciously, but didn't want to say anything more, so he simply kept silent and looked at where the three Mephistas were. Backstage of the concert, the invisible magic circle shrouded the place, making it difficult for outsiders to detect the truth here. Demon Snake Kato's face was ruddy, and his eyes were shining brightly. It's great to be a star, and these lambs are actually delivered to my door, willing to let me eat. Necromancer Biro had an unbelievable expression on his face, crossed his legs, and knocked on the table with his hands. I can't figure it out, it's much more enjoyable than being a devil. This environment is really getting better and better. In the past, they had to threaten and lure. The method is old and easy to spot and target. It's different now, since I put on the skin of a star, even if I make all kinds of anti-human actions, I will be protected by these hardcore fans without thinking, and they will even volunteer themselves. Surprised, this is 10,000 times easier than fighting against the Templars of the last century. A generation of gods, this one is finally our turn. The beholder Modo was also very shocked. Boss, do you dare to think? More than 500,000 people, more than 500,000 people can be gathered in a month to stand willingly in the ritual circle for us to learn. If it were changed to before, even if 10 of you stood in the dark ceremony, you would still be chased and killed by Templar warriors and those righteous heroes. Now, it's easy and you can harvest a lot of social resources. The thing is, many, demons are enough. Humans are so obsessed with star power. 
Necromancer Biro couldn't even close his teeth with a smile. Okay, you will start the ceremony later, and when Kato sings to the end, the effect will be full. Only this wave is needed, and we can recover a lot of strength. The eyes of Demon Snake Kardo are full of greed. Okay, after this ticket is done, we can summon the Dark Portal and gather a part of the army. Coming. The eyes of the three Mephistas are full of longing. Good day. What a day. Miss Cardo, the time is coming. Cardo smiled confidently and stood up, wearing a purple navel bearing outfit, showing off a perfect devil figure. Boss, good news. Necromancer laughed loudly. Okay, even if Ancient One comes in person, with this ceremony, we can still compete with her. Kato smiled charmingly, walked up the steps with a spring breeze, and walked onto the stage. Cardo blew a fiery kiss, winked like silk, and was about to read the opening remarks as usual, his eyes swept across the first row, his voice was instantly stuck, and his body began to tremble slightly. Ancient, ancient, ancient one, Fang, Fang Quan. It's over. It's a trap. Kato was so frightened that his body became weak and he hurriedly sent a mental wave to the backstage, wanting the boss to withdraw quickly. An invisible devil's hand flew past Kato's cheek, bringing a gust of wind and blowing her brown hair, and the mental wave behind her was annihilated by the devil's hand. Kato's pupils shrank sharply, too frightened to move, and looked at the young man in black casual clothes in the middle of the first row. Demon, demon, demon king, it's over, it's over, it's over. Fang Quan had a half-smile put his hand on the side of his face, and looked a little lazy, keep playing music, keep dancing. Invisible's Demon King's hand exuded a destructive aura that only the demon serpent Kato could feel, and it slowly flew to the waist behind her. The devil snake Kato turned pale, not daring to ignore the death crisis behind him, and exhausted his greatest courage in this life, showing his most perfect figure and temperament. To suffer, to suffer, to suffer. Sorcerer Supreme and Demon King are in the audience. When did these people start setting us up? We obviously blast the concealment magic very carefully. Demon Snake Cardo follows the process, and can only hope that the boss and the third child can find out the problem earlier, and don't let all three of them fall here. In the audience, the cheers of the fans surged like waves fanistically shouting for Cardo. 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 Angel Cardo. Wow wow wow. Cardo I love you. It's so beautiful. Cardo, you are the most beautiful. In the first row, Fang Quan admired her figure and smiled, it's really beautiful, but it's a pity that it's fake. In the eyes of his dark king, the camouflage of the magic snake Kato is just like paper. Ancient One snorted coldly. Dirty means, to pretend to be a star to gather people to devour lives. Strange looked backstage, eyes full of astonishment, there are only these three Mephisted teachers here. They used a concealment circle just now. I didn't find out in time. I'm sorry. Ancient One stretched out his hand. You have little experience, it's normal. We'll do it after they consume magic power to start the ceremony. It is good. Ancient One ignored Kato, who was pale on the stage, and began to talk about their background in a low tone. Kato, the devil snake, is a descendant of the ancient Mephista known as Greed and Lust. After inheriting her mother's magic power, he worshipped Dormammu his subordinates serve the ruler of darkness. You need to pay attention, her petrification ability is rule level. Her magic ability and melee combat ability are both excellent, and she is a Mephista with relatively no obvious shortcomings. If you are proficient in mirror image magic, you can restrain her. Quote. Ancient One paused, then said disdainfully, This guy has lived for more than 300 years, and his strength is all in the dog. Every time he invades Blue Star, he is beaten to death by me. Fang Quan expressed his understanding, yes. Ancient One began to introduce the other two, Undead Biro. Also known as the Necromancer, he controls the largest Necromancer army in the Dormammu Empire. He is proficient in the way of death and is a super magic genius. Almost 2000 years ago, he has a very powerful magical power. Ancient One began to snort coldly again, unfortunately, he is not as good as me in magic. Every time, I can still easily crush him. Fang Quan smiled. It is difficult to find a few in the entire universe who can surpass her sorcerer supreme in magic. Seeing Fang Quan's smile, Ancient One looked slightly smug, but soon became serious again. This last one has a lot of background. He is the descendant of the ancient Mephista beholder who transcended time and space. 
This guy's strength is not the strongest, but its foundation is the best. Fang Quan was a little impressed, and raised his eyebrows. An ancient Mephista who can travel through time and space at will, hang and beat the celestial group, and then run away because of impatience. Ancient One said helplessly. Yes, Shumagoras is also protecting the cosmic civilization Waishandi and defending the mortal enemy. M. Fang Quan nodded. It is indeed a bit troublesome. Shumagoras, the ancient Mephista known as the Eternal Beholder who swallowed up hundreds of universes and fell into a deep sleep after being beaten on the ground by the Creator God. And this Beholder is somewhat related to Shumagoras. Ancient One said helplessly. The main reason is that these three guys are immortal, I can only do serious injuries, and I can't completely eradicate them. Behind the demon snake Kado is the greed and lust of the Mephista family, and Necrobiro relies on Dormammu to thrive. The Beholder Modo is quite special. He has a father, Kuigos, who betrayed their creator god Shumagoras. Although his father failed to kill the gods as a filial son, the blood of the Eternal Beholder was still passed on, which became a headache for Ancient One. Because the Eternal Beholder cannot die, the descendants who are related to him also have this characteristic. It can only be destroyed and fall into a deep sleep, but it cannot really die. Fang Quan stroked his chin. If I can capture these three guys, what can you give me in return? Ancient One laughed. I haven't caught these three guys for hundreds of years, what else can you do? You guys are still arrogant after all. Ancient One smiled indifferently and said, If you can catch these three Mephistas, I'll be your subordinate for ten years. Fang Quan smiled and accepted. Ancient One smiled slyly. By the way, I break them one by one every time. If these three guys work together, they can still compete against me for a short time. These three Mephista are not useless, but really have a few brushes. It's just that I was unlucky and met myself, so I kept losing. Fang Quan smiled. You don't know anything about my strength. Ancient One chuckled. No, it's because you don't know anything about Dormammu's dark universe. Even if you control the time, you can't trap these three Mephistas. On the stage, Y Snake Cardo had no choice but to perform the folk dance of the Demon Snake Clan. Behind the stage, Biro, King of the Dead, and Modo, descendant of the ancient evil god, the Eternal Beholder, are immersed in the joy of counting heads. The ghost king Biro and the beholder Modo had bright smiles on their faces, but with Kato's singing, the smiles froze a little bit. Undead king Biro's face froze. She brought the latter song to the front. Does she want to carry out the plan in advance? The beholder Modo's voice is low. The order of the lyrics has also changed. Boss, did you hear that? Biro, the king of dead souls, was thinking while repeating the lyrics that Kato sang just now. The ancient glory, all be to my god. She sang it wrong, this is not the original word of the hymn. Ancient, everything, ancient one, shit, Biro, the king of the undead, suddenly turned seven points pale, realizing what message Kato wanted to convey. The beholder Modo's tentacles tighten slightly. Now she can only rely on singing to convey information, and she also requires planning in advance, and dare not do anything else. Explain that Ancient One is nearby, even off stage. The message she really wants to send is that Ancient One is here. No, she doesn't want us to plan ahead, but the plan has changed, let us find a way to save her. Quote. Undead King Biro gritted his teeth, but she dare not do anything now, which proves that the situation is many times more serious than before. We must be prepared before we do anything. After a month of recovery, Kaduo has regained part of his strength, and it is not a problem to compete against Ancient One for a short time. But now, Indo doesn't even have the thought of fighting. The beholder Modo looked at Biro with a strange expression. Boss, the situation is very serious, what should I do? Undead King Biro took out a green ball from his arms. When you were carrying out the plan, my duplication joined the black hand and collected enough life energy. This life energy is enough for you, me, and the second child. Recover 70% of your strength. Beholder Modo's eyes lit up. Boss is awesome. Biro, the king of the undead, pondered, I didn't just do these things this month. My duplication has already controlled a part of the crowd. If the three of us die, the duplication will control those crowds and blow up their holy place. Quote. The beholder Modo's face was stiff. Boss, the situation isn't so bad, is it? Biro, the king of the dead, shook his head. 
Kado didn't even dare to have a change, which proves that we need to face a more severe battle than last time. Get ready to fight to the death. If you can't fight, you will explode yourself immediately. The second child and I are fighting for time, and I have a third plan. Beholder Moto was curious, what plan? Undead King Biro. You can't know this, I'm afraid that Ancient One will read your thoughts. Well, you start the ceremony quickly. The Beholder Moto didn't dare to say anything, and immediately started a huge dark ceremony. The dark ritual started smoothly, and a neat control panel emerged. The Beholder Moto proudly introduced to Biro. Boss, let me tell you, since the last time, I have improved the ritual template on the basis of the original one. You see here, the lighting and dimming of this area is responsible for showing the efficacy of the ritual in the elemental environment. However, the most interesting thing is here, this piece of life that can show how many personalities there are in the ceremony. For example, if you look at the big red dots and big black dots that are becoming popular now, it proves that there is a powerful righteous god and a powerful demon sitting in the first row, the demon king. Biro, the king of the undead, complained, the improvement is very good, now we can die more clearly. The beholder Modo stared wide-eyed, has a devil king been born in this place? Generation after generation of gods, why are we demons still being beaten? Undead King Biro looked helpless. Very good, now we know why Kato dare not move. A powerful demon king comparable to Ancient One was sitting in the audience admiring Kato's dance. The beholder Moto looked at Biro with wide eyes, and the inquiry in his eyes was clearly visible, Boss, what should we do now? After finishing the calf, I met two big daddies. Biro, the king of dead spirits, took a deep breath, and handed over the life energy ball that had absorbed one-third, suck it, and leave one-third for Kato. What else can I do? Fight hard. The beholder Moto had no choice but to switch the dark ritual to automatic gear, grabbing the life energy ball to absorb it. With Ancient One and this Demon King present, whether this dark ritual will work or not is another matter. Ancient One played with the magic circle with both hands, and with a flick of a finger, a huge magic circle sank into the ground, suppressing the dark ritual below. Fang Quan looked satisfied. What do you think of her dancing posture? Ancient One sighed and rolled his eyes. Can't you see that she is stalling for time and trying to pass on information? The songs she sang are all in a different order from the order on the leaflet. With the wisdom of Biro, the king of the dead, he would definitely know that something went wrong here. Even if undead king Biro guessed that he was sitting in the first row, ancient one would not be surprised. For these masters, one detail is enough to guess a lot of information. Fang Quan looked indifferent. Do I need to care? Even if something happened, the person who died was from the eagle country. What does it have to do with me, an oriental person? By the way, her hot dance is really eye-catching. Quote. Ancient one, I have prepared mirror image magic, and I will release them when they come out. Fang Quan yawned and smiled at Kaduo, it's so boring. Beautiful girl on stage, start fighting after dancing, or I'll crush your head. Kato's voice trembled slightly, and he immediately changed the lyrics a little, so that the boss and the third brother should make more preparations, lest they die prematurely. The strength of this demon king is too terrifying. If you are in your prime, you can still compete against one or two. But now, I can only accept it obediently. The dead king Biro and the beholder Modo behind the stage looked at each other when they heard the lyrics, but in the end they still held back and made full preparations to rescue Kato. Fang Quan looked at the dance in a fairly happy mood, and two hours passed by like this. I have to say that apart from the snake hair of the magic snake Kato, this figure is really hot. At the end of the concert, Ancient One couldn't wait any longer, and directly raised his hand to instantly cover the entire concert site with mirror magic. Under the horrified eyes of everyone, the first member and star Kato disappeared. Mirror World The undead King Biro has turned into a skeleton Mephista, holding a scepter, surrounded by undead knights, undead spells and other undead products. At the moment of the mirror image magic, he didn't do nothing, but took the opportunity to use the scepter to face the magic snake card a little more. Beholder Moto turned into the body, a huge amount of eyeball occupies the huge octopus body, and countless tentacles are floating. The demon snake Kato almost rolled and crawled out of the portal of the undead King Biro, got up in a panic, and turned into the appearance of the snake girl Mephista. The demon snake Kato looked at Fang Quan in horror and despair. 
My God told us to hunt down a demon king, he is the demon king Fang Quan. Biro, the king of the undead, almost gritted his back molars, and looked at Fang Quan in shock, what the hell? Let's hunt down a demon king. My God is crazy, we three Mephistas hunting down a demon king. It's not bad if the devil doesn't chase us. The beholder Modo tried to liven up the atmosphere. Everyone, take a closer look, we have completed the task with our lives. You see, now we are trapped in the mirror world, and we will definitely die without a place to die. Oh oh, I'm going to die, I'm done. Undead King Biro and Demon Snake Kato turned their heads expressionlessly, looking at this zabby teammate. Fang Quan amused. Yes, I like this guy quite a bit. Tell me something that interests me, and I can spare your lives. Beholder Mordo laughed loudly. Did you laugh so hard, you're barking, boom. A huge demon king's giant hand pinched his body, squeezed him hard, and crushed him completely. The bone fire in Biro's eyes fluttered wildly, his hands trembling slightly to maintain the protective magic that was activated instinctively, but the defensive magic on the left side of his body had been crushed by the giant hand of the demon king, and pieces of energy shattered. The wave is falling in the direction of gravity. Lean on lean on. The shot speed is too fast. How did he do it? Demon Snake Kato looked desperately at the crushing of his sand sculpture teammate. Boss, his personality is relatively high. At least taller than the three of us. The corner of undead King Biro's mouth twitched, and he simply dispelled this ineffective defensive magic. Fang Quan, don't be arrogant, we will not really die, I will not say a word to you. The Demon King's giant hand shrank in front of Fang Quan, and slowly opened it, revealing a crushed octopus soul with a spirit body on the verge of breaking, this is the soul of the beholder Mordo. Fang Quan tilted his palm slightly, watching the dying soul roll over in front of him, surprised, it turns out that your soul is not perfect and immortal. The beholder Mordo's body is immortal, but his soul only has a powerful recovery ability, not absolutely immortal. Ancient One looked at his eyelids and said, when did you make such a deadly attack? In the blink of an eye, why did you slap your face in the face? If it were me, if I didn't hold Eye of Agamotto and Time Gem, I'm afraid it would have to be like this. The beholder Moto's soul trembled, and his voice was humble, Great, I, I, I meant to. Fang Quan just felt dull, opened his mouth, and a black light shot out from the mouth, covering the soul of the beholder Moto. Ah, no. Before the beholder Modo finished speaking, he was sucked into Fang Quan's mouth and disappeared completely. Fang Quan hiccuped, spat out a mouthful of black spirit body with ring-shaped eyes, and smashed his mouth, the taste is not bad. The devil snake Kato and the undead king Barros hugged each other tremblingly, not daring to make a sound. It's over. This big daddy is more ruthless than ancient one. According to the original practice, even if the body dies, the soul will be instantly transported to the dark universe to wait for resurrection. But now, the demon king has intercepted the rule of the dark universe, and is holding on to the soul of the eye demon Modo. No matter how strong the resurrection ability is, the beholder Modo can only be resurrected in the belly of the devil, this is no different from waiting to die. Fang Quan asked curiously, what did you want to say just now? Biro, the king of the undead, cried and said tremblingly, Master Demon King, I think you must really want to know the story of my god Dormammu. Fang Quan smiled, I still like your rebellious appearance just now, you recover. Biro, the King of the Dead, wanted to wring his head off. Regret, regret very much, regret coming to Blue Star to take risks in person. Never expected that such a tough guy existed on Blue Star. Biro, the King of Dead Spirits, did not dare to be unruly. He knelt obediently on the ground of the mirror world, looking like an obedient child. Ancient One curled his lips, his enemy who had been fighting for hundreds of years, was actually surrendered by this guy. How embarrassing! Fang Quan looked at Ancient One and motioned for her to interrogate in person. Fang Quan didn't care what these demons wanted to do. G.U., the appearance of walking the process, the purpose of your coming to Blue Star. Biro, the king of the undead took a peek at Fang Quan and swallowed, find the trace of this lord, and then summon my god. Ancient One immediately laughed. Fang Quan, did you hear that Dormammu is going to kill you? What good can Dormammu come to do? At that time, they wanted to kill Fang Quan. That wave cut off the phone should have made Dormammu very angry. 
The corners of Fang Quan's mouth raised slightly, his eyes flickered with murderous intent, and he retracted his previous thoughts, yes, continue. Undead King Biro said hesitantly, Well, if there is time, Lord Sorcerer Supreme, please check the situation of the holy place. Ancient One sensed a bad premonition, and hastily took out his mobile phone to call the guardian magician, What did you do? Biro, the king of the undead, mourned, I have controlled a group of people with magic. If the life signals of my second and third child start to disappear in the main world, they will tie bombs and blow up the holy place. It was supposed to be controllable. But Ancient One came up to reverse the space to the mirror world. Ancient One's face suddenly turned pale, and there was a blind tone on the phone, but no one answered. Ancient One hung up the phone and called Daniel Magician. The call was quickly connected. The voice of Daniel Magician's constant cough came out. Teacher, someone has attacked the holy place with terror. Now everyone has suffered heavy damage. The guardian ceremony has been destroyed and cannot be repaired in a short time. Ancient One can't laugh now. Fang Quan laughed out loud. Your operation is good, multi-threaded operation. Biro, the king of the dead, almost cried, my god should come to this place soon. Without the holy place, Dormammu can descend on the body without any restraint. Ancient One was so angry that he threw out a magic ray, directly hitting the dead King Biro's body, smashing half of his body, cunning villain. Take all precautions, but I was still taken advantage of by these 510 guys. There are indeed powerful Asgardian magicians stationed in the holy place, but there are no powerful weapons stationed there. No matter how strong an Asgardian magician is, he is only a human body, so he can't stop the operation of a life bomb. No matter how strong the holy place is, it cannot withstand the bomb demolition method. Who would have thought that this watch would keep pace with the times? Ancient One was so angry that he directly tore open the space gap in the mirror world, and saw a group of people panicking in the main world. Ancient One's eyes quickly calmed down. These people must be transferred as soon as possible. Fang Quan smiled and watched the excitement. Oh, how do you say it? Ancient One explained helplessly. Dormammu descended by locking the position of the King of the Dead, which is his old habit. Fang Quan smiled slightly and asked. So, if Dormammu feels safe here, he will come here soon. Ancient One looked at him sideways, with a question mark floating above his head, what do you want to do? Fang Quan opened his hand and aimed at Biro, the king of the dead. Biro was directly sucked into his palm, and his neck was tightly grasped. Fang Quan smiled gently, and snapped his fingers with his left hand, transfer all the idlers here. Skull, I will restore you to your full glory. You have to work hard to be a good guiding light. Biro, the king of the undead, trembled all over, feeling the warm palm on his neck. The surface of this palm exudes dense and terrifying energy fluctuations. It feels like your head is being baked in front of a dark sun. Ancient One raised his eyebrows. You want to fight Dormammu? Fang Quan laughed. He wants to kill me, why should I not kill him? A dark mark appeared on Ancient One's forehead, and his smile became more serious. If you are interested, that's really great. For the sake of the Blue Star's beings, she avoided confronting Dormammu every time she fought. Dormammu insulted her every time. No matter how good-mannered she is, if she has endured for hundreds of years, her temper will wear off. When she was young, she fought in the Ten Thousand Realms, how could she have received such anger? Today, I can always get revenge once and for all. Ancient One rolled up his sleeves showing his slender white arms, and dialed the phone number of Asgardian in the mirror world. Listen, throw me the holy place from the mirror world later, fill up the protective formation, and prevent Dormammu from invading Blue Star. Fang, CBFG, asked a question mark on his head, what are you doing? Ancient One smirked, for acting, you need to be full. The holy place in the mirror world cannot fully apply to the space rules of the main world. If Dormammu wants to break through the holy place circle, he must use 30% more power. Fang Quan was startled, and looked at Ancient One with admiration. She really deserves to be an intellectual elder sister who has lived for 800 years. The despicable and shameless vigor of this sinister person is really silky and natural. In the main world, countless black shadow soldiers flew out of the shadows, hugged everyone present, and quickly moved more than a hundred kilometers away. 
More shadow soldiers spread to the surroundings, moving more people to the surroundings, preparing a spacious battlefield for their dark king. Fang Quan walked to the main world holding the neck of the undead king, and used the horse charm to restore his strength to its peak state. Empty empty, the huge death breath exploded, the bones of the dead king exploded, and the cold white magic light shot out from the eye sockets, hitting the sky directly, and the skeleton on the body became extraordinarily white and evil. On the ground, countless skeleton arms struggled to break through the ground, and followed Biro, the king of the dead. In the mirror world, those elite undead who followed the undead King Biro knelt on the ground and shivered, not daring to make the slightest movement. A skeleton arm grabbed Fang Quan's ankle, a skull broke through the ground, roared at him, and opened its mouth to bite Fang Quan's toe. With a sweep of Fang Quan's eyes, the undead skeletons were turned into ashes and annihilated. Undead King Biro struggled and roared in pain, and endless dark energy poured into his body, turning him into a dark signal light that was conspicuous enough in the universe. The devil snake Kato looked at the boss's miserable appearance through the shattered space, trembling. The gap between the devil and Mephista is sometimes bigger than the gap between humans and dogs. Forcibly enter the undead King Biro, like ten dogs played by the devil at will. Dark Universe, Dark Empire Capital Star, Royal City, Throne Hall. Dormammu was practicing on the throne, and suddenly felt the dazzling dark fluctuations coming from the direction of the blue star. He opened his eyes and eagerly looked in the direction of Lan Sheng, and a picture appeared. The energy fluctuations of the undead King Biro swelled wildly on the surface of the Blue Star, and the Holy Place's world guardian Guangfa disappeared in three days. Dormammu laughed happily. Very good. After hundreds of years, Biro finally did something useful. The Third Army did a good job this time, and actually broke the three Holy Places. Knowing that time is not waiting for me, Dormammu immediately leads to the space gap of the Blue Star, bringing the dimension of the Dark Universe closer to the space-time coordinates of the Blue Star in the 616 Universe. Just as the Dark Dimension approached the main world, a huge sacred magic field opened up over the Blue Star again. Dormammu frowned. New World Protection Magic. Ancient One is really tough to chew on. It has been guarded for hundreds of years, and it is a watertight guard. Dormammu hesitated for a moment, but the movement of his hand was not slow, and he continued to push the time and space of the dark dimension to hit him. What if this is a bluff? Ancient One is so cunning that he can't believe it. The dark dimension bumped into it and was bounced away forcefully, causing the space around Dormammu to shake slightly. Dormammu smiled, looking at the slightly cracked sacred magic field, holy place in the mirror world. Ancient One, you are really rich. Dot but that's all for now. Take the holy place of the mirror world to kill the Mephista of my master world. What a dream. The opportunity never comes again. Dormammu strengthens the rule, the energy level of the dark dimension rises, and hits again. The world-class sacred magic field once again bounced off the dark dimension, but this time, dense cracks have begun to appear in the magic field, and the sky above the blue star seems to be splitting open. Blue star. Hearing the exclamation of the people around him, Nick Fury raised his head to look at the sky, his expression changed drastically, what the hell is this? The sky cracked like a mirror, and countless black and purple rays of light emerged from the cracks, reflecting the entire sky in an extremely evil and ominous manner. A detective with a binoculars yelled in horror, and hurriedly patted the chief on the shoulder and handed the binoculars over. Nick Fury took the binoculars, looked at the sky, and opened his mouth wide. Countless weird and evil creatures are swimming in the cracks. The eyes of these evil creatures are particularly aggressive and bloodthirsty, as if they can't wait to come to the world and start killing. Nick Fury felt the blood vessels in his head thumping, and couldn't help but swear. Is this the alien evil magic force that Sorcerer Supreme guards against? Grass. Can't this world be more peaceful? Director. An ultra-high energy burst has been detected, 200 kilometers away near California. When Nick Fury heard the word California, his eyebrows jumped, and he picked up his mobile phone and dialed Fang Quan's number. After several rounds of negotiation, in order to inform Fang Quan Shield of the time to murder him, Fang Quan was interested and asked Tony to order a mobile phone for him. The video call is connected. Nick Fury saw Fang Quan grabbing a writhing, pale, screaming undead skeleton wearing a crown at a glance. The corner of Nick Fury's mouth twitched slightly. Master Fang Quan, may I ask, 
Dot you, ah, is it your handwriting? Fang Quan was in a good mood, and the phone was floating in front of him. Almost, I'm fishing with this undead king, what's the matter? Nick Fury asked cautiously. Then, what do I need to do? Fang Quan glanced at him and saw through his little thoughts. I've moved all the people nearby, as long as they don't die and don't cause mass casualties, just keep your people away from here. Nick Fury laughed dryly. Yes, yes, I must be responsible for the people. Then, will you allow us to watch this battle? Fang Quan was a little impatient, feeling that he was talking too much, so he frowned, sure. Nick Fury left in a hurry. You are busy, so I will leave now. When the video call was hung up, Nick Fury breathed a sigh of relief and straightened his back. On the video call just now, he saw the Ancient One Magician standing aside. He believed in Fang Quan's character. Ancient One Magician, he believed even more. Director, we are now. Nick Fury has a relaxed expression. Evacuate the people here, send some helicopters to broadcast the live broadcast here. Battle Situation Warn those reporters not to disturb the interest of the Great Dark King by crossing the line to die. The high-level agent looked confused. The Great Dark King. Nick Fury sighed. Yeah, such a big shot is great as long as you don't do anything. You still don't understand the twists and turns in it, go ahead and do something. As long as the Dark King doesn't engage in any massacres on a whim, he will burn incense. What? Have higher expectations and requirements for this Dark King. Die laughing. Even the Sorcerer Supreme who guards the world dare not go beyond, how can he dare to have extravagant hopes? Nick Fury suddenly remembered another thing. Go and call the military and the president, don't let them provoke the Dark Lord. I am not afraid of them making troubles, but I am afraid that they will spoil the mood of the Dark King. Nick Fury didn't want to know what would happen to a man who was immortal and powerful enough to make the world's Asgardian Sorcerer Supreme dare not provoke him. Military, secret base. After listening to Nick Fury's phone call, Ross frowned wildly, don't provoke me. Humph. He was not convinced, but he did not dare to provoke Fang Quan anymore. Just one experience was enough to make him feel heartbroken and realize the gap between man and God. But, since the onlookers are allowed, why don't you take a look? Ross ordered, go, send out a helicopter to see the battle here, don't get too close, why? Facing Fang Quan, he still has courage, although not a lot. Magic in the holy place, Asgardian magicians gathered together, looking at the picture in front of them with sad expressions. In the three-dimensional picture displayed in front of him, the holy place in the mirror world has begun to gradually shatter. Hey, it's a bit hasty after all, it's not as easy to use as the one in the main world. The holy place in the mirror world is originally a backup style, and its degree of completion is not as good as the world sanctuary in the main world, which needs to be updated and patched every three years. It's over, the world is going to be destroyed, Dormammu is coming. Some Asgardian magicians sat on the ground holding their heads in pain. These veterans, the magicians who have been on the battlefield with Ancient One know very well how terrifying Dormammu's strength is. If it weren't for the most powerful sorcerer supreme in the multi-universe on Blue Star, any one of the Mephistas under the name of Dormammu would be enough to bring Blue Star no disaster. Every time there is a war, it is G.U., one person who hangs and beats the upper and middle ranks of the Dark Legion, and they are responsible for killing the monsters at the bottom. But even so, the casualties of the magicians in each war are very serious. Dormammu came to Blue Star in person, this is the end of the world. What to do? What does Sorcerer Supreme say? Wong asked urgently. Daniel's expression was particularly painful. The teacher may have arranged it herself. After she asked us to throw out the holy place, she told us not to panic, and hung up the phone. The Asgardians looked at each other, completely unable to understand the words of Sorcerer Supreme. The world is going to be destroyed, how can we not panic? Wong looked indifferent. Okay, do you eat hairy crabs? Daniel looked at him like a lunatic, King. Didn't you hear clearly? Wong shrugged. The world is going to be destroyed, and you still don't allow me to have a good meal. Do you think we can help with this kind of problem? That's Dormammu. In the Dark Universe, the ruler of the Dark Empire, the immortal Dormammu, is the ultimate dream of many Mephistas. This kind of powerhouse can only be suppressed by the Sorcerer Supreme. What are they going up for? To give away heads. 
Long took away the long stick and magic weapon, and waved his hand. I'm going to eat hairy crabs, you guys think carefully about what to do before the world is destroyed. Wang's figure disappeared into the portal. Other Asgardians look at me and I look at you. I was ordered to guard Holy Place, and I haven't been home for 365 days a year. I miss my daughter, sorry, everyone, I'm leaving first. The world is going to be destroyed anyway, so I confess to the girl I like. I just want to go home now and have a good meal with my family. One after another, everyone found a reason to choose to leave. Only Daniel stood where he was, without moving. Daniel, is there anything you want to do? Daniel shook his head. As long as the holy place is here, I will always be the guardian magician. The magicians who were about to leave heard the news and saluted Daniel magician one after another. Master Daniel, please accept our respect. Please also send a signal immediately after encountering difficulties, and we will return to you immediately through the portal. Daniel smiled and waved his hands. Go, go, one person is enough to control the holy place magic, if necessary, I will call you. Many magicians saluted again and opened the portals to leave. Daniel sat in front of the magic console, opened the panel, kept the connection to the best state, and was ready to call everyone to fight at any time. Daniel breathed a sigh of relief, and smiled again, if I had known that today was the end of the world, I should have told my wife that I love her. Before Sorcerer Supreme launched the summoning, no one knew where the battlefield would be. Every time there is a war, the battlefield is created by Sorcerer Supreme, trying not to affect the main world of Blue Star. Die, what Daniel can do is the same as before, believing in the judgment of the Supreme Being. Center of the Concert Venue Fang Quan let go of the undead king, and let him lie on the ground, with cold white strong bone fire gushing from his head, the entire undead had lost his sanity, and the wildness without spirituality released the power of death all over his body. After being used as a guiding light by Fang Quan, the undead king has lost control over his own power, releasing his own energy crazily like a large nuclear reactor. Ancient One leaned over and took a look, grinned, it's a bit of a mess, you're really ruthless. Tisk tisk tisk, meeting a ferocious devil king, this guy is really miserable. Fortunately, Fang Quan belongs to our family. Fang Quan waved his hands casually, and looked at the sky, this is the dark universe. Ancient One looked at the dense black and purple cracks in the sky. Yes, when the three holy places in the mirror world explode, Dormammu will be able to freely invade the blue star. Fang Quan looked at the dark monsters constantly emerging from the cracks, by the way. I think there are a lot of them, can you control them? Ancient One snorted disdainfully. Before I died, Dormammu only dared to end by himself, and did not dare to really start a race war. If he dared to start, I would dare to abandon the human race and live directly in the dark universe. For the sake of his own dark empire, Dormammu himself will restrain his men from doing stupid things. Although Ancient One has been an Asgardian for many years, in the memory of the multi-universe powerhouse, her most dazzling appearance is that of a rebellious, arrogant and rampant super genius who has conquered all worlds. If you dare to risk your life, she will just dare to change houses. Isn't it just extermination, who is afraid of whom? Fang Quan once again looked at Ancient One with admiration, this royal sister still has a lot of face in the multi-universe. Boom, thunder roared continuously in the sky, countless spaces shattered and smashed open, and a huge dark universe was approaching the blue star. Ha 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 ha, Ancient One, after hundreds of years, you are finally going to lose. Dormammu laughed wildly. Originally, I just wanted the help of the Third Army to break a hole and come to Blue Star to teach the young man in black a lesson. Unexpectedly, it is a miracle. The undead king of the Third Army actually prepared such a big surprise for me. Fang Quan clicked his tongue twice, waved his hand, and directly sucked the undead monarch, and then threw it into the sky for General Feying to catch. He was forced to release a huge undead sanctuary to cover it up. Ancient One showed appreciation. Not bad, your operation is really detailed. In this way, even if Dormammu probes very carefully, unless he breaks through the sanctuary of the undead, he cannot perceive the specific details here. Ancient One also released the Supreme Sanctuary very cooperatively, expanding the undead sanctuary continuously. From the outside, it looks like the undead king is using his life to delay living in ancient times. Fang Quan couldn't help but marvel. 
In terms of meanness and shamelessness, you are more elegant. Fine, fine, can this Dormammu be fooled? In the sky, the realm of sacred magic is on the verge of shattering. Dormammu's huge fiery face appeared in front of the biggest crack. Dormammu looked at the undead realm stretched out on the ground in surprise. Like Luo, hold on, don't let her go, let me do it. Biro really worked hard this time, and he must be rewarded well later. Dormammu saw that the demon realm of the undead on the ground was constantly being stretched apart. It looked like it was about to shatter, so the movement of his hand accelerated, and he directly punched out a magic wave to hit the sacred magic world realm, Ancient One, don't even think about escaping. Dormammu eagerly broke through the world domain, tearing open the cracks impatiently and getting out, his huge body hit the ground like a mountain. If I let you run away this time, I will take your surname from now on. Without holy place, let me see where you hide. When Dormammu thought of the scene where Ancient One relied on the blessing of the holy place and kept provoking himself, and he couldn't beat it, he became even more angry. Good fool, you finally showed your dick feet this time. Dormammu is very confident, but also very inflated. He firmly believes that without holy place, Ancient One will be able to score 70 to 30 at worst. Myself, E, this is your blue star as the battlefield, I don't believe Ancient One, you can still release the curse of extinction to beat me. On the ground, a concert. Ancient One held a large space forbidden spell in his hand, and his expression jumped. I prepared a large mirror world as a cage to trap him, as long as he falls, he has nowhere to escape. Fang Quan also showed a nuclear smile. I will use time and space to help you bless him, even if he has eight legs, he can't escape. In the sky, Dormammu's body had already flown out more than a thousand meters, he smashed the remaining confinement in the surrounding sky in surprise, and landed laughing. Dormammu was overjoyed, and praised loudly, Biro, you are really a good. Biro, ha. Huh. Dormammu praised Biro loudly, but he didn't receive any response from Biro's mental fluctuations, and suddenly felt bad, turned around and ran away. Biro is the most loyal subordinate to him in the Third Army, as long as he still has breath, he will never fail to respond to him in battle. What's more, if he is suppressed by Ancient One, he should immediately seek help from himself. However, from the moment he broke through the dimension until he descended, Biro didn't ask for help. This is a trap. Dormammu didn't have any hesitation, and felt that the problem was serious, so he ran away at the speed of light. When the dimension is not broken, the spiritual connection is difficult, which is understandable. But I broke through the dimension and descended, and Biro still hasn't contacted me, there must be a big problem. Ancient One can spare three additional holy places in the mirror world, and there is no guarantee that she will prepare other deceiving spells. This is not right, let's discuss it in the long run. On the ground, the center of the concert venue. Fang Quan looked strange. This Dormammu still has a bit of cleverness, although not much. After all, it is an old monster that has lived for thousands of years, and its control over details is invincible. I will ignore some small problems because of my impatience, but I will never make any stupid big mistakes. Ancient One watched Dormammu fly to the dark universe with regret. It's a pity, such opportunities are rare. Fang Quan sneered. I'll go up and catch him, you release the forbidden spell. Hit me too. Ancient One's eyelids twitched when he heard it. Can it work? Are you afraid of being sealed together? Fang Quan directly set off and flew into the sky. If you want to hit you, hit it. Fang Quan's coercion soared rapidly, and his body was filled with the evil light of the Devil King. During the flight, he left behind a long dark magic light. When Fang Quan flew into the air, Dormammu had already flown back 800 meters in an instant, leaving only about 200 meters away from the dark universe. Fang Quan sneered, and the avoidance charm and the chicken charm appeared in the left and right eyes respectively. The divine power of the two spells exploded, and the time and space of everything around suddenly became extremely slow, and even stagnated. Dormammu's figure in the sky was affected by the force of time and space, and his speed dropped sharply, but he is an eternal level powerhouse after all, only his body was affected, and his mind only reacted in a short moment. Shrinking suddenly. Time and space force. Marred. I knew Ancient One was up to no good. Dormammu cursed in his heart, his hands were not slow, and hurriedly put on protective magic and abnormal state resistance blessings on himself. Boom. Dormammu didn't even have time to see clearly. 
he felt the dark protection spell on his chest shattered, his chest hurt sharply, and he fell to the ground with a huge force. Dormammu looked up at the sky, his pupils shrank sharply, Fang Quan. This guy is a demon king class. How can that be? Dormammu's face was horrified, he never thought that he would meet a devil level powerhouse whose strength surpassed his own. Dormammu knows that Fang Quan's strength is not simple, simple. Blue Star, a big ass indigenous civilization, actually has a phoenix chick called Ancient One, and a crouching dragon like Fang Quan. What do you make those god level civilizations think? Dormammu felt the fluctuation of the huge space forbidden spell from the ground, and he tried his best to expand his body, turning into a giant of more than 100 meters in the blink of an eye. Entering the super giant state, I should be able to resist a wave. As long as you resist Ancient One's forbidden space curse, you. Dormammu watched in shock as the demon king Fang Quan chased after him with an evil smile, the phantom of a magic dragon was condensed on his fist, and the clothes on his upper body were shattered, revealing the lean and muscular body of a perfect handsome man. Are you crazy? You hit me. I can understand. Are you so blind that you can't see that Ancient One is casting a forbidden spell on me? Are you using your life as a pawn for Ancient One? Fang Quan stepped directly on Dormammu huge amounts of forehead, and his fists dropped rapidly. A large part of Dormammu's forehead was sunken in an instant, and his skin rolled violently like waves, and some wave crests could even be tens of meters high. The phantom of the magic dragon pierced through his forehead and entered Dormammu's brain, crushing all the prevention and control methods he was about to release. Dormammu was furious in disbelief. You don't want to die. After receiving such a heavy blow, Dormammu was completely unable to release any magic in just a moment. I have fought with the Eternal Class, but I have never seen the Eternal Class fighting directly for life. Dormammu desperately saw the curse of space flying up behind him, and the time and space around him were shattering and distorting. The mirror world prepared by Ancient One was smashing and cutting the time and space of the main world, enveloping him and the demon King Fang Quan on his forehead. Live. While the time and space of the main world were shattered and cut, Dormammu's body was also pierced by these shattered time and space fragments. The dark body was pierced by countless transparent time and space fragments like a rag doll. Dormammu couldn't help spitting out a mouthful of blood, and was forced to release the super giant form, his body shrank rapidly, he looked desperately at the Fang Quan demon king floating above him, what are you trying to do? Exclamation mark question mark quote. Aren't you afraid that Ancient One will also cast an eternal seal on you? Even if he won't die in a short period of time, being trapped in such a broken time and space, he doesn't know that he will have to be sealed for thousands of years before he can see the light of day again. Countless fragments of time and space collided with Fang Quan's stalwart body, and were shattered by the passive position of the powerful demon soul. The time-space fragments burst on the surface of Fang Quan's body like breaking waves, blooming with brilliant brilliance. Fang Quan sneered lightly, his eyes full of disdain. Dormammu's eyes widened to the maximum, he couldn't believe it, the temporal demon king. He is actually the demon king who has completely mastered time and space. Why does this kind of demon lord cooperate with Ancient One? Dormammu smashed into the ground of the mirror world with a, boom, making a big hole, and the ground roared. Dormammu flew out of the deep pit in disbelief, and turned into a human height form, looking at Fang Quan in horror, why did you help Ancient One? Looking at the big picture, shouldn't we be on the same side in front of the world as guardians like Ancient One? Why do you want to help the righteous Ancient One? We are civil war, don't we have to kill Ancient One first? Dormammu looked at Fang Quan in midair, his face was full of shock and bewilderment, and he couldn't fully understand the current situation. I was captured by the time-space demon king and sorcerer supreme Ancient One together. Depend on. Dormammu didn't have time to think about it, the dark magic power in his body burned wildly, exerting pressure on the surrounding time and space desperately, looking for the key to breaking the game. A burst of coercion swept across, and Dormammu's face was completely stiff. The only place where there is a flaw in the forbidden spell in the entire space is behind King Fang Yuan. Because when the space curse was swept over, Fang Quan Demon King completely invalidated the swept space curse because of his strong personality and resistance. Although the curse made up for itself later, compared to the whole, here an area of weak energy has been formed. Dormammu was uncertain for a while, 
His face changed, and he could only silently re-establish the connection with the Dark Empire in his body. By now, the mirror world has been completely formed. This is a world that is exactly the same as the main world, but there is no life here, only a perfect reproduction on the level of the physical world. Ancient One flew to Fang Quan's side, grasped it with his left hand, pulled out a magic weapon from the void, and looked at Fang Quan unexpectedly, why can you perfectly resist the curse of space? She was shocked by Fang Quan's performance just now. To be able to master such a perfect time and space force, and to forcibly catch the aftermath of his own space curse without being hurt. Dormammu was forced to shrink his body in order to reduce the damage, and now he was looking for a breakthrough while rolling his eyes on the ground. Fang Quan was indifferent and disdainful throughout the whole process, singled out and suppressed Dormammu abruptly, and this incomparably powerful resistance made her feel extremely curious. Fang Quan didn't speak, but looked at the task panel facing, 960. The mission is completed, congratulations to the host for obtaining the Demon Lord armor. Devil King armor. The devil's armor that changes with the strength of the host, and can change with the devil's mind. Challenge mission. Dormammu, who is seriously injured and immortal. Task reward. Number of draws plus one. Fang Quan raised his eyebrows, feeling amused. The Demon King armor in the original world, is a set of armor that can greatly enhance the strength of the host. Even if it is worn by a mortal, it can resist the attacks of the eight great demons. However, for me, the biggest function of this set of battle armor is that after I put it on, I don't need to ask ghost soldiers to change my clothes after fighting. Fang Quan decisively changed into the demon lord armor. A jet black domineering king's armor emerged, and it was put on Fang Quan's body out of thin air, covering his whole body. Even his head was protected by a closed devil's helmet. As for the serious injury to Dormammu, it's easy to say. Fang Quan looked at Dormammu on the ground with slightly unfriendly eyes. Dormammu swallowed. Fang Quan, we don't need a civil war, as long as we kill Ancient One, the Milky Way and the vast territory of the 616 main universe can be usurped. Although Sorcerer Supreme is only responsible for protecting the Blue Star Civilization, because of her deterrent name, no alien civilization dares to invade the Milky Way, and powerful superpowers from other universes dare not go to the 616 universe to act recklessly. Because Ancient One would literally blow their heads off. From another point of view, as long as Ancient One can be killed, a large area of the 616 universe master universe can be owned by them. Fang Quan sneered. Are you teaching me how to do things? Dormammu's eyes widened and he was choked up, completely unable to understand this guy's brain circuit. Ancient One stepped back two or three meters cautiously, looking at Fang Quan who was wearing the armor, his eyebrows tingled slightly, your armor is not simple. After Fang Quan put on the armor, he carried the aura of a king all over his body, making people unconsciously afraid that he must keep a certain distance to weaken this terrifying coercion. Fang Quan didn't bother to pay attention to her praise. You said, if I use infinite light power to suppress him, can I seriously hurt him? Ancient One was amused. You are a dark king, where can you find so many light forces? Do you think you are the sun? Do you know how much light force it takes to suppress Dormammu? Seriously injured, this is really a novel concept for the eternal strong. In the level of the eternal strong, Except for those who are tired of life and give up their lives, no one will be seriously injured easily. Fang Quan glanced at her coldly. Ancient One hastily restrained his laughter, and explained sternly, in theory, it is possible. But the biggest problem now is that he has re-established the connection with the dark universe within three seconds, unless you can use more than his unlimited energy suppression at the speed of absorbing energy. When Ancient One strengthened the mirror world, Dormammu did not do nothing, but was ready to go. Fang Quan got a satisfactory answer, and moved his wrist, you give me support, I want to play. Dormammu is a better test than Hulk. Ancient One was stunned, but did not object. He chose to be an assistant, giving Fang Quan status blessings, and releasing various curses and negative magic to Dormammu. Anyway, Dormammu has fallen into the trap, and he can't make any waves for the time being. Dormammu felt that his own strength was not enough, and he was so angry that his liver hurt. If he had known this situation, he should have been more cautious. The despicable and shameless Ancient One actually filled the King of the Dead with dark energy and led himself to misjudge. 
Seeing Fang Quan rushing down, Dormammu was so angry that his nose was almost crooked, and the evil flames on his body exploded. Fang Quan, don't think you are the Devil King, I'm afraid of you. I don't care about the time system. As for space magic, I have fought with the Ancient One for hundreds of years, and I have long been familiar with it. If we really want to fight seriously, we may not know who will take advantage. Fang Quan flew into the air, with an evil smile on the corner of his mouth, traces of pig charms appeared in his eyes, and the dark magic light on his body instantly transformed into a holy righteousness. As we all know, the active ability of the pig charm is laser light, and the passive ability is to absorb the power of light. The magic power of the spell, originally is the third of the righteous demon. Dormammu was full of energy, when he saw that the falling demon king had turned into the lord of the holy sun, his whole body exploded, and he propped up a round dark wall in extreme fear. Ancient one in midair saw his eyelids twitch wildly. In the blink of an eye, the Fang Quan demon king became the Fang Quan holy sun lord. Ancient one looked at Fang Quan, who was covered in gold and exuded infinite radiant power, and hit the ground like a little sun. Boom, the mirror world trembled violently, countless space debris exploded, and the power shockwave even rushed to the main world, blowing small solar hurricanes in the main world. The corner of Ancient One's mouth twitched, maintaining the stability of the mirror world, his face was as awkward as he wanted, isn't he the devil? Or is it that the current demon king has evolved to become a sun god? Water Zephic, the ground was blasted into a deep pit of magma by the aftermath of a small sun. Fang Quan was standing on top of the magma, looking evilly at Dormammu, whose body was made of dark flames in the magma. Dormammu was hammered into the magma, forced to taste the saltiness, struggled to climb to the surface of the magma, looked up at the radiant Fang Quan above him, and the whole library was in despair. Made, these righteous gods are too despicable and shameless. They actually went undercover and became the devil king. Sun God, the more self-styled bright and righteous guy, the more shameless and despicable. Standing above, Fang Quan glanced at Dormammu's inner body, slightly surprised, interesting, it can recover all injuries within two seconds. It has to be said that Dormammu still has two brushes to become the ruler of the Dark Empire. An interested smile appeared on Fang Quan's face, and his fists made a cracking sound, it's fun this way, and it won't be easy to be beaten to death. In the sky, Ancient One stretched out his hands, trying to expand the envelope of the mirror world, enhance the overall stability, and prevent Dormammu from escaping. And Dormammu on the ground propped up the dark shield with eyes full of fear, ready to accept the bombing of the sun god again. Fang Quan smiled kindly, his eyes flashed with lightning in an instant, and two thick thunder lasers shot at Dormammu, who was helpless and helpless on the ground, who would only be beaten. Boom boom boom. The earth was rapidly melted by the thunder laser, the magma melted and evaporated, and the magma pit was also expanding rapidly. Dormammu passively endured the suppression of the thunder laser, and the dark flames on his body made crackling sounds, like roasting meat. Hiding behind the dark shield, Dormammu cried out in grief, Fang Quan, Ancient One, I will definitely take revenge on you. Ancient One laughed, and while maintaining the stability of the mirror world, he laughed at the same time, you escape from Fang Quan's torture first, then we will talk about it. Fang Quan smiled kindly, killing Dormammu with great interest. Main World, the core teleportation place of the magic holy place. Daniel Magician has seen everything that happened in the mirror world through the global magic monitoring panel, and his face was horrified, who is this? How could anyone be stronger than Sorcerer Supreme? To be able to master such a powerful justice magic, could it be some righteous god? Or simply the successor of the righteous god? When Daniel was shocked, he did not forget to spread the video to the internet for everyone to watch. Soon, all justice sees this battle that shocks the world. A large area of the ground was melted into magma, and the magma flowed around exuding terrifying heat. The Lord of Darkness, Dormammu, was suppressed in the deep magma pit by a godlike man wearing the armor of the King of Light with a thunder laser. The Dark God, who once had infinite power and prestige on the battlefield of another dimension, suppressed the gods, and was as huge as a mountain, was beaten like a dog in the water at this moment. And the role of their great sorcerer supreme in this battle is to obediently maintain the existence of the mirror world and prevent the main world from being affected by this battle. But in this mirror world, the celestial phenomena have been tampered with by the terrifying light force, 
the earth is rapidly turning into billowing magma, and the weather is also turning into a terrifying heat wave. Everything on the ground in the distance is ignited by this terrifying heat wave, and the whole world has rapidly become a magma world. Wong, a battle of this level, even if we get close, I'm afraid we will all be evaporated in an instant. I understand the truth, so, the end of the world was prevented by a righteous god. Excuse me, who knows this righteous god? This strength is really too strong. He is simply a strong man in mythology. Could it be the righteous god summoned by Sorcerer Supreme through Waishandi? It's really too strong. No one knows who the man in the armor of the Lord of Light is, but everyone is shocked to see the man in the armor of the Lord of Light crush Dormammu, the mighty Lord of Darkness. All righteous magicians began to pray that this righteous god would end this end of the world. The main world, the sky above the concert venue. Nick Fury was sitting on the helicopter, looking at the picture from the front drone, his head was buzzing, if I am not blind, then everything I see now is real, not a phantom. Beside him, sat an oriental magician, Jill Magician who came to station in Kamar Taj. Sweat broke out slightly on Jill Magician's forehead, if you think it's a phantom, you can let a drone approach the high temperature rock splashed from the gap in the mirror world. Pulp, I think you'll know if it's true. Nick Fury shrugged. I was just joking. So, where is Master Fang Quan? Jill Magician was silent for a while, feeling the protection spell given to him by Sorcerer Supreme when he started, and after some thinking, he said with some uncertainty, Do you think that spirit wearing the armor of the King of Light, could it be Lord Fang Quan? Jill Magician's entry-level protection spell is the prediction-type protection of the Sorcerer Supreme Gift, which has a super boost in intuition. Nick Fury laughed. Are you kidding, isn't he the Dark Lord? Jill Magician had a miserable look on his face, and he didn't want to believe his energy prediction perception feedback, and his expression was inexplicably awkward. The smile on Nick Fury's face disappeared, and the muscles on his face began to tremble, isn't it a joke? Jill Magician nodded sadly. That's what the magic feedback says. Nick Fury, did I hit my head on the door today? At this glance, he was full of righteousness, and the strong man who seemed to be a savior was actually Fang Quan, the King of Darkness. That's even more outrageous than that guy Tony is married to. Not far from Nick Fury, on a military combat helicopter, Ross was also watching in person, with a heavy expression on his face. The civilization technology on the magic side is no worse than that on the technology side. Look at this individual combat ability, one person is more outrageous than a nuclear bomb silo. Both eyes fired lasers, and the climate of an entire area was permanently altered. Countless magma spewed out from the broken gaps in the mirror world, igniting the entire concert venue and turning it into a sea of flames. On top of this sea of flames, storms of solar wind and flames formed, roaring, roaring and revolving around the concert, constantly tearing apart everything around them, and igniting everything around them. Rose pursed his lips, and his white beard squirmed, it is necessary to reach a cooperative relationship with Sorcerer Supreme. I need this magical power to complete the duty of protecting the Eagle Kingdom. If the power of magic is used properly, his super soldier plan will become smoother. After Bronski's death Ross still has the ability to transform into Hong Haoshu. But after he had seen Fang Quan's power, he didn't have enough confidence in the Red Hulk's power. I need more power, whatever it is. Rose's eyes flashed with unscrupulous ferocity. At the moment, the situation here in the main world concert is very dangerous, ordinary people can no longer get close to this place, and this place has become a literal restricted area for human beings. The solar wind, flames, and hurricanes are spinning around, and the high temperature of more than 1000 degrees is sprayed out from the broken gaps in the unknown space at any time, covering the ground. And not far away, there were even reporters sitting in a helicopter and broadcasting this horrifying scene to the audience. In everyone's shock, disbelief, and panic. In the mirror world, Fang Quan stopped the magic power of the pig charm, and observed Dormammu, who was suppressed by lasers in the magma pool and could only whimper weakly. Dormammu floated on the surface of the magma pool, the dark flames all over his body became much dimmer, and his breath became weak. But after a breath, the dark flames on Dormammu's body gradually recovered and began to become a little alive. Dormammu had a chance to breathe, and soaked in the magma pool in fear, not daring to make the slightest movement, and desperately squeezed the dark passage in his body to restore his strength. 
Dormammu looked at Fang Quan in midair with extreme fear. Currently, he was restrained by attributes, and his energy level was also restrained. It's not that he doesn't want to resist, but just defending consumes too much power. If you want to resist, you have to give up part of your defense to attack. How should I put it, it might be better to die by then. Dormammu didn't even dare to beg for mercy, for fear that his origin would be cut off and suffer more serious losses. Fang Quan clicked his tongue. I have to say, Dormammu really deserves to be the Lord of Darkness, look, I burned this place into a magma world, and this guy is still alive and panting. It has to be said that immortal enemies are difficult to deal with. Winning a fight is winning a fight, and it is indeed difficult to get seriously injured. Ancient One wiped the sweat from his forehead, and generally stabilized the mirror world. As for some small space cracks, feel free to do so. Ancient One breathed out, feeling the heat wave air that had been burned to hundreds of degrees, and said helplessly, indeed, in terms of energy, you can consume him to death. But his immortality is very strong, even if he is seriously injured, it will take it will take a while. Fang Quan stroked his chin and smiled playfully. I mean, if you introduce the power of the sun, can you bear it here? Ancient One looked at him in shock and horror. Are you trying to set the whole world on fire? The power of the sun capable of suppressing Dormammu, do you think my little ragged mirror world can take it? If you play casually, you have permanently changed the landforms of the main world. Stronger pressure, do you think the surface of Blue Star can withstand it? He is Dormammu, the Lord of Darkness, not Dormammu, the Dark Lemur. Dormammu also looked at Fang Quan in horror, you can't do this. If I die on Blue Star, half of the Blue Star's landscape will be changed. Unbeatable in terms of strength, Dormammu can only try to reason. Humble, weak, and helpless master of darkness. JPG. Fang Quan didn't bother to pay attention to Dormammu at all, he only had the task in his eyes. You open a portal directly to the sun, I'll play. W. The corner of Ancient One's mouth twitched. Are you serious? Fang Quan looked at the terrified Dormammu, smiled and said kindly, If you are told to drive, you will drive. Ancient One definitely has this ability, decisively opened the portal thousands of kilometers away from the sun in midair. Fang Quan has already demonstrated his formidable strength, there is no need to question how powerful this super idiot really is. Fang Quan smiled faintly at Dormammu. With your strength, you must be able to withstand the energy fusion effect of the sun's energy 330,000 times heavier than the blue star. His face turned blue, and he detonated all the power in his body recklessly, madman. I won't succeed. Death is just a temporary problem for him, after a while, he will recover from the darkness again. But if he is thrown into the sun, this state of being seriously injured and unable to die temporarily will become his eternal cage. Fang Quan smiled coldly, and appeared in front of Dormammu in an instant, with the shadow of the purple magic free spell reflected in his eyes. The space-time power was exerted by Fang Quan, and everything around him became stagnant, as if the pause button was pressed. Dormammu's mouth turned into a fake, his pupils slowly contracted, the horror on his face almost exploded, and the dark flames on his body became violent and intense. As the master of darkness, he is time-resistant. But, for something like resistance, you also have to look at the opponent's time-space pressure. When the space force is strong enough to a certain extent, the resistance thing can also be pierced. Dormammu has time-resistance, but now he knows that his own resistance is not enough in front of Fang Quan, the Holy Sun Lord. Fang Quan ignored the raging dark flames on his body, grabbed his neck and flew towards the portal in the sky. Ancient One's eyes moved slightly, and her body glowed with a dark green light. Her movements were normal, but there was a slight sweat on her forehead. You'd better hurry up, maintain the portal that transmits you too, the pressure is very high. Big. Especially if one of the parties is not willing to cooperate. Fang Quan was too lazy to talk nonsense, and went directly through the portal to the center of the solar system, near the sun. Huge amounts of Liyong occupy 99.86% of the mass of the entire solar system, and nuclear fusion effects occur every moment. Dormammu's body began to crack, and the black and purple magic light inside slowly sprayed out. His eyes were terrified and desperate, and he beat Fang Quan's arm armor with both hands. Countless dark magic waves bombarded the Light King's armor. Terrifying energy fluctuations erupted, 
slightly distorting the surrounding space. Fang Quan chuckled. Dormammu, remember this lesson, don't mess with me next time. Dormammu's eyes were full of terror, but there was still a glimmer of hope in his heart. If he moves fast enough after being thrown out, he might be able to teleport back to the dark universe. Even if the other end is affected by the power of the sun, as long as you can survive, it is more important than anything else. Fang Quan didn't bother to talk nonsense, and directly grabbed Dormammu and rushed towards the sun. Dormammu opened his mouth to the maximum, his pupils trembled, are you so crazy? This is a one-for-one one desperate play. You are the lord of the holy sun, you can't play like this. You really think the sun is your home? Fang Quan laughed loudly, ignoring the fact that the demon king's armor on his body had started to turn red, and grabbed Dormammu and rushed towards the sun at high speed. The dark power on Dormammu's body was quickly weakened by the power of the sun, he gritted his teeth, raised his hand and cut his neck with a knife. Puff! The blood of darkness splashed all over Fang Quan, and Dormammu's head was separated from his body. His head desperately started to activate the teleportation magic, even if he only had one head left alive, it would be better than throwing it in the sun and boiling it for five billion years. An invisible wave swept through all the time and space nearby, and Dormammu's teleportation magic was suppressed by the overbearing and completely unreasonable space-time force. The most unpretentious method is often the most effective. Dormammu looked desperately at the dark formation in front of him being violently crushed, turning into dark afterglow, flickering and splashing in space. Huge amounts of the Demon King's hand grabbed his head and body together, Fang Quan laughed and accompanied him to rush towards the sun. Dormammu integrated with his body desperately, slapping the hand of the devil with both hands, watching him getting closer and closer to the sun. When the distance was close enough, the gravitational force of the sun had firmly grasped the Demon King's hand, preventing him from escaping. Fang Quan stood on the edge of the gravitational critical line, smiled and waved towards Dormammu, and then detonated the Demon King's hand. The Daedric hand explodes, sending the desperate Dormammu toward the sun. At this moment, Dormammu, even if he could absorb energy from the dark universe, could no longer escape the sanction of the power of the sun, and fell into the sun with a mournful roar. In the vast solar storm, a small black spot fell into the surface of the sun, exploded into a mass of dark sparks, and then was covered by the solar fire wave and disappeared. Facts have proved that even the mighty Dark Lord cannot ignore the power of a whole sun. The task is completed, congratulations to the host for winning the lucky draw once. Fang Quan is in a very good mood at the moment, the passive of the pig charm is working, constantly absorbing the power from the sun to make his body stronger. Interesting, it seems that I can often bask in the sun in the future. Who said that becoming stronger requires practice, lying down and basking in the sun is also a way to become stronger. Rat charm, active, the power of life, which can give life to inanimate things. Ability to give motion to still life. Passive, creation of life power. Fang Quan's eyelids twitched, create the power of life. This is actually the original power of the rat charm, really powerful. If we say that among all the powers, Fang Quan thinks the greatest power is the creation of life. Because creating life is the eternal miracle in this universe. Destruction is always easier than creation, and only creation can constantly create life. Seeing the original power of the rat charm, Fang Quan immediately thought of the monkey charm, the monkey charm is life change. If combined with the power of the monkey charm, I will be able to obtain a more perfect power of life. In other words, it can exert the power of life power to a stronger level. In the Marvel Universe, the gods who can create life are often the gods who are widely worshipped and respected. This is really face-saving. It's so cool, when I'm interested, I'll get a race up and down, and I'll summon the god of creation. Fang Quan glanced at the surface of the sun, seeing that Dormammu was in a state between life and death, he hummed lightly, and directly returned to the portal when he came back. After Fang Quan flew into the portal, a powerful dark wave erupted on the surface of the sun. Fang Quan, Ancient One. The roar of hatred briefly overwhelmed the power of the sun, but was quickly suppressed by the surging power of the sun. Fang Quan returned to Blue Star with a happy expression and a slightly raised voice, not bad, a comfortable battle. Ancient One looked at the mirror world that had turned into billowing magma, and sighed helplessly, an ordinary place really can't bear your power. This guy is really strong and crazy. 
Especially the operation of grabbing Dormammu and rushing towards the sun made Ancient One tremble with fear. Even after becoming the Sorcerer Supreme of the Multi-Universe, Ancient One still admires this kind of dark demon king who directly opposes the sun. This is really fatal. Fang Quan moved his wrist. How long do you think it will take Dormammu to get out of trouble? Ancient One pinched his fingers and calculated. If he is ruthless, he will be able to get out of trouble after a while at the cost of sacrificing the lives of the powerhouses of the Dark Empire. However, the only thing that is certain is that within a short period of time, he will not dare to come to Blue Star again, let alone provoke you again. If I were to be replaced by Dormammu, I would have to have a psychological shadow. After landing on Blue Star, not only did he not take any advantage, he was also beaten unilaterally for a long time, and finally he was grabbed by the neck and thrown into the sun by himself. For the immortal Dormammu, he actually doesn't have many choices now. So he ended his life and was resurrected in the dark universe. But the cost of doing so is extremely high, and it may take a long time or an energy cost. Either wait for his subordinates to save him, the price of is that the Dark Empire will fall into a weak state for a period of time in the future, and he needs to wait until his subordinates are resurrected. Fang Quan doesn't care about this, anyway, I'm already happy, it doesn't matter. If Dormammu admits to being cowardly, then go for it. If you don't admit it, then the fun will come. Fang Quan suddenly thought of the portal magic just now, didn't you say you want to give me the magic book? Ancient One. Ah, I'm picking, what, do you want to learn some magic? She didn't forget about it, but she needed to choose carefully about it. It's not because he's afraid that Fang Quan will learn something he shouldn't, but because of Fang Quan's temperament, if some books are sent to him, he will definitely not be able to read them. Fang Quan. The portal. Ancient One looked at him speechlessly. You have mastered the power of time and space, you can't teleport. Isn't this the basis of space-time force? Fang Quan clicked his tongue. What I have mastered is dark teleportation, which is different from your fancy ones. This thing is easier to use when traveling through dimensions, but it is not so easy to use in some situations. For example, open a portal directly to the sun this is a dark zone, and there is no way to travel through the dark. Ancient One, if you say my magic is fancy, believe it or not, I'll screw your head off. You are amazing with your strength. Ancient One cursed and took out a sling ring from the space and threw it over. This is a sling ring, you should go back and familiarize yourself with it. Tomorrow, related magic books will be delivered to your dark palace. Fang Quan accepted it with satisfaction. Ancient One watched the magma world in front of him gradually cool down, with a pensive look on his face. Fang Quan was in a good mood, seeing her expression, curious, what? Ancient One frowned slightly. I've been curious about one thing recently. Oh, what? Ancient One looked at Fang Quan seriously. The future I see, is it what I see, or what you want me to see? Fang Quan raised his eyebrows. Why did you say that? Ancient One's words came to his lips, and finally used a tactful way. After you said it, I did predict the Thanos crisis. However, I also predicted your things. But after that, I had a dream. Quote, Zero. Ancient One paused, and said, I dreamed of a universe that you haven't appeared in. This is implying that Fang Quan is not a life form in this universe. The original fate of time and space has been influenced and tampered with by Fang Quan. Fang Quan smiled. Don't be so euphemistic, I am indeed an outsider. Any prophecy you see related to me should be a picture that has been affected, not the result of your real prophecy. Willing. Quote. Once he has mastered the power of time and space, he will definitely leave waves in time and space, affecting anyone who tries to prophesy himself. Ancient One looked deeply at Fang Quan with complicated eyes. What I predicted before may not necessarily be true. In other words, it can only be relatively true. Fang Quan didn't bother to pay attention to what Ancient One thought, and directly used the dark shuttle to return to his big villa. Seeing him leave, Ancient One sighed. I hope this matter will have a good result. Prophecy is not everything. At least for now, Fang Quan is on the standpoint of human civilization in the overall situation. Ancient One looked at the tumbling magma world under his feet, raised his hands, completely sealed the surrounding time and space, isolated it from the main world, and then adjusted the spatial dimension. Let this mirror world not become a legacy problem in a short time. 
After solving the problem of the mirror world, Ancient One returned to the concert venue in the main world. Looking at the surrounding solar wind burning tornadoes and the ground that had turned into a sea of flames, they had to cast magic again to restore the place to its previous appearance. If these problems are not solved, the effect of these permanently changed abnormal climates will exert an influence on the entire planetary ecological chain, causing certain problems. For example, the birth of elemental creatures, or the attraction of life forms from other dimensions. While solving the problem, Ancient One held the phone around his neck and called Daniel Magician. Okay, the problem has been perfectly solved, and Dormammu will not come to Blue Star again in a short time. Hurry up and fix holy place. As you order, Sorcerer Supreme. Ancient One looked at the helicopters circling in the sky, raised his eyebrows slightly, but didn't bother to pay attention, and continued to deal with the remaining issues. Fang Quan returned to the Dark Palace, happily hugging the beauty to relax his body. After a full two hours of relaxation, the ghost soldiers came to report. Fang Quan let go of the panting and tired beauty, got out of bed, changed into casual clothes, and teleported into the hall. Ancient One was flipping through the books. When he saw him coming, he put down the books in his hand and pointed to the huge magic bookshelf full of books. These are the agreed remuneration. Fang Quan raised his eyebrows. Okay, not bad. Ancient One hesitated for a while, and added, the holy place is damaged, and there may be some different dimensional gods or demons invading Blue Star in the future. I hope you can pay attention to this point. Fang Quan was surprised. I pay attention. Shouldn't they pay attention? Ancient One looked at him speechlessly. Be careful not to crush some background gods or demons to death, causing even greater trouble. The eternal beholder Shumagoras has disappeared for tens of millions of years, but his his son Kuigos is still alive. Your act of devouring the beholder is very likely to provoke Kuigos. I definitely am not afraid of your problems. I am afraid that those gods or demons who meet you will be labeled as problems. Fang Quan's expression was quite disdainful. Then let Kui Jesse come, do you think I will care about this? Ancient One felt a pain in the head. You definitely don't care about this, but the war you caused will make me care. For example, this time, if she was not on the side to help stabilize the overall situation, Fang Quan's aftermath of the battle would be enough to turn half of the state into a lava world, causing political turmoil in the Eagle Kingdom, and triggering a series of chain reactions. Fang Quan sneered, could it be that Dormammu would not have come without me? Do you want to blame me who saved millions of people? Ancient One, you are more proficient at raising questions than I am. Seeing what Fang Quan said, what else could Ancient One say, and he could only take a deep breath, call me when you fight in the future, and I will be your support. Very well, in the face of this kind of irresponsible demon king, I can only work hard on myself, the sorcerer supreme Asgardian on the magic side. Fang Quan was happy. Okay, deal. Let Sorcerer Supreme support yourself, which is not cheap. Ancient One asked curiously, Aren't you the Demon King? How did you master the power of the Holy Sun Lord? Or, the power of the Sun God series backquote. The pure power of light scared Dormammu so much that he didn't dare to fight back, he only dared to use his life shield to save his life. There is also the final performance, grabbing Dormammu directly and rushing into the sun, and even staying comfortably at the critical point of gravity to watch Dormammu turn into a dark firework. If this is replaced by a strong man of other elemental systems, one must first kowtow to the sun and perform the corresponding elemental ceremony to have this ability. Fang Quan shrugged and sat on the dark throne, is it strange that I master this? Ancient One looked at him speechlessly, if you can master the power of the sun god series, you can call yourself the most authentic, purest, and most convincing title of righteous god among righteous gods, where is the scary demon king? Is it not good to be admired by all? Is it not good to be worshipped by all beings? Is it not good to let all things submit to your light? Fang Quan picked up an apple on the table and pouted his lips, I think the title of demon king is cooler. Ancient One, I've never been so speechless in my life. Ancient One was choked and had nothing to say, so he got up and left. When you encounter a powerful enemy, please be sure to let me know. I'm not worried about your safety, I'm afraid of some high-level people who are friendly to Blue Star Civilization as in crisis of extinction. Fang Quan is not only the King of Darkness, but also masters the powerful power of the Sun God, the Righteous God. 
There is hardly any enemy in the universe that can match him. The only thing that Ancient One is worried about is that those short-sighted guys will provoke Fang Quan, and then be beaten into an extinct crisis by Fang Quan's order. She is very aware of some things that have happened in the Dark Universe recently. Poor, Dormammu must not have noticed that in the corner of the galaxy occupied by his empire, in a corner called the Wilderness of the Galaxy, a force called the Shadow Empire is steadily marching to conquer the entire Dark Universe. When Dormammu noticed this problem, he probably felt remorseful. Just because he said something cheap, he provoked this Dark King. Hey, the power of the people of this Dark King Empire is countless times stronger than those in the Dark Universe. Ancient One laughed politely. Fang Quan was so happy and relaxed that he just waved his hand in return. Soon, Tony, Banner and others finally returned to the Dark Palace. Tony came in sweating profusely picked up the cup in front of Fang Quan very naturally, and drank the clear, water, inside. Tony took a sip and felt something was wrong, and when he smashed his mouth, he felt that the strength was really good, so he simply drank it all in one breath, then put down the glass, his face flushed slightly, and praised, this is really good wine, so that can the ninja pour me a glass of plain water? I just want to drink a sip of plain water right now. The ghostly soldiers standing on both sides of the hall were holding trays from the darkness, and the glasses above were filled with boiled water. Tony, Banner, Yin Sen and the others hurriedly picked up their water glasses and drank them all in one gulp. Fang Quan nod on an apple, what's wrong? Tony wiped the sweat from his forehead, what's the matter? Oh my god, dear Fang magician, you turned it into a magma world with a wave of your hand, and even several kilometers away, you can feel the terrifyingly high temperature. If it weren't for the ghost soldiers, we would have almost died of heat there. Banner also had fear remaining on his face. To be honest, Lord Demon King, I know you are powerful, but I didn't expect you to be able to change the entire sky with a single wave of your hand. Because of the aftermath of Fang Quan's battle, everything that happened in the mirror world can be seen by the world. All the onlookers were greatly shocked in their hearts. Everyone watched how Fang Quan showed off his strength. Yin Sen adjusted his glasses trembling slightly, aren't you the devil king? Why do you, know the power of the sun god? Everyone immediately quieted down and looked at Fang Quan in unison, expecting his answer in their eyes. God, that's the question they're most curious about. Lord Demon King actually has such a divine side, resisting the invasion of a powerful demon master, killing millions of people, and even saving the lives of billions of people. Fang Quan didn't bother to pay attention to their questions, rolled his eyes and continued to eat fruit. What a fuss, never seen the world. Is there any problem with me grasping the power of the righteous god? Sorcerer Supreme Dormammu has also mastered extremely profound dark power. My lord, Nick Fury, please see me. Fang Quan was surprised. What is he doing here? Let him in. He is ready to kill the gods. Ah no, the plan to kill the demons. Then I'm interested. Fang Quan got interested, sat up straight, and looked at the door curiously. Nick Fury walked in quickly, with a heavy face, and saluted, See Lord Demon King. Fang Quan female wonder, ready to kill me so soon. Interesting, tell it and see. Quote. Nick Fury smiled wryly. After seeing your majestic power heading straight into the sun, I don't think there is any combat power on the blue star that can catch your eyes. He has verified again from Tony and others that the god of war wearing the armor of the King of Light is Fang Quan. Now, he understood Fang Quan's fun better. This is the really invincible Mephista, who really does these things for fun. Fang Quan also really cares about whether he can come up with plans or enemies that threaten him. After all, when a puppy barks in front of you, it thinks it's threatening you. And you will only think that this puppy's milky barking is so cute. That's it the fun of Mephista. Fang Quan slumped in his sitting position, leaned on the chair, and said, it's boring. Hearing this sentence, Nick Fury looked a little nervous, and hurriedly said, there is one thing I want to report to you, and I want to talk to Mr. Tony. Fang Quan waved his hand boredly. Quote, the corner of Nick Fury's mouth twitched. The House of Representatives sent Tony an impeachment, and it will hold a meeting tomorrow morning. Moreover, you have also received relevant accusations, and you are required to come forward and explain the protection of the Absorber David. Fang Quan was startled. That person who is not afraid of death is so arrogant, how dare to impeach me? 
I just showed off my muscles, you tell me this. Are you blind or my low profile makes you think I'm a bully? Tony was also shocked. Are these guys in the Eagle Country House of Representatives all pig brains? Impeach Fang Quan and me. One is the dark king of super life that objectively protected the lives of millions of people, and the other is the chairman of Stark Corporation, a pillar industry of Eagle Country's military industry. Are these people crazy? Nick Fury looked embarrassed. Impeach Tony because of the steel battle suit. Impeach you. This is because so far, your information is at the highest level of confidentiality, and those people below don't know it. There is a stupid senator who didn't know that he found fragmented information from that corner and did this stupid thing. Hmm, he thought he was going to make a big contribution. Quote. Little did he know that he had caused a catastrophe. This kick is not considered to be kicking the steel plate. This is the torch kick to the Statue of Liberty. In short, this matter was very embarrassing, so embarrassing that he felt ashamed. Fang Quan smiled happily. Okay, this is interesting, I will definitely be there tomorrow, let me see what tricks they can play. Nick Fury is dumbfounded, anxious. Busily waved his hands. No, 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 I just want you to know that we will deal with this matter, and you will never encounter this kind of thing again. I'm here to make friends, not to find fault. Brother, brother, you can't do this. Fang Quan waved his hand indifferently. No, no, it's because you don't understand my fun. Arrange all of this, I'm going to appreciate it tomorrow. Nick Fury's scalp was so tight that he could only nod his head stiffly. Okay, I'll keep everything as it is. Do you need me to do anything of Wang Qian's? Fang Quan put a finger in front of his mouth, smiling kindly, what to do? No, you just need to do what you have to do. Nick Fury held his breath. The thing he wants to do most now is to shoot all these stupid senators who are dragging their feet. Lao Tzu is here to protect the national security of Eagle Country. These sharks are here to mess with me. Nick Fury took the order and left with a sigh. No, I have to do something in moderation and not really let them drive Eagle Country into the ditch. Nick Fury doesn't care about those senators at all, he only cares about the national security of Eagle Nation. Tony opened the smart panel speechlessly and checked the latest intelligence report. Well, I am the defendant, and you are the one who happened by the way. They didn't have clear evidence, just. I suspect that you have something to do with this matter, and feel that you may have sheltered the absorber David for a while. Single quote. Fang Quan's information has been set top secret by the Department of Homeland Security, and the confidential information that that idiot senator got is very limited. So limited that he didn't even know what kind of valley of existence Fang Quan was. How can a character who can make the entire eagle country shut up obediently and swallow the bitterness of 60,000 dead souls into his stomach? How could he, a foolish senator, try to provoke him? Exist. An emerald green light flashed in Fang Quan's eyes. No, I'm not interested in those current affairs. I'm just interested in everything that happened later. From then on, you've reached the next stage of metamorphosis. A stage. Quote, Tony put down the data panel in surprise, the next stage. I don't know what you're talking about, but I want to tell you one thing. Fang Quan turned off the prophecy magic and asked curiously, what's the matter? Tony held out his hand, and a flame ignited from his palm, I visited Kamar Taj and learned magic. Fang Quan opened his mouth wide, shocked, are you going to do it so soon? This is already a mature Iron Man, able to learn by himself. Tony shrugged. I spent a lot of money to hire a high-level magician with a PhD in launch mechanics, and I am helping to create a magic armor. Do you need it? This is much better than the Mark VI I promised you. Fang Quan smiled. Okay, you can give me a few sets when the time comes, and I will use them for collection. Tony is indeed a super genius. With his super high IQ, he does have a strong magical ability. In a certain universe, Tony took over the title of Sorcerer Supreme and became the Supreme Iron Man to protect the Blue Star Civilization. It's just that he didn't expect that his arrival would have such a big impact on him. Tony laughed. My dear friend, you will never regret my collection of armor. Tony knew very well in his heart, if it wasn't for Fang Quan Sake, those Kamar Taj holy place who made themselves so proud would never open up to him. Naturally, Ancient One opened up the research to Fang Quan for the sake of Fang Quan's face. Banner and the others looked at Tony in shock. 
Banner was dumbfounded. Magic. You actually mastered it. Is it difficult? There was pride and arrogance on Tony's face. It's not difficult, you can learn it after just a few glances. Banner was very surprised, and he became more determined. When I finish studying the mutant gene, I will also study. Fang Quan pointed directly at the magic bookshelf. Everything is here, you can see for yourself, I don't have any restrictions. Everyone was surprised and expressed their thanks one after another. After Banner and the others thanked them, they excitedly ran to the magic bookshelf to look through the books, hoping that they could also master magic. Tony waited for everyone to leave, then lowered his voice. Fang, what happened to the next level 1 section you just said? He had already felt itchy, but since everyone was here just now, he was too embarrassed to ask. Fang Quan said indifferently. Shield has a video file that your father left for you, and an arc reactor that can be used to build new elements. You get these, the combat power on the external level, the internal level the spiritual world has been greatly improved. In Howard's recorded video, the strict father expressed that his son was his greatest invention, which made Iron Man Tony's regrets from childhood to adulthood supplemented and became a more responsible person. And the super element that Howard left to him is to allow Iron Man to upgrade the core technology to a level, which has triggered a huge change in energy technology around the world. A gleam flashed in Fang Quan's eyes. In exchange, I can protect you. But you must do one thing. Tony was surprised. What's the matter? The world's second most handsome Lord Demon King, you can just say it straight, I owe you a lot of favors. Fang Quan smiled. Don't hand over the core technology of steel armor, don't hand over the latest technology of micro arc reactor technology. Tony was at a loss. I'm sure I don't want to hand it over, but what's your reason for doing so? Fang Quan did not explain the reason, but said lightly, I need you to build the arc nuclear reactor for me for free. Tony smiled happily. That's perfectly fine, my dear friend, you can just say it directly next time. Fang Quan stroked his chin. I mean, I want to use your new armor to form a steel shadow army. The biggest disadvantage of the shadow fighters is that their defense is not good, and when they are taken out, their image is not so cool. Fang Quan wants to create a guard of honor with face and integrity. Tony's smile froze completely. Walter, if you want one or two, or even six or seven, I can finish it. Is it too much for you to ask me to build you an army of steel shadows? Brother Ni in the cotton field dare not be used like this. Fang Quan shrugged. You say you are willing. The corners of Tony's mouth twitched. I can only say that I can use my spare time to build for you. The biggest difficulty in this problem is not money, but some rare resources that need time to collect. Fang Quan shrugged and said it didn't matter. Success, you remember to find the leader to hand over. Tony was speechless, what he just promised was too fast. I should remember one thing. If Fang Quan can say something politely, it often means that I can't refuse and this matter is extremely outrageous. Create a black shadow steel army, look, is it human? Do you know how long it takes me to craft an armor of steel? Fang Quan whistled, ignoring Tony's sad expression. Time soon came to the second day, the largest court in New York. Today's protagonist is Tony, who is sitting in the defendant's seat. Fang Quan happily sat on the sidelines, eating melon seeds and watching the play. Banner and the others also came to eat melons one after another, sitting behind Fang Quan one by one, wanting to see if it was the short-sighted guy who came to seek death. Behind them, a group of reporters kept their cameras on and took pictures from time to time. Some eager reporters kept asking Tony questions. Tony smiled heartily, turned his head to say yes to the reporters behind him from time to time, and occasionally pulled Fang Quan to turn around and say yes to the reporters behind him. While he was smiling brightly, he and Fang Quan were also commenting on a reporter with a hot body. Fang Quan swept his eyes, and saw acquaintances on the side seats, General Ross, Phil Coulson, Ancient One. Good guy, there are quite a few acquaintances. Tony followed Fang Quan's line of sight, and sure enough, he saw an acquaintance on the remote seat on the side, slightly surprised, what are they doing here? Fang Quan, I don't know what other people want to do, but Ancient One must want to see if I will go on a killing spree and kill all these people. Tony's smile froze slightly. Fang Magician, you are not joking. Fang Quan watched the beautiful reporter with him, with a gentle smile, I never joke. At this moment, 
in the back passage of the court. Nick Fury was standing in front of Senator Washington, his face was heavy, I don't care who ordered you, after you go in later, no matter what happens, don't provoke that man named Fang Quan. Senator Laden sneered. Nick Director Nick Fury, please correct your attitude, this is a court for homeland security. Nick Fury smiled angrily, and waved to the close agent beside him, come here. The agent directly pulled out the gun and pressed it against Senator Laden's temple. Senator Laden's face changed drastically. Director Nick, what do you mean? Nick Fury's one-eyed stare coldly at this hopelessly stupid guy, you think I'm negotiating with you. Your current behavior has just affected the security of the country, and you have no idea that the king you are about to offend just how powerful it is. Laden, your actions have threatened the security of the homeland. I have the right to shoot you directly now, and the president will not say a word for you. Quote. Senator Laden swallowed. Okay, I think I understand what you mean now, don't mess with that man named Fang Quan, right? That's the guy sitting next to Tony that distinguished guest. Nick Fury's face softened slightly. To be honest, even if you provoke him, my worries won't be that serious. After all, he's just going to kill everyone in your family. Quote. After Nick Fury finished speaking, he directly led the agent to the front, not bothering to pay attention to this stupid senator. If this guy's ability is two levels stronger, he should know how high the threat level marked in the data will be. Apart from a certain eastern country, this Dark King is one of the few Mephistas who can directly turn the entire Eagle Kingdom into a hell on earth. Provoking this, it's really courting death, Senator Laden watched dumbfounded as Nick Fury just walked away. Walter, did you step on a big thunder? Fang Quan, an Oriental. An Oriental dare to be arrogant on the land of our Eagle Country. Senator Laden was angry on the surface, but his eyes were extraordinarily clear, and he finally chose to calm down. Life, after all, is the most important thing. Senator Laden straightened his instrument, took a deep breath, and began CBCC to take the stage. In the courtroom, on the side seats, General Ross looked at Nick Fury who had just sat down, why are you here? Nick Fury deadpanned. I'm here to protect Eagle Nation from being led into a ditch by a bunch of idiots, what about you? General Ross raised his arm and pointed to the window of the court. I will personally be responsible for giving the order to the sniper, so that the interests of the Eagle Kingdom will not be led into the ditch by a fool. Nick Fury's eyelids twitched, and he scanned the roof opposite the window, and saw an excellent sniper position, okay, dot are you sure? Why is your style of doing things harder than mine? General Ross's tone was calm. I don't like Fang Quan's protection of David, but I'm not uncommon. We ordinary humans are not qualified to provoke this Mephista yet. Ancient One happily ate melons behind them, and nodded in agreement, indeed. If Fang Quan is provoked, I believe this senator's family will be wiped out. When Ancient One spoke, Ross and Nick Fury were startled, turned around hastily, and saw this familiar face. Meet the Sorcerer Supreme. Ancient One waved his hand. You don't need to be so polite, I just came here low-key, to see if Fang Quan will kill tens of thousands of people. By the way, let me declare that I am only responsible for protecting the overall interests. If he goes on a killing spree and kills hundreds of thousands of you, I won't bat an eyelid, I'm from the East. Quote. General Ross and Nick Fury fell silent, they could only laugh dryly, and then perfunctory. Well, Sorcerer Supreme is not necessarily reliable, you still have to rely on yourself. Soon, the court began. In court, Senator Laden took the lead, condemning Tony with seemingly polite but extremely sharp words, only for his own interests, regardless of national interests, and should hand over the steel armor to the country. This trick of oppressing people and moral kidnapping is a perfect match, if it were an ordinary person, they might succumb. Tony is different. Tony directly released the scandal of Senator Laden, and then curiously asked him why there are some discrepancies in the tax accounts here. Does the tax bureau need to investigate? Senator Laden was so angry that he couldn't speak, his face was ashen. Tony's move wasn't fatal, but it was enough to make him suffer for a while. However, this is not the most important thing. Most importantly, Tony let everyone see how terrifying his intelligence ability really is. This time it's a tax account, what about next time? Senator Laden's tone was slightly softer and three-pointed. Mr. Tony, do you think that you can maximize the power of the iron armor by yourself, 
which is better than leaving it to the country to let the country control and use it. Next, there is a long wrangling. Fang Quan yawned and wondered why this guy didn't spray me. Fang Quan thought for a while, stretched out his hand to hold Tony down and replied cheerfully, Hey, why don't you ask me if I'm threatening national security? Senator Laden was sweating slightly on his forehead, and his eyes unconsciously looked at the people in casual clothes on the side seats. On the seat on the left, General Ross and others sat. On the right side, on the seat, General Byrd and several heavyweights sat. He originally wanted to pretend he didn't see it, and confuse the matter, but now that Fang Quan brought it up, he could only deal with it desperately. Sir, our theme this time is the ownership of steel armor, and you are not included in the theme of this meeting. Senator Laden's words fell, and the atmosphere in the courtroom changed. The reporters smelled something different, and keenly sensed that there was a lot of melons to be tapped. General Byrd and the other senators who came to observe in civilian clothes looked at each other, with doubts and surprises flashing in their eyes. It seems that this young man named Fang Quan has a not simple background, and he was able to make Laden flustered, and even changed his words in court. Well, this is kicking the iron plate. They quickly figured out the logic in it, and they all felt that things were getting tricky. Now, it is not Senator Laden who is attacking Fang Quan and Tony, but this Mr. Fang Quan is asking for guilt. The taste of a bloodbath began to spread in the nostrils of General Byrd and several senators who were in attendance. Their faces became serious, and they all sat upright, aware of the imminent disaster. Fang Quan smiled, keenly feeling that this Senator Laden should have received a warning from some people. However, this is not important. I like to have fun. Fang Quan directly put his two legs on the table, held the back of his head with his hands, and looked at the reporter's cameras with a satisfied face, and said words that shocked the world. Didn't you find out the evidence that I covered David, the 60,000 massacre absorber? Why don't you show it now? This is the best evidence to attack me and Tony. Senator Laden's face turned pale, and he instantly knew what mistake he had made. The information I found was that Fang Quan had sheltered the absorber David. And Fang Quan and Tony have a social relationship. I originally wanted to use this to attack Tony. But now things are getting bigger. Because what Fang Quan said now means that he has, always, been covering up the absorber David. The weight suddenly changed. The potential line is, Fang Quan can make the entire Eagle Country executives shut up, let them swallow this shame and humiliation obediently and dare not say anything more. Now, Fang Quan's ability to speak out in public proves one more thing. He can shut up Yinguo once, and he can shut up Yinguo a second time. Senator Laden explained with a pale face, Sir, I don't know what you are talking about, our theme this time is the issue of steel battle suits and my taxes. The only thing he can do now is to attract everyone's attention, even if the reporters attack him. Combined with his previous experience, he knew that he had provoked an existence that he absolutely should not have provoked. Fang Quan smiled and snapped his fingers. David, stand up. Absorber David took off his hat and stood up from the second row. He had an old face, but his eyes were extraordinarily energetic, and he was full of energy. Senator Laden's lips began to turn white at this moment, and he clearly realized how much crime he had stabbed. No matter what the outcome of this matter is, I will definitely be finished. This matter was brought up on the stage, which completely deepened the conflict between myself and Tony. Even if Tony would not target himself, his company's interests would try their best to kill him, proving to everyone that the Stark group is not vegetarian. Senator Laden's pupils trembled slightly. Sir, I don't know who this is, please don't disturb the court. General Byrd looked at General Ross on the side seat in the distance, and saw this colleague who had worked with him for decades sitting silently on a chair at the moment, looking at Senator Laden with a heavy face. There was murderous intent in his eyes. General Byrd sighed helplessly, turned his head, and stood up, let's go, Senator Laden is finished. Sitting next to General Ross is Nick Fury, and sitting next to Nick Fury is a level 9 agent. At this moment, the level 9 agent was asking Nick Fury whether he wanted to kill Senator Laden on the spot. General Byrd knew that the water inside was very deep, but he never expected it to be this deep. He got up and left in a low-key manner, not wanting to play the water at all. The 60,000 souls belonged to Ross, but now, Ross wanted to kill Senator Laden who wanted to uncover the matter. 
This abnormal performance has explained many problems. The remaining senators who participated in a low-key manner looked at each other in blank dismay, and two or three also pretended to be calm and left. General Byrd is not willing to participate in things, and a few of them will easily die if they get involved. There was only one old man with slightly withered facial muscles who was unwilling to leave, and his eyes were bright, you are still young, and I am already dying. I want to see how this young man dares to trample on the face of our eagle nation. General Byrd stopped, looked at the old man, and saluted respectfully, Senator Bart, I pay my respects to you, and may God bless you. The rest of the senators also saluted one after another, and then left quickly, unwilling to stay any longer. The reporters looked at the absorber David who stood up, and hurriedly turned the camera on his face, shouting. It's him, he's the guy on TV a while ago. 60,000 people died in vain. There is no follow-up. These people only know how to embezzle our taxpayers' money, and they don't do business at all. Everyone was shocked, they never expected that the number one most wanted criminal in Eagle Country would dare to show up in public, and even stood with the latest popular superhero Iron Man. Reporters keenly smell the big news. Tony looked at the cozy Fang Quan beside him speechlessly. Lawton dare not say anything, he must have been warned by the high-level members of the Eagle Kingdom. What are you doing? Fang Quan smiled softly. Ten rings offended me, and now all members are repenting in hell. The immortal Dormammu offended me, I threw him into the sun to feel warm. Do you think I am a person who likes to let things go? Such a lowly soul deserves to talk to me about the price. If you were replaced by a soldier with firm belief and noble soul like General Ross, I would be more than willing to take a second look and even give him some face. Lawton, what the heck? Senator Lawton was at the head of the trial seat, his face was already pale, and he could only bite the bullet and continue doing what he was supposed to do. This is the best way to protect himself at present, Mr. Fang Quan, what are you doing? You are challenging the national dignity of Eagle Country, you are challenging the dignity of the most powerful country on this planet. Now I can only pray for my hard-working performance in exchange for the protection of high-level officials. This is my only chance to survive now. If he confessed to Fang Quan, then he was really doomed. Fang Quan was too lazy to play around, and said with a smirk, Yes, yes, I am just challenging, Mr. Hydra. Senator Lawton's pupils trembled, and he stood up in shock. No, I don't know what you're talking about. Fang Quan snapped his fingers. Grab him. Whoosh whoosh. Three ghost soldiers emerged from his side, and pressed the mortal's face on the table in an instant, and one ghost soldier even drew out his sword, waiting for the order of the Dark King to behead him. Fang Quan stood up and smiled brightly at everyone. Everyone from Eagle Country. I am kind enough to invite you to enjoy a huge scandal in the political circles of Eagle Country, and unbutton Senator Lawton's pants for me. Nick Fury covered his face and sat on the seat. Fack. Grass. These idiots are really stupid to the extreme. The Hydra gang. Who are you provoking? You are provoking the Dark Lord. Court death. Nick Fury never expected that things would turn out like this. Sometimes, it's really not that S.H.I.E.L.D. is awesome, but it's all set off by peers. If he hadn't seen it with his own eyes, Nick Fury would never have imagined that Hydra, which has been passed down for hundreds of years, would lead to such a catastrophe. Amid the exclamation of the crowd, Senator Lawton's pants were taken off, and his big buttocks were lifted up to point at the cameras of important national media, with a Hydra mark printed on his big buttocks. The shutter was pressed into a symphony, and the reporters asked Fang Quan all kinds of questions like crazy. Fang Quan stretched out a finger and put it in front of his mouth, exuding coercion and smiling kindly. Inside, invisible, everyone present felt a powerful aura emanating from this young man like a mountain pressing down on all of them. Fang Quan said with a gentle smile, Absorbing David is a tragedy of a biochemical research project, a plan launched by some high-level officials in order to achieve longevity and surpass the power of ordinary people. It caused his wife and family to be broken up, and he was imprisoned for decades. He was more fortunate to have my appreciation and is now in my name. So, those guys who try to attract people, you can challenge me, I will bestow eternal death on you. Fang Quan tilted his head, and showed a kind smile again. Hydra is an evil organization that has been passed down from the Natui organization to this day. Now, they have infiltrated many key departments of the Eagle Kingdom. 
Definitely, that's not what I'm trying to say. What I'm trying to say is, Hydra, circles will kill you. Fang Quan snorted in disdain, directly tore through the space, and returned to the Dark Palace. And Senator Laden on the table was beheaded by ghost soldiers directly, and blood spattered all over the ground. Screams immediately filled the entire hall. Tony sighed and said that Fang Quan, the devil of fun, is the real six. See, if this wave of things happens, the situation in Eagle Country will be rewritten. Some ghost soldiers came out of the shadows, holding sharp knives and staring coldly at some people present. Swipe, swipe, some hidden Hydra members were directly killed. Some people with their own weapons wanted to resist, and shot the ghost soldiers, making a gap. The wounded ghost soldier continued to walk towards the shooter expressionlessly, and the gash on his body healed at a speed visible to the naked eye. Tony raised his forehead. Okay, that's the upgrade. General Ross sat on the seat and looked at Nick Fury with an ugly face. He is from Hydra, don't you know? If it weren't for this Dark King's insight, half of the high-level senators in the Eagle Kingdom would be blamed. Nick Fury was speechless. To be honest, if I knew he was Hydra, I wouldn't try to persuade him at all, I would even encourage him. General Ross watched these ghost soldiers killing people, and then saw Nick Fury sitting on a mountain, aren't you going to solve this situation? Nick Fury looked very calm. Do you believe it or not, you can see the mark of Hydra when you peel off these decedents' clothes. We have already lost enough face, there is no need to uncover another layer. Quote. The Dark Lord is strong, and so are his warriors. According to previous video data, these immortal fighters have extremely strong fighting qualities. Those who should be killed, none of them will be killed by mistake. People who shouldn't be killed, they don't even meet at a glance. Nick Fury got up and walked away without looking. Ancient One was surprised, scanned it with mental power, and nodded helplessly. He is right, these people do have the mark of Hydra on their bodies. How many millennia did it take this guy who is so strong to gather so many fighters with extremely high fighting qualities? I'm really envious, General Ross. Well, it's another hundred miles away from seeking justice for the 60,000 dead souls. There was noise in the hall, some people fell in a pool of blood, but more people were screaming and fleeing here. And the black shadow soldiers came out from the darkness one after another, starting from here, spreading to the surroundings, looking for any members related to Hydra, and beheading them. At this moment, the outside world was dumbfounded by Fang Quan's manipulation show. Eagle Country executives were shocked by the live broadcast and quickly participated in the online meeting. Soon, all the senators came online, and one of the positions was vacant. The president is also online, his face livid with anger. Who can tell me, who is going to provoke this super strong man who has lived for an unknown number of years, controls a dark empire, and lives in the suburbs of California with a low profile? The senators quickly exchanged glances with their friends and enemies, feeling the seriousness of the matter. The most serious thing now is not the Eagle Nation's face, but the president's condemnation of Senator Lawton who was beheaded in public. One senator kindly reminded, Mr. President, Senator Lawton has been beheaded by this Mr. Fang Quan's ninja minions. Dot and his minions look a lot like mutant. Our attitude towards mutant, the president stared, wishing to stare at this guy who knew he was being stupid, mutant. Didn't you see the video of the concert incident more than 100 kilometers away in California yesterday? He personally crippled an alien leader who had invaded Blue Star, grabbed the enemy's neck and flew towards the sun. Are you blind? He is that god. The senators shut up one after another, their faces were heavy, and they clearly felt that a catastrophe was imminent. Due to the rush of time and certain blockade agreements, they only knew a little about the concert incident. They really didn't know that the strong man who resembled a god was actually Fang Quan who was impeached today. The president was so angry that he had nothing to say, do you think I turned a blind eye? Wrong, they turned a blind eye and didn't want to pay attention to us stupid, short-lived mortals. But, today, because of Hydra idiots, because of you ignorant and stupid people who can't do things with money and only know how to fight politically, you provoked this god with eternal lifespan. Within three days, take out the heads of Hydra executives and place them in front of others. Stop this farce. Idiots. A bunch of idiots. An existence that can physically cross the starry sky, face the sun, and have eternal life. How dare you provoke me? Point zero zero. 
The president was so angry that he cursed and compared these senators to uninformed pigs waiting to die in a slaughterhouse. The president scolded in one breath. It took 20 minutes before he stopped talking, with a gloomy face, end this farce as soon as possible. We can end the war in the Commonwealth of Germany, and we can clean up these residues. Can't do anything. The president looked around coldly. If you can't do it, just wait for the wrath of this god. After finishing speaking, the president didn't even bother to talk about the report, so he hung up and went offline. The senators looked at each other, feeling that something was out of the question. In the blink of an eye, a god appeared facing the sun. Can someone post information about the concert? Senators with military backgrounds silently uploaded the video. Yesterday, some journalists attempted to broadcast live in vain, but under the pressure of the government, they could only disseminate fragments in a non-governmental manner, without official approval. If this kind of video is released, the current situation in the whole world will be in turmoil. But now it seems that everything is too late. The biggest problem now is not to control the influence, but how to satisfy this super powerhouse. The video material of the concert was clicked on, and the high-level executives of Yinguo who were present gasped and watched. The first shot was taken from a distance, and there were pieces of pale cold light flowing on the ground of the whole concert, undead burst out of the ground one by one, and pale bones appeared one after another. In the palm of his hand, the head with cold white bone fire makes people feel chills in the bottom of their hearts. The camera gradually approached and captured the situation in the middle of the concert. The young man who was impeached, that is, Fang Quan, was smiling kindly, holding a struggling skeleton wearing a gorgeous magician robe and a pale white crown on his head. The skeleton screamed and wailed, reaching the sky, and there were obviously more powerful undead skeletons on the ground around it, but when it got close to Fang Quan, its whole body turned into a... Bai Bai Chen was blown away by Quan Wei. The faces of the senators changed dramatically. Didn't expect this scene at all. Dot 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 dot. Is this not a joke? Do the undead really exist? If you doubt it, you can go to this town a hundred kilometers away in California to see where it has become a barren magma zone. If it weren't for the man behind this god. With this strong man's action, the climate near California has to be permanently changed to a high temperature environment. Quote. The person who raised the question obediently shut up. The video continued to play and the next scene was the well-known sky mutation, followed by the super demon who smashed the sky descending on Blue Star, and was unilaterally hanged by Fang Quan. Every next frame of the picture is challenging the tolerance of everyone present. Sister Yu created another world with a wave of her hand. Everyone can still see their activities, but they can also clearly see that this is a world separated by a layer of invisible glass. Another world. In this, mirror world, this god unilaterally hangs and beats these demon-like superpowers. The eyes emit laser light similar to the sun and thunder, turning the entire, mirror world, into a magma world. The sound of gasping for air kept ringing out in the online meeting. I hope everyone will support it and subscribe more.